Yeah, hey there, I do this. Never fear losing. And when I get up in the game, you're up here and prove A real problem, but I solve them all facts proof. And if you think I'm going to fold, then you talking fool. Yeah, y'all want to win, let me spin, boy. I dunks inside, I'm super fly like I'm hanging off the rim, boy. I've been winning for my kinfo. And I put on for my city from the intro. Let's go. that time in. My pride is out the roof, I get that grinding. So I'ma tell the truth, I get my grind on. You know the pressure make all of these diamonds. I tell them get back, step back, fast track, big lap, big facts. I'm past that, yeah. I'm trying to get ahead, get out the way. Now move forward, stand back, now break away. I'm about to bring it up. I ain't never back.
Welcome to Soup Fighter. Hey, Doom. Welcome back. Hey, Doom. It's been a bit. It's been a little bit. Welcome back. To <laughs> hey, y'all doing? Thanks for tuning in. Welcome back. I've been gone for a million years, but I return to fight some concrete. Hope you're doing good. Hope you had a good last week, y'all. Um, let me just, just fade that out. I did consider starting stream with Guile's theme. You're welcome, I didn't. Hey! Oh, uh, thanks for all the three slips and everything. Thank you. Hello. Hello. I'm old! Who is this? I don't know. I don't... I wish I knew. I wish. Um, honestly, honestly, I am considering just keeping the jams going, because this is just gonna loop on this demo forever, unless I just... Open the menu. Hello! What year is it? I don't know. 2019, right? Hey, thank you. But that's a lot of bit. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I was gone at SGDQ last week. Uh, it was a great time. Um, fun. Good times. I'm back in town. The boys are back in town. Blah! Not the full game. Huh? What? The demo screen. Oh, no. Yeah, I just meant... I Yeah, no. The demo screen. This is the full game. Uh... <coughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, we were at uh, SGDQ, and uh, uh, it was our first time back, ba Bath and I, back in person there since 2019, because we went to our first ever GDQ. If you're not familiar, GDQ's Games Done Quick. It's a big speed-running charity marathon. Runs a week long. They have the two main events, Awesome Games Done Quick in January, and Summer Games Done Quick, which is normally summer, or late May. It was pretty early this year. Um, but we went in 2019 for the first time ever, and had a great time. We're like, we went awesome. Let's go back every year. And that was 2019, and then nothing happened next year, and it was great. But we went back. And we went back in part because Bath ran, was a speedrunner, run, physically running um, at GDQ. So for those of you who might have missed it, um, go, go go look up. Well, thank you. Well, like, wiggle in the leg. Um, go look up the golf it run at GDQ. What happened in 2020? Nothing of note uh animal crossing came out um oh i think i had a great time that's a lot thank you for the hype thank you well i'm glad oh that's it right there. there you go go watch it go watch it and come back and watch me be bad street fighter uh it was great um it was it was i was on the couch the the commentary armchair along with mech analyst tom friend of the show oh i watched those amazing thank you we met robert frost we fought in the parking lot afterwards it was a good time um, a lot of fun was had, and, uh, I really had a lot of fun doing it. Um, and, and after watching GDQ for so many years, it was an honor and a privilege for Bath and Nicole to gaslight me on stage on the big GDQ stage. It was fun. Um, I was there. You were there, Tom. It was you. You. How was the fit fight, fist fight with Robert Frost Estate? Um, uh, due to legal court proceedings, I can't talk about it at this time, but... Only one more gift to a hundred. Oh my goodness, thank you. That is wildly generous. Uh, thank you all. Um, it was fun. Yes, but yeah, it, it was uh, uh, about 4.30 a.m. was when the, the, the run started. So if you haven't watched it, just go into it knowing that it was extremely late at night. <laughs> and um, I'm proud of us because A, we didn't get banned from the event. And B, nobody swore. Um, so, in fact, the closest anyone came to swearing was, um, Nicole almost swore. If you go back and rewatch the VOD, once again, of Golf It, SGDQ 2023, um, it's one little clip of the golf run. Oh, okay. All right, watch this real quick. Um, no, ball stuff is fine. We, we said ball stuff all day. <laughs> um, the closest, and I didn't catch it during the run. It was only afterwards when we were all talking about it, uh, and coming down from the adrenaline high was, um... The fact that we managed not to swear, I know. Well, we did a couple practices at the event. Uh, all of us got together, and, and we, we kind of got some of it out of the way ahead of time. But it was like, it was so, so late at night. I was like, someone's going to slip. But no one slipped up. But what I didn't know, and if you rewatch the VOD and, and look out for it, you'll see it, is uh, there was, you know, there's donations that come out during the event. It's a charity event. Uh, the summer one is always for Doctors Without Borders. And um, during... Um, the run, there's breaks to read out some messages from donations. I donated and I didn't get my donation read. It's 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 fine. But I'm just glad that like Gam and Shiv and a couple other people that we know had donations read, which is awesome. But um I donate to support the charity, not to have it read 
But I did say in my donation message, greetings from Couch Mini, because I donated from the couch before I before I started. But um, the one of the one of the donation messages was trans rights, and Nicole almost said, "Fuck yeah, trans rights," and she caught herself. And if you rewatch it, you can see the moment she mouths the, and then brings it back in and goes, "Yeah, yeah, trans rights," and um, real proud of her. <laughs> but. But of all the things to swear about, it's like hilarious that that's almost the thing. Cause it's a PG event. You're not supposed to swear. We kind of we had some euphemisms in there, talking about balls and stuff. It's golf, you know. But yeah, it was great. <laughs> Say fuck for a good cause. It's for a good cause. Yeah. So, I don't know about that one, Rose. But yeah, consummate professional. Yeah, all professionals. It was great. Cause you know, from where I was sitting behind Bath and Nicole, I couldn't see, you know, her just. But watching it back was. Hilarious. Anyway, um, they skip Pete's Tower sewer level. Deal. Yeah, greetings from Fuck Island. We say fuck for charity. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna start our own charity marathon. We're the only we we every time we say fuck, we give a dollar. Um, but anyway, yeah, it was great. I I really enjoyed being back at GDQ. We had watched a lot of runs. Um, I've talked about it before that when we went in 2019, we really didn't know anyone except for Tom. Uh, we met up with Tom in 2019. It was great. Uh, and we met a ton of people like Nicole. Um, but, oh yeah, thank you. Well, what Bath said there, yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah, like, um, <laughs> swear jar, yeah. I feel like that would incentivize people to swear more, so that's probably why they don't do it. But, yeah, it was great to, to be, um, to back there. But it's like, in 2019, we met all these people, and to go this year was like, we actually are going there, planning on meeting up with people that we met in 2019. It was, it was, it was nice to be back in person. So my favorite runs, so it's it's funny because it was true in 2019 as well, but I feel like attending it in person, I end up watching fewer runs than when I'm home. Like if I take time off to watch GDQ from home and just sit on the couch and, and watch runs, I'll catch way more. So what I did catch was very fun. Um, definitely, I mean, the, the Mario Maker runs, the races are always fun. Um, uh, Majora's Mask Randomizer. Uh, Paper Mario was a good time. Um, shit, what was... There were a couple that... God, my brain just went empty. Did I, I did not catch Hitman. I really want to catch the Hitman VOD. I didn't catch Breath of the Wild blindfolded. I was I was trying to stay up <laughs> to watch the finale, which the, the marathon ended at like 6 a.m. or something. I only made it through through uh, the Mario Maker relay race, and then I was just like out. Um, but... Yeah, when I was there in person... Oh my god, Titanfall 2 was great. Oh, we were in the room for um, Overcooked, which that was the run that started the chef meme. And then Ratatouille, I heard the Ratatouille run was amazing. I still have to catch the thought of that. Um, Ratatouille kind of blew up the Yes Chef meme for GDQ. But Overcooked, not only was it a really fun run, but uh, they got a world record, which is always really cool. I passed that Ryan Breath one on next. I, yeah, I want to watch Super Metroid Co-op. Um, what was that? Was that the one? Wait, no, I'm thinking of a different one. That was uh, uh, two players, one controller. Was that Super Metroid? What was that? It was so good. He was great. Event world records are surprised. Yeah. Especially because Overcooked, uh, uh, one of the runners was like, don't tell me. Yeah, Mega Man Maker. That was really cool, too. Um, They're like, don't tell me what the time is, but the world record is like 54 minutes. And they got like a 40-something. I forget what the exact times were, but they were like almost five minutes world record, which is just nuts. Uh, one player, four controls. Nuts. Yeah. Very good. Um, I'm trying to think what else. I don't know. It, it's, it's literally a 24-7 event. So <laughs> after every GDQ, it's just like, Time to look up every single list of like runs to catch, but um chat's doing I hope chat's doing good today. World Tour battles are very laggy. PS5 is performance mode. I have the performance mode on. So I played the demo of this. Cause I was like, I don't know, I'm I'm I've never been a big uh, fighting game guy. Um but as a kid, you know, going to an arcade with friends, sure. But we were all just kind of button mashing. And as soon as competence rose above button mashing, I was just like, I'm outpaced. So I've never really got super into to fighting games and not really into the FGC either. Um, I've always just admired it from afar and just been like, eh, it doesn't seem really accessible to me. But I played the demo of this and was like, this is really fun. And it, I actually was really enjoying it. And it's just shenanigans. Um, I, I made Kiryu just because I was fiddling with the character creator and ended up making a guy that kind of looked like Kiryu and I just leaned into it. Um, and yeah, I, in the demo, I think it was locked to the resolution mode. Um, but yeah, I, I did switch it over performance in this just to make sure. Um, and I did, 
Uh, when I booted up the full game, they're like, do you want to import your avatar from the demo? And I went, yes. But I don't know if it... I want to start over from the beginning, because there's, like, cutscenes and plot and stuff and introductions, so... Hopefully there's an option to do that on stream. Otherwise, it's going to drop me in wherever the demo ends. Um, we'll see. Who's my favorite SF character? I mean, in terms of... Oh, shit. I mean, so the, the Street Fighter I ever played the most was probably Street Fighter 2 Turbo. So it's like that cast, which is like, I don't know. It makes me feel like like a Pokemon Gen 1-er to be like the Street Fighter 2 characters. Look at that. The, the, I know them. Um, my tag name is me. I bet I'm a Guile player. So I, 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 I'm such a normie with this game. I always played Ryu because I knew how to throw, throw out Hadoukens. And that was about all I knew. And I would accidentally throw out a Shoryuken. And then the demo, the only characters you could play as were Ryu and Luke. So those were the guys that I, I spent the most time with. So, I mean, I'll, I'll see. I, I plan on basically doing World Tour on stream. I don't know if I'll do the whole thing or not. It depends on if Chad's into it for more than 10 minutes. But um, definitely E Honda guy. I mean, I do like his mash. Good mashes. Chun Li's my girl since fifth grade. They're just they're just great. Um, you are a Pokemon Chad. I know. I'm not. I'm not saying I'm not. I'm saying I'm not. Yeah, Luke. Yeah, Luke. Yeah, Luke. I didn't even make that connection. Can you make a Luke Triton? Thank you. I really appreciate Big Fat Smork. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't recall from the character creator if you can make a child. Probably not. <laughs> but it would be hilarious to make a little Victorian boy, <laughs> name him Luke, and then just get him, just give him the worst stats, all the worst moves, especially he just kind of starts coughing, and uh, then anyone can just run over and pff, clock him and take him out one hit. Like, can I give them reduced vitality? Is that an option? Or, or yeah, yeah, give him Luke's head, but on like a giant muscular body. That's also good. I'll take him out, Professor. You can make your character small like a child. Oh my God. I'm glad this game actually makes an effort to lower the skill floor. That's the thing is, um, this game has three control schemes. It has classic, which is the standard, like to do a Hadouken, you quarter circle forward and hit punch and you throw a Hadouken. But then there's the modern control scheme, which is like you press a button to do a special move. You don't have to input the command yourself. Uh, and in the demo, the single player world tour mode only lets you use modern. I was practicing with classic because I was like, I want to learn the combos and stuff. I want to I want to try to get into it. Um, but they locked you into modern in world tour, at least at the beginning. So well, we'll see. But there's like a whole debate going on because because modern definitely lowers the skill floor considerably. But it seems like on the higher tiers, Classic still wins out because there's things you can't do with the modern controls, but I might I might miss around with both But then there's a third mode. I forgot what it's called But it's basically like you tap a button and do a bunch Raise of stuff, a glass to the which Nintendo, is really cool It does less damage Telling the story of its body it has for mega Dynamic, thank you the expansion pack. Appreciate it, thank you. Yeah, dynamic is the third type which I haven't even touched but that sounds like party game mode of just like give the younger sibling a controller they can tap buttons and actually do stuff which is awesome that's a really cool idea um but i don't think you can go online with dynamic but it's meant for like local play which is awesome really smart idea um change styles them yeah i might i might mess with modern i don't know i don't know i i think it's fascinating um and and again makes this game more uh, more impressive but yeah so the, the the three main modes world tour is the single player which i'll be doing which has like cutscenes and plot and is a yakuza game apparently uh, Battle Hub is the online stuff. It wasn't in the demo. I don't know. And Fighting Ground is like a bunch of different fighting game modes and tutorials and stuff. So it's good. Um, but yeah. Keep dying in Iron. Ooh. Can you not play Modern Online? No, you can play Modern Online. I'm assuming it tells you who, if your opponent's using Modern or Classic. Dynamic. The one where you like tap a button and that makes you move forward into a combo. That's local only. That's not available online. So yeah. Modern Classic. Whoa, Martins. Thank you. Modern is easier to navigate. Yes, modern is much more approachable and accessible. Practice training combo practice later. Yeah, that's what I was messing with in the demo. And the, it's, it's a, again, as someone who's... I'm not new to fighting games. I'm just new to caring about fighting games, I guess. I mean, I added a tag to the stream that, that says bad at fighting games. I want to make it clear for anyone who clicks on the stream, like, don't expect me to be good at this. I'm here to mess around and have fun. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, I just... Uh, I, I was messing around, and the, the tutorials are exactly what I would want for a uh, a fighting game. And it's I 
Again, I'm sure that a lot of this is pretty standard for like any kind of modern Mortal Kombat or Tekken or, or Guilty Gear, or what have you, but it's like a lot of interactive tutorials. Because I remember back in the day, it was either there's no tutorial or maybe there's like a thing where you can just like punching bag against the, an AI uh, that doesn't fight back. But it's like, not only do they go step by step and break down high level concepts down to granular, here's how to do every combo, whatever, but it gets into like, here's how to play this character. It's like, this character is good in sort of a medium range and here's what you can do in these contexts and here's some combos you can do. And then getting into, here's actually the button prompts. And there's also a frame meter where, I mean, I could probably just, probably quicker just load it up. Um, but uh, is it a practice? Is it training? I don't even, I don't even, probably training, right? Tra yes, yes, maybe. Button prompts, do a character guide. I mean, I don't know what the hell, hey, this is, uh, the training room. It just, just, it doesn't matter. Get him in there. That's fine. Um, but it shows you on, literally, the game's running at 60 frames per second, and it shows you per frame. Also, whoa, whoa, whoa. I love that. Um, so that's on the left. How do I bring up the actual uh, text? He's pogging. He's pogging. Simple training sessions. Feeling, feeling overwhelmed? No! No, I'm good. Uh, ooh. Oh. Um. Options menu for frame bar. Uh, uh, uh. Parameters. What the? Basic. What? Options. Huh? Huh? I did start with avatar battle control type is modern. I don't. How do I just turn on the meter thing? Because I saw it in the demo, but there's way more settings in this now. Uh, change my flag. No. Environment settings. Uh. You sure? Screen display settings. That sounds like it. Frame meter. There it is. Yeah. This is the shit that's nuts. Cause they, they, it's like, people had to just like, figure this shit out back in the day. But now it's like, okay, it's his standard little jab there. It shows you the actual frame data of the attack. Which is nuts. So it's like, the, the green frames at the bottom are the wind up animation, the two red frames are when he does damage. That's the recovery afterwards. It's just like, nuts. Eh, eh. Eh, eh. And then on the left is just all the... Wait, it is putting me in modern, didn't it? I was like, why aren't my combos working? <laughs> I don't know how to play modern. I didn't mess with it that much. Anyway, it's, it's cool is the point. Goodbye. Does it show invulnerability frames? I think it shows everything. In Tekken, you have to pay for in-game frame data? That's fucked up, but that's true. Yeah, you can just kind of tap buttons, huh? That's kind of nice. Maybe I'll mess with modern more. Anyway. Huh? How do I? How do you how do you do things in modern? Anyway. Uh goodbye. Goodbye. Go back. Get out of here. Leave. Stop. Go quit. 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 Mode. There. Goodbye. Yes. Anyway. A number of the screen saying plus or minus not the frame types like this. Yeah. Yeah, it's not just saying like how many frames, it's just like all color code and update and stuff. The yellow ones on bottom, I think that's because the bottom track is the the, the the second player, the CPU. And that yellow probably means there's all kinds. It's all in the game. I just, I don't know. I have not even scratched the surface. I like scratched off a single flake. You know, it's like if you ever, if you ever, if you have like a sheet of ice, you just kind of like flake off a little bit off the top. That's all I've done with this game. Anyway, it's a miracle. Is this hit stun? That's what the yellow is. We're doing World Tour. I'm not gonna rule out Battle Hub against like, I don't know if there's a way to to be like, okay, I'll uh, fight against viewers. I mean, you'll destroy me. I'm planning on just sticking to World Tour. Um, so we'll see. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's instantly tell when you're actually confirming stuff. Yeah, it's great. There's silly modes on online. Yeah, I, 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 I might mess with them, but anyway. Let me get cop and alerts. We had a lot, whole lot, whole lot. Thank you all, uh, I appreciate it. I'm happy to be back. Um, Yes, I've seen that there's avatar battles, which is uh, probably very silly times. I suck. Please kick my ass. We'll be a race to the bottom. Um, it's still fine. Yeah, I really enjoyed the the uh, the what I said. Well, I saw in the demo. I just the the fact that I mean, well, you'll see it in a minute. 
but the world tour is is kind of smallish open world. It does remind me of Yakuza, where it's just like here's like a little area you can run around in, and you can run up to people and punch them, and then you fight them. You can just r walk up to someone just walking around, minding their own business, and just uh, fight them, <laughs> and it's excellent. So I'm excited to play some of that. Um, do avatars have a fixed move set? So my understanding is no. Is that in playing World Tour, as you progress, you basically unlock moves you can slot in to create your character. And that's the character you can bring online. You also, of course, have the online that's like, here's Ryu, here's Ken, here's Guile, whatever. That's part of the online, but there's a separate mode that's like, you can put all your wacky... It's it's like, um, I don't know, like Me Fighters and Smash. It's like, yeah, you can pay, play Mario versus Fox, but also you can be like, all Mies, run around. So, you can play as Ryu from the streets. The level one petty, petty thief versus level 100 mob boss. Mobile game ads. It's real. They made it a real game. I don't know. Capcom's just out of here kicking ass. You can watch your character's styles and put any of their specials in the slots. It's nuts. I'm excited to check it out. Oh, yeah. I never... Uh, I, I meant to watch this clip, and then I never pulled it up. But this is a clip from the GDQ golf it run of some something that happened. Maybe. Listen, okay, GDQ, I'd like you to know something. We both operate on the same brain cell. Um, we basically share half of it. Um, Nicole and I are like just constantly <laughs> just, wrestling with it. We are. Every day. It's and true. so this this is just the this is just sink. How, right. So I, I mean I'm when I tell you that this is gonna be oh, a neck heck. and neck race, it's I'm not lying to you. Well I would you never might be lying. lying. Well I you hope did it's just neck and neck. Yeah. Cause uh, uh, at Frost Fate House a few months oh, ago, no. nothing of note oh, happened. Oh nothing yeah, betrayal did not happen. No, no, it definitely is never... not recorded on the GDQ YouTube That's page so for all silly. time. Why would you? Why are you talking? Um, why, we'll get to that later. Why are you here? Yeah. Yeah. Are you? Did I invite you? Did, uh, did you I, just I, let this me up This is your here. fault. This is my fault. Oh heck. Well, listen. Okay, GDQ. I'd like you to know something. Thank you. Thank you. I'll be. I'll be here all the week. And then I left. That guy sounds familiar. Who? Tom. He's great. You should follow him. Shout out to the top. Putting Dalsim's teleport on a grappler? What the hell? And then we left. The lost stream. Mm-hmm. Tom didn't speak in that clip. Hey, listen, don't worry. Tom was thinking about it. Uh, she said, heck, yeah, banned for life, actually. Goodbye. Uh, do you know that guy's in the middle's ads and social media to block him? That's fair. Yeah, good idea. Shout out to Greg. Greg was great. Um... But did Greg make a home game? Yes. Yes, she did. Um, Street Fighter Six, this video game here, was recommended I streamed by Solemn. So thank you. Uh, and also in between streams, uh, Kale the Dragon resubbed for 52 months, Valkaya 34 months, Little Star Warrior 59 months, Bouncer Creeper 62 months, Jolly Rogers 46 months, Zebrund 51 months, and Draco the Cupcake 55 months. Thank you. Emotional support, Greg. We couldn't have done it without Greg. Um, if you look up photos from the event, Greg is real, and Greg is sitting there. <laughs> they just, they just didn't want to move the camera. Uh, 50, 55, Ludline, thanks for 53 months. Xanry, thanks for 51. Welcome back, hope you all had a good time. We had a great time. It was a lot of fun. Uh, definitely, if you're into speedrunning and have the, the means and the etc., the gumption, I definitely recommend, uh, attending a GDQ in person. It's a very fun time. And there's also a lot of fun stuff to do at the event other than watch speedruns, even though that's a great thing to do. There's there's an arcade with some awesome arcade machines and stuff. Um, oh, also before I, I didn't even mention, but before our, um, our 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 the the run that Bath and Nicole had that day earlier, we went to mini golf and we actually did um, IRL mini golf as practice for the speedrun. And Tom won, and Bath got last place. So. I don't know if that says anything about the speedrun, but you know. To be fair, it was like like a what like a five or six stroke spread between the the five of us, but we went golf. We went small and real. We did real small. Oh, and 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 best of all, so we went we went to this place called um, outside Minneapolis called Can Can Wonderland, I think. Uh, I did have an, a, a hot aim, so we can talk about that in a sec. Remind me. Um, and, uh, the, 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 the place we went, don't say stroke spread. Yeah, they made golf IRL. They made a, a IRL version of golf it. Um, so it's this p spot that used to be like a canning factory and the ground level is now a brewery and underground is an arcade slash mini golf. It's a cool little spot. Um, and uh, the arcade was actually really legit. They had a ton of very old 
authentic arcade cabinets. Like talking like literally asteroids and space invaders and and Pac-Man and all kinds of old cabinets, Don Kong Jr. all the way up to more modern recent stuff. It was rad. Um, but the mini golf was excellent and I recommend it. Um, I'm just gonna have to pull up this video on my phone because I haven't posted it anywhere and I don't know if I will. But um, there was a hole where you have to, to, to chip the, the golf ball into this giant blue toad. Um, and this is a shot, this is a, a, a video film of, uh, of, uh, of a certain Tom uh, scoring, well, he's not scoring, he's, he's, he's working on it. So there's, there's Tom, there's this big old toad, I'm behind the toad. And you'll see he hits it up into the mouth and it poops out the ball out of a butthole that it has. And there goes the ball. Give the chip with a putter. I don't you think I know anything about golf. I don't know why they asked me to commentate. I don't know anything about golf. So uh, it, ha it has a butthole. They, they also they also had a um, a hole where it was it was billiards, where you actually had to use your 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 little putter as a as a as a as a pool cue and like hit it. Um, the f one of the final holes was a batting cage where you actually grab the plastic bat and like hit it off a tee. It was a it was a fun time. If you're in and around the Twin Cities, I guess this is my hashtag not sponsored endorsement of Can Can Wonderland. It was a cool spot. It was neat. It was a cool spot, just like Seven Up. Anyway, that's that's all I got. Uh, yeah, I had a hot Amos, and I lived to tell the tale. That's about to say. I well, okay. Here was here was my experience having a hot Amos. Right? Uh, Nicole's like, here's the hot water. She demonstrates the proper dunking procedure. Um, and and I, I followed in suit. And here, here are my unbiased scientific findings. I learned, A, hot amos is not terrible. It's not great, but I see the logic and dunking it into anything other than water would be better. The, 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 it actually does because hot Amos cookies, famous Amos cookies, are um, dust, compressed dust with chocolate chips in them, and the hot water does kind of bind it and warm it up in a way that is satisfying. But dunking into hot milk, dunking into hot cocoa, literally anything that's like dessert adjacent would be preferred. And Nicole admitted that. To be fair, she's like, "Oh yeah, for sure." Um, but. What I learned, and if you decide to try to make a hot Amos at home, it's really important to note, hot cola, I don't know about hot cola, um, that you, it's re, it's actually very precise. The amount of time you dunk it, as well as the, the quantity of, chi of, of, of cookie that you're holding. Because it's really easy to, to dip it in for too long, and then it gets all kind of soaky and soppy. It's like a little dip. It's like a little dip and a little swirl and you're done. And then you eat it. Um, I found it to be more successful with like tiny little broken bits of cookie. Because then you could kind of dunk it in real quick and just have a little bit. But a full size cookie, which I mean they're tiny little guys. Um, it ended up just being like half of it was just kind of watery. And then the other half didn't get dunked at all. And it was just dust. So it's a very specific amount you got to do to make 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 the hot Amos proper. Um... So I, I think for anyone that may have tried it at home, it's uh, it sounds compli it is complicated. I, I mean, I sat there for a good five minutes trying to mirror Nicole's technique because she has it down pat. She knows exactly how to how to dip that cookie. But uh, the hell is a hot Amos? So if you missed um, if you missed the hot Amos um, the debacle from what last year? I don't even know years ago. Um, uh, the very very short version is is Nicole invented a food question mark where you take famous famous cookies and dip them in hot water and in in her opinion it makes it you know the the, the cookies kind of uh uh warmer and and moist and and you know the the, the chocolate chips are a little, can get a little goo gooey if the water's hot enough um it's, it's f food yeah you need a couple air quotes around there so a community food criminals yes Ansta the coin the term hot animals yes bless her heart she doomed us all um so it makes famous, yeah, because and famous Amos for those that don't have them, because I'm, they're probably not an international brand. I don't know. Um, it's just they're plastic, not plastic, whatever the fuck those kind of little bags. It's a little bag of some cookies. They're tiny chocolate chip cookies, about the size of like a quarter. Except you know if it's not international, I'm comparing it to American currency. So 
you know, you're welcome. Uh, maybe a little bit bigger than a quarter. And uh, they're, they're, as I said before, they're just compressed dust. They're, they are so crumbly. You take a bite and it explodes everywhere in a powder. Um, and, and Nicole was very bored and very sad at work. And they had a hot water dispenser and then she dipped it in the, in the water and was like, yeah, it was fine. It's not bad. A 500 yen coin. There you go. These would be better in the 90s. I don't trust my memory of anything from the 90s. Because a lot of things were better when I was a kid. Doesn't mean that they were actually better. <laughs> I like the dust. If you like the dust, then go go with go with dust. Be with the dust. Become one with the dust. Who's gonna be your main? I don't know. I'm excited to mess with it. I mean, I'm gonna do a world tour and, and make an abomination. But once I actually start playing with the other characters, I just I played a lot of Luke and Ryu in the demo. That's all I know. So we'll see. Um, where got an anonymous figure? Give me this piece of paper with the drawing of a key on it. I don't know what to do with it. Rubbing it's locked over the best. Yeah, you just crumple it up. If you got, if you have a crayon scribbling of a key on a piece of paper, roll it up in a little ball and just kind of mash it into the keyhole, and it will work every time. So, you're gonna fight some streets. E Honda, yeah, hell yeah. Honda main in my first SF. Nice. We have Luke, better Luke, and now handsome Luke. Now we have forearm Luke. Dude's dude's forearms look like they're bigger than his biceps, and it is a choice. I love these character designs. Um, it's great. Anyway, uh, uh, uh. Uh, Radio Bone Air, thanks for four months. Why couldn't Luigi open his pasta locker? No key. Huh! Uh, Peridot Project, thanks for 20 months. Bargliachi is waving. Dylon, thanks for 37. Wow. Ryan's a turd, thanks for 11 months. Kale the Dragon, 53. Hams. Hams. GM Sec, thanks for 16 months. Barry versus Ryu, show him your own Hadouken. Any interest in streaming Katamari Reold? Absolutely. I adore the Katamari games. Um, I haven't played Katamari 1 or 2 re-release. I played the first two on the PS2. Um, they're great games. Um, am I going to do community matches? No plans at the moment. I'm not ruling it out, but I'm just going to stick to World Tour for now. Cute Hadouken. You got to... There you go. Oh, oh, I don't... Uh, looks like he's massaging the hams. Uh, yeah, I, I, I might stream him at some point. Because um, I think didn't re-rolled... Katamari Damashi, I think it released, I could be wrong, I thought it released originally just on the Switch, and I'm like, that's awesome, but in my brain, you need symmetrical sticks to play Katamari. The idea of using, like, the Switch or the, the Xbox controller, asymmetrical sticks, to roll a Katamari in my brain is just like, ah, but, yeah, but I think they're on all kinds of other platforms now, so if I can get it on, if I can get it on my PlayStation machine, that'd probably be good for my brain. Um, the Prince is a fan of hams. There should be a Katamari level where you just roll pigs and make a little hams planet. Both reels are out on Steam. Nice. Yeah, I have to do that. It's kind of what the sticks was fine. Yeah, I'm sure I'd get used to it in 10 seconds, right? It's that kind of thing of like, oh, that sounds terrible. And you play it for five seconds and you're fine. Thank you, Katie. Hi from Ireland. Welcome. Hello. I'm just getting caught up alerts for the next hour. But I might play Street Fighter eventually. Spectre of the Fae, thanks for eight months. Welcome back. Bath and Nicole's SGDQ run was amazing. Thank you. Yeah, I, 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 I'm glad I got to have a first a front row seat for it. It was a lot of fun to be on the couch. And also just, it's been so cool to see the the outpouring of positivity about that run. Because it's like, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't need to get into it. It's like 4 a.m., 5 a.m. delirium on top of, like, we have our sense of humor. And Bath and Nicole have their sense of humor and stuff. And it's not for everyone, right? But... Just to see so many comments from people saying that it was one of their favorite runs of the event or one of their, f just like their favorite run of the event or just all this high praise is just so, so cool. I'm so happy and proud of, of Bath and Nicole. Um, it warms my heart because I introduced Bath to GDQ when we started dating. And uh, that's so cool to, to just have gone from us hanging out on the couch, watching it together to Bath goddamn running in the event. Uh, it's very cool. So very happy for them. So many people never heard you guys loved it. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's the, the cool thing about it. It's like, I, I mean, I, I it, it, it's not, it doesn't mean any less for someone who already watches me or Bath or Nicole or anyone to be like, that was a great run. If you guys thought it sucked, then it would be really bad. It would be a pretty bad run when you already kind of mesh with the vibe and you're like, eh, I don't know what you guys were, were up about that night. That was, that was weird, but yeah, definitely a good time. Yeah, I, so so there was a guy on, on tech, uh, after the run he said it was a full-time job balancing our levels, but he had a little mixing board and was managing the, the audio levels for everything. 
Uh, and he has a microphone and can talk to us, but yeah, it was Zenadir. Excellent. Very, very cool dude. Um, I wish I had more of a chance to talk to him. But uh, he was sassing us a little bit during the run, and it doesn't go out into the stream audio. Only those of us wearing headsets could hear him, but there were a couple times when we're like, uh, can we get them muted? And he's just like, yeah, yeah. Just say the word and I'll mute them. And we're just like, God damn it. I, I wish that went out and people could hear it because it was very funny. Tech crew is great. They're so, so good. Also, 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 um, watch the, the Golf It VOD. It's on YouTube. Uh, if you just search GDQ Golf It, Bath had the link before. Uh, go watch it. I also recommend, I don't think it's been uploaded to YouTube yet. I think they're working on it, but it's on the Twitch VOD somewhere. There's links around. Watch the interview. So a couple hours before, it was after the Paper Mario run, which was great. Paper Mario was a really fun speed run. There's some really janky stuff that they do to break that game wide open. They don't get like half the party members. It's wild. Um, and after that, uh, they did an interview with Bath and Nicole about the, the, the speed run. And it was a very funny, silly interview. And then it ended with a prize segment because during the event, if you donate during certain blocks, certain amounts, you're eligible into drawings for different prizes that they have. Um, and they were part of the prize segment, and I recommend tracking that down because it was very, it was very good. Um, I didn't even know stream yesterday was still fun, but yeah. Oh, so if you watched it on stream, you might be able to find it in Nicole's VOD too. Is the interview in Twitch VODs? If the interview is in the Twitch VODs. It should be dumped onto their YouTube. GDQ posts the entire event chopped up, and it just takes them time to go through and edit everything together. So. Uh, no, that's fine, Elix. Absolutely. I, for, for me, it's just if people are um, aggressively adding me, um, you don't need to add me just if you're typing in chat. It's just like I, I prefer people only at if it's something that demands my urgent attention. It's just here's a, a thing, you know? Yeah. But it does highlight my name if you just write my name. Because, <laughs> you know, that's how it goes. But no worries. Um, it's just it, it, it jumps out of my peripheral vision. And, and, you know, I get easily distracted when the poo brain strikes. So that's why I asked. No, I appreciate it. Thank you. Chop the pull up pot, make a nice body soup. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Smash my thanks for the hammy. Welcome back. Nicole and Bath were fantastic at GDQ, and the commentary from you and Tom were hilarious. Thank you. Rest of GDQ was great. Pizza Tower speedrun was as magical and amazing as I hoped it would be. Hope you all had a great time. We had a great time. I did not catch. That's Pizza Tower is another one I want to catch the VOD of. It's, it's a very long list of, of runs that I want to watch. Um, there was another run that I remembered and I forgot it again. That was like, oh, I saw that. I tried to watch as much in the in the room as I could. Um, there, there were a couple times where we were hanging out in the stream room and they have a crowd cam. Yeah, it was golf it. They have a crowd cam in between runs. Um, and, and, and Shiv identified us. Let me see, I, I took a screenshot. Hold on, give, give me a, give me a second. Um, uh, huh, huh, what? Huh, wh when? When you, when? How do you, sir? Okay, well, never mind then. Um, this heartbeat's being anxious. It's just jamming. Is this better? Maybe that's better. This sounds like Persona music, this one. Uh, 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 uh. I, I'm gonna have to scroll so long to find it. This was forever ago. Just like, we have we had a, a GDQ chat going in in our, our our private Discord server, and and Shiv would just habitually post shit like this of just like I think I see you. just like there's a smudge in the crowd and just like huh and um every now and then it was it was it was accurate um or maybe all of it, well maybe it was accurate every time um I just gotta keep fucking oh here here's 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 the evidence. Oh god, it's such a fucking huge JPEG. There you go. Proof that a hot Amos was had. Shiv is incredible. Shiv's shouts to Shiv. New Street Fighter reveal pick is insane. Yo, they're adding famous Amos to Street Fighter. Let's go. I'm still scrolling f to find the thing that made me go, haha. Well, now is good. Um, when shit. When the fuck was it? Y'all talk too much. Uh, uh, nah, still, I'm still going. Give me a minute. I know this is fun to watch, just, you know. Uh, when? Hmm? Nope. 
Still a little more. Little more. Nope, not there. Wait. Nope. Little, hold on. Wait. Wait. Just gotta. Nope. Almost. Wait. There. No. Wait. Wait. Oh, yeah. Found it. I think. Yeah, there it is. That took a bit. That's when we were hanging out and, and Shiv added themselves to the to the to the to the group photo. Shiv Fighter if you want, says I'm here too. <clears throat> anyway, uh it was fun. Good time. Interview segment there it is. Yo mods pin that shit. I mean I could pin it. I don't know Shiv my Shiv was there. Uh meh. Yeah, woo, yeah. Go watch that interview. Uh, na 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 Thank you. Uh, Arachnophobia Kid, thanks for 50 thanks for the bits. $10. I said thanks for the $10. Yeah, all right. And there's a million things I can buy with 10 bucks. Okay, like lettuce. Like, uh, like some lettuce. Like Famous Amos. Probably buy that for $10. Uh, no such thing as sleep. Thanks for 17 months. White Hawk Workshop, 49 months. That's a lot. What edition should I buy? I don't know. I only play the demo. And I've just been streaming for 50 minutes at the title screen. But... I mean, you, I think you could upgrade to the fancier editions, right? I don't, I don't know. Probably someone in chat can maybe talk about that. Someone needs to edit that scene of a voice right with the call. You must be Amos. Don't. Uh, Joker hand, thanks for 43 months. Uh, I think I recognize this guy. Wasn't he on the couch during the world famous SGDQ golf at speed run by Bath and Jan and Nicole? Good night. No, that's Mech Analyst Tom, but you should follow him. He's great. Spectre of the Faith, thanks for 100 bits. Oh, happy Pride Month, trans rights. Let's go. Let's go, trans rights. Happy Pride, everyone. You know, Pride is year-round, but in June, we can we can be extra happy about it. Extra loud. I don't know. It's red. I was on the couch. It was a long week. I was on the couch. You can buy upgraded editions retroactively. That's nice. Platinum edition comes with menus. Bump, bump, bump. Highly recommend looking at today's Yeti tea. The Yeti. Dot com. Uh. Oh. Hmm. Well, there's this. There's two. There's always two daily. Yeah, chef. Thank you, chef. <laughs> I really like the the the, the chef meme out of GDQ. Uh, that was, was. There's always something. Um. This is very silly. Uh. This is the stream. Menu Fighter Six. These are these are quite good. These are quite good. They're they're, they're both Kirby's. Hold on, they'll, they'll rotate through, I think. Yeah, what? Can you just, just where where's the just just the design? I got it. Jesus, there you go. Corb, they they're both quite good. I, the 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 like <laughs> the tarot card Kirby is uh that's a mood. Anyway, uh, um. Uh, Kurt, thanks for soup. Special move. Soup. Soup Dukin. I was there for the chef meme because I feel like I would have been so confused watching Shiku not knowing. Well, the best memes of GDQ are the ones where you're like, I don't, I missed some crazy context, didn't I? Shouts to the ball with the screaming man inside. Shouts to the soup with the screaming chef inside. Did that, ha did anyone say that? Soup Nukem. Mm. Is it too late for me to change my name to Soup? Orb. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I think I think what I don't mind about the chef meme as much, especially when it comes to the, the, the crowd yelling about stuff, is uh, I feel like a lot of them, my threshold for, oh my God, this is now obnoxious, is when it's a single syllable, when it's a wah or an orb or a honk, it's like, this is great. And then by day three of that, you're like, Ugh. but yes, chef is just like, it's, you know, it's a sentence. It's a, it's got, it's got two syllables now. We're moving up. Yeah, the wah. I mean, the wah I thought was fun until it very rapidly, like, you hit your moment where you're like, actually, I'm done with this now. But it's still, I don't know. I, if 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 being somewhat annoyed every now and then is the price I have to pay for, for I don't know. The, 
the in-person GDQ just has an energy to it. Even just when you're watching it online. Um, that having the crowd yell stuff. Like, sometimes it might be like, okay, it's too much, but I, I, I still like it. Um, but that said, I really like that they're still doing online runs with the in-person events, because it just, it makes the event so much more accessible to different people from around the world. And they can bring in, like, showcases of rhythm games and stuff. It's, it's great. No, chef! The one meme got a butthole pin, so it was a win. Yeah, I remember that. Um... Yeah, it makes you. I don't know. I I I I I, I like it. I don't know. It, it it's fun to see people just randomly grab on something when it feels forced. Obviously, it's not the same. But it's like when they did the first. I think it was the first um, online SGDQ 2020, and uh, everyone got obsent, uh, obsessed with Sense Mom's lamp, and uh, they turned the lamp into an emote. It was a good time. Anyway, uh, Goat Show. Thanks for nine months. Enjoy your Ruby key. It's my birthday. Here's my reds. Happy birthday, Goat Show. Did you win a, a blue medal for the best goat at the goat show for your birthday? The lamp is still an emote. <laughs> it was repeated heavily in two runs. I don't think it was random light switch online. I, I I guess, but it's still I, I guess for me, random is maybe not the right word, but it's not like it's not like GDQ staff are like starting the event being like, okay guys, here's the meme for the event, you know? They they just give people the stage and the jokes. I mean, because there's plenty of jokes that are kind of in one run that don't pick up that kind of momentum. You know, you never really know what's going to stick, so. We're all stars now at the GOAT show. The GOAT! The GOAT GOAT. Happy birthday. Um, because about the I hope you enjoyed it, Apricot. It's 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 a weird, fun time. Um, it's just, I don't know, it, it's great that it's 24-7, because at any time during that week, you can just be like, what's on right now? Just turn it on. Gather around a table trying to figure out what meme. What's the best meme? The meme to virality ratio. Ball stuff doesn't apply to a lot of games. SGQ. I mean, ball stuff is basically just the same as orb. Like, just just saying, it's kind of the same thing. Uh, Nuclear Sunset, thanks for soup. Welcome back, Barrel. Thank you. Also, I'm glad that my my dumb joke about um, what was it? Uh, bath bath. The, the the one of the jokes with golf it is bath and Nicole always say fuck Robert Frost, and that's not quite PG. To say that. So Bath was saying, Robert Frost can kick rocks. And I said, that's how he invented golf. Uh, building on an earlier joke we made in the run. And I'm like, that got a chuckle from the audience. And I was like, just, just. I did it. Uh, Kitsuna Sith, thanks for 32 months. What? Where am I? This isn't Tears of the Kingdom. I've been in a trance for like two weeks playing it. I know. I barely played Tears of the Kingdom last week. And that should show you how much fun I was having at GDQ. Because goddamn it. Up until that point, I've basically just been exclusively doing it. Billy Chili made all of us so mad. <laughs> After the run, we were like, Tom, where the hell did that come from? <laughs> Get him to chuckle. Yeah. Kick rock scene, the appropriate PG version. Mm hmm. A path diverged in the road. Nice. Mm hmm. Did you pay your Tears of the Kingdom tax in the event? Not directly, because I wasn't playing Tears of the Kingdom and then, like, taking a break to watch. Um, But I, I did donate during the event. They didn't read my, my donation, but that's fine. Most donations I've ever made to GDQ have not been read out loud. That's. It's not why I donate. It is a fun bonus when it does get read. It's like a weird double take to be like, huh? That's me. Um, Still mad. Still mad. Little Star Warrior, thanks for 60 months. That's five years. Hope you enjoy your Kiwi Key. It was my birthday two days ago. Hope you're doing well. Happy Bladed. Thank you so much, Little Star Warrior. My dice roll once. Thanks for seven months. Welcome back. I missed you. Thank you. I'm glad to be back. Gazbo, thanks for 500 bits. That's a lot of bits. Welcome back. Uh, Happy birthday. Enkimana, thanks for the soup. Soup fighter. Because I soup. Because I point. Point at the soup. See him touch butt. Thanks for a year. Thoroughly enjoyed Bath and Nicole's section on GDQ. Everyone did great. Thank you. Enjoy your mild Chris Kelton key. Beer and Snorlax for 15 months. Barry's back with the milk, guys. I listen, I told you I'd be back. I brought enough milk for everybody. Curls McGee, thanks for 38 months. Enjoy the streets. I'm gonna punch the ground. Uh Lonely Wheel, thanks for 21 months. And a tier three. That's a lot. I'm taking a break from my tier three subbing for a bit, but I'll be lurking just as usual. K Chef. Okay, Chef. Listen. I don't mind in the slightest. I, mean, I appreciate, you know, something for tier three ever. That's nuts. So thank you. And absolutely take a break or stop or unsub or whatever the hell you want to do. Thank you. Sarcastic Crow. Thanks for gifting five subs. Which went to Vika T, the Zacatron, Mr. M Mimic Monster, NV Adoro, and Petco. 130. Bayo Titties, thanks for 27 months. Literally the funniest run. They were incredible. They killed it. I'm so happy that it went well. Obviously, both of them were like, oh, like, you know, on that r r hole, this, or, you know, I wish, you know, on, th on this part, the speed run, it's just like, sh sh shut up. You guys did great. <laughs> like, 
if anything, I, I, what I find having been a casual observer of many speedruns is it's often when they mess up something a bunch and then they get it, that sells the difficulty of a, of a strat or a trick or whatever much more than like, okay, this is serious time. This is hard to do. That can, it, depending on what it is, but I don't know. I, I, I just, I really enjoy watching golf it as a run, not only just because they're great, but like it's mini golf. You look at it, you see what they're doing. You're like, great. I understand it. Uh, it didn't require that much commentary to explain. Like at the very beginning, we're like, here's the things we need to explain. So people can be like, okay, like if they're going into the wrong hole outside the map, like we need to explain that, but you don't have to be like, okay, on this hole, you see that they're hitting this rock and then bouncing over this ledge. You can see them do it and be like, I get it. That's cool. That's neat. That's cool. What is golf? Mm, it's just whole ball. I'm still here. Exactly. You're welcome, Zachatron. It's golf. Uh, Autism Dragon gifted a sub to Sprinkle the Lich King. Mako Su, thanks for four months. What's up? Dr. Fat Caddy, 46 months. I'm for subbing. Thank you for other bits. I'm glad you guys had such a great time at SGDQ. Watching Bath and Nicole's Realm was hilarious, as was your commentary. Got a notice that the Hippo Space Download DLC for Placid Plastic Duck Simulator is available now, which I can only assume is Hypno Space Outlaw themed. I, that's what I... Th I thought you had a crazy weird typo. It's called Hippo Space? Bucket. I... 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 Yeah. <laughs> I got excited for Bucket. Bucket. Never asking how the golf. Correct. That's awesome. The size of the clap is inversely proportionate to the size of the golf. It's true. Yeah. I, I just didn't want... Because, listen, if the audience were doing polite golf claps, I wouldn't be able to hear it over the headset. So I was like, y'all need to be loud. And they were. It was great. Uh, Lee Rugetta, thanks for two years. Enjoy your house key. Wobble Scott. What's up, dude? Yeah, there was a... That's another one of the runs. Was a uh, um, fucking little gator game. Was at SGDQ. And the speedrun was super fun. I love once. Thank you, Wobble Scott, for 34 months. Sorry for shouting one time. Oh, my God. That's okay, human. Uh, Space Sucky Best, thanks for 42 months. Enjoy your doki. Did Primes become automatic? Because I don't remember resubbing yet. Uh, no. Primes are not. You watch it. It's good. Um, Primes are not automatic, but sometimes Prime just bugs out a bit and can, like, pop up when you didn't do it, or it take- or, like, you resub with Prime, but then it doesn't pop up in the chat for a thing for a long time. No. Project RF, thanks for two years. Enjoy your house key. If they changed it, I didn't hear about it. Big Fat Smork, thanks for the hammy! Hello, Barry, who was formerly known as Is Streaming. I landed a proper big boy job with a proper big boy paycheck, and I want to thank you for keeping me in high spirits while I was unemployed. Congrats, Big Fat Smork. Thank you for the hammy. I'm glad to hear that things are, are going good, and you're so very welcome. No no thanks is ever needed, but it's certainly appreciated, so thank you. They can easily get out of sync. Yeah, it gets weird. They just beta for multiplayer. They announced multiplayer for Placid Plastic Duck Sim. I don't know what it, I don't know what it is. I don't know what that how that works. Hmm. Uh, Killy, SG10, thanks for 60 months, five years, enjoy Kiwi Key. New stream, who dis? I don't know. Mercanius, thanks for 16 months. 16. I right, now I'm old enough to drive. Gotta go borrow the car. Gonna go have a mic ride, maybe? Dizzy at the beans. Thanks for the hammy. Thank you. Also, Mercanius with 10 gifted subs to Sally Mander, Zorax, Gold Rush, Charging Kaboom, Golan, Yetagodi, MSP Merrick, Murphy's Logger, X and the Mighty, and Kaoras. Oh, Mr. Darcy, 23 months. Punch, punch, kick, kick. Very stream is sick, sick. Is Parappa in this? Uh, that beers guy. Thanks for four months. Welcome back. Naked Arcade Bubbles, 57. That's many pop up. Definitely not a sadist, 25. It's Yakuza time. Uh, Barry Dingle, thanks for 10 months. Is that Luge from the streets? Correct. Uh, Maxter, thanks for 56 months. Barry playing fight games. Hope you have fun. Thank you. Chuck Dive Bomb, thanks for three months. Jerry Silver King. I'm back, and so is Robert Frost. Yeah, he just won't stay down, will he? Shit. There you go. There he go. Um, ba, 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 ba. Tommy Cheese, thanks for 10 months. Welcome back. Hope you had a good week off. Good to take a break. Yeah, it was. It, it's been it's been a bit. I don't really take breaks from streaming that often. And every time I do, I'm like, wow. Like, I miss it, but it is nice to take a break. You know, refresh the brain. Boingry, thanks for 20 months. Witchy Juice, two years. Enjoy your house key. What a great day to, to sell a... To sell a six? I don't know what that means. Sell a six, berries run. The golf at run was legendary. Congrats to Bath and Cole. Yeah, thank you. Really appreciate it. Thanks for two years. Everyone has the same pool, gets the name of Duck. That's cool. Who won the GDQ parking lot brawl? It was a tie. It was a tie. How many fights are in the street? At least one, maybe up to six. Basilisk, thanks for two months. Enjoy your bronze key. Learned I have Prime after two years, despite it being a meme. Did you know that if you have Amazon Prime, you have something called Prime Gaming? And that means you get a free sub every month that doesn't already know. You can go to twitch.tv slash bathandjam. 
and you can click on sub and then if you have your prime and your twitch connected and all that you can go down and check the box for use my prime sub if it's available and you can click on sub and then you basically get a free month of baths emotes and you can bath in wow for a for a whole month it's true street fighter implies the existence of boulevard beaters avenue assaulters etc it's all true or you can do it right here right now i mean but why would you but why would you do that? Look at Bath and Wow. Look, at that's like the best emote on Twitch. Uh, okay, okay, thanks for 30 months. Show your outhouse key for Shidden and Farden. Hi from the depths of Tears of the Kingdom. Hyper fixation. Back to avoiding the main plot to check out that new cave over there. That's, yeah, I'm not going to be done with that game for at least another five months. My Otis Man, thanks for 55 months. And Free the Okris with 55 months. Smash my thanks for 83 bits. Have you seen the Sakurai video? Aside from the Kid Icarus stuff, which you haven't played, it feels like it was written for by you. Specifically, which one? Game writing is unique from five days ago. I did not. I did not watch a lot of YouTube balls gone. I will check it out. Love me some Sakurai. Thank you. Tempestuous1212. Thanks for the hammy. Hello. I'm starting an internship at a AAA game company as a 3D artist. I'm very excited. Honestly, never thought I would get something like this. Thank you for your streams. They kept me company while I was working. Congrats, Tempestuous. That, that's amazing news. Thank you so much for the hammy. That's very generous. Um, and I hope the internship goes well. That's very exciting. And uh, that's rad. Thank you so much. Uh, Blaze Vice, thanks for 14 months. I come for your bees. Enjoy the bees. Thank you. But we have a inf we have a, a, a absolute confluence of bees. So any that you can take out of the house is appreciated. Make sure you spread them around Twitch. Get them, just get them all. They need they need room to fly around. Uh, Adam Five Numbers, thanks for 29 months. Have a good Street Fighter Six. Thank you. Space Succubus, 50 bits. Was listening to the SGDQ breakfast block while sleeping, and my dreams were plagued slash blessed with Yes Chef. Uh, Smash Man, thanks for 96 bits. Lario says, everybody want to be a superstar, get a lot of money, drive fancy cards. Someone said superstar. My mind immediately went to this incomprehensible pizza tower meme. Nice. Alex Bird, thanks for 69 bits. What I love the most was seeing the occasional random in chat going, wait, wait, that's Barry from Grumps. That's just Barry. That's me. Hold on. Yeah. I know. I, I was, it's like I was happy to be there, and and I, 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 but it's like, I, as far as I was concerned, I was there to support Bath and Nicole. So, you know, I'm, I'm not, I wasn't. Wasn't fine. Who? Right. Pondering ball stuff. Mmm. You gotta. You gotta. Me when I'm thinking about that ball stuff. It you. It bar you. Who? Me who? When? Oh wow. Did 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 you spot the bath? They just they just they just. There they are. Watching. Who ponders? He who ponders the ball stuff. Plotting. So up to no good. Uh, Hime Riolu, thanks for 13 months. GDQ was awesome, but I've missed your streams. I'm back. Thank you. Asalius, thanks for four months. Venna, thanks for seven. And Kimi Kappa, thanks for ten. Those are all prime subs. Thank you. I appreciate it. It's, it's a meme, but by God, it does it does work. And it's something that I, I need to, because I'll be watching so much stream. They're like, prime. And I'm like, oh, yeah. Shit, I, I haven't... Re I, like, I'll be good. I'll have, like, a good streak where I'm re-upping my Prime, and I like to use it on different streamers. Um, and there'll be like, five months where I haven't used it, and I'm like, shit, I forgot. Anyway, uh, Twitch Prime, it's a thing. Hydrate, thank you. Uh, let's play, soup. shit, let's soup. Let's have some soup fighter. Hydrate with soup. A lot of soups are kind of salty, so I don't know if, um, if that's the best way to hydrate, but listen, I'm not a doctor, so. It's Bath's turn to play Tears of Game on TV. I know, that's why I'm like, how... I'm I'm glad that Bath is here to hang out, but shit, this is this is prime Tears of the Kingdom on the TV time when I'm not home. Because Bath is much further in the game than I am. So uh no spoilers. Uh is water a soup? No, but water with fish in it is like a bisque. Uh this is Street Fighter 6. It came out like last week or something. I'm gonna play World Tour mode. Um I did play the demo, and I may have made Cure You in the demo. Um and I may have imported him into this game, but I don't know if uh, if if it'll let me start from the beginning of the game. We'll see. Monster, I it, perfect timing. Uh, Ipit, thanks for 28 months. That's so many. Thank you. So we're just gonna hop in and see what the hell happens. So go. So I've been thinking about strength, man. Strength, might. The power to fight. Is it money, authority, a cool job? A it does start. Rad. Perfect. <laughs> there he is, okay. this Blanca okay. champ. 
Let's keep it simple. I didn't know that Blanca Chan existed until very recently. Can you believe it? We got self-driving cars. The time's coming. We'll be taking rockets to Mars. And yet you still got folks out there using their fists and bodies to seek strength. Yeah, I hear you, man. We're all a bunch of fools. But, you know, if you want to know about strength, you just got to get to it. We fighting fools are all getting to it on the streets. I love it. I love it. It's so good. It's so good. Does Todd know his granddad is in here? <laughs> Where's Todd? I'm sure. Has Todd, Todd's got to be playing this, right? There's Luke. It's me, Professor. <laughs> This bag is a puzzle. But. Maybe. I didn't remember Street Fighter being this Todd. <laughs> it's, it's great. It's good. It's real good. Hmm? You my new recruit? Hello. Kids, take a breather. Look. Professional? Welcome. This is Buckler Security Services. I'm Luke, the coach around here. You're here for basic training, right? Mm hmm Okay. Let's get you measured up. Thanks, Luke. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. You could already see him behind. Lur lurking. Lur he's th he's there he is. Um... Create your avatar for world tour mode. It'll be used in Battle Hub. Try looking through the veil presets. You might just find something you like. The length of your limbs and size of your body matter during battle. Having long limbs makes it easier for your attacks to hit opponents who are far away. But a large body makes you a bigger target for your opponent to land hits on as well. You can spend Zenny to change your look at the body shop at any time. Feel free to make your avatar how you like. Well, let's see what these presets look like. Body size and oh. your reach are all factors in a fight. Well, so check everything carefully. I mean, shit. That's seems seems pretty good to me. It's Kiryu. You know, from Street Fighter. That's my wife. Um, this is a question for literally only Ansta. Are there any changes that need to be made to make him better resemble Kiryu? Owns the male wife. No, he's perfect. I'm gnawing on his arms. Understood. Um, may- perhaps, um... Body. Lower body. Uh, where... Just wanna make sure... We're good. Yeah. Think so. Which one's this? Let me hear those vocal cords. None of them really sound like Kiryu. Um, that's probably good. Sa you save. Live in an age where you can save all of your coolness and data for. Wild. We live in an age where you can save your data, your DNA, onto the blockchain. Um, this is all good. He says voice to Japanese. I can probably said the entire game to Japanese, but I don't know if I, don't know if I want to do it. Um. Oh, there it is. There's the yeah. I don't know if this is... They also hit back easier. Maybe got a... Is that better, Ansta? Or... Maybe, maybe dial it in a little bit. I think I might... be murdering Ansta in real time. You get that back out there! <laughs> I, 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 I imagine... I imagine Onsta's nosebleed spurt was visible from space just now. Um, I could also set to 69 size for buttock. This feels like TOS. Well, good. I bonked my head into my mic. He got that 2x4 dumpy. Yeah. Thick thighs, please. Uh, let me make those 69 as well. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh. I, I mean, I wanted him, I wanted him shaped like a triangle, so... I didn't want to. I didn't want to go too uh, too ham on on the lower lower half. Sixty nine is good, probably. There you go. Now we're cooking with gas. Don't be a coward. I am indeed a coward. 
You can pop every meter of the max right now. No mid sliders, all max. I like, I like, I like, I like the, I like that the butt is 69 on the meter. Nice. I'm reforming into a bionicle. He skipped a couple leg days. I mean, if his upper half didn't look like that, you'd be like, damn, them legs. So, yeah, yeah, I think it's, I think it's good. I think it's probably pretty good. Okay. Um. Yeah. Uh, yep. I'll, I'll say, I'll save over that. Share. What? How do I? What? What does that mean? I'm happy to share them with the world. I just upload recipe. Upload and share the selected recipe. Yes. Recipe upload complete. Now you can have Kiryu in your game. Nice. With the code GTPS. It has piss in the middle of. GTPSSQYL4. You can have your own Kiryu if you want. Uh, I don't know if that's. I'm on PS5. I don't know if that matters. Um. Can I, um, here we go. Get him. Yeah. Yeah, that'll, that'll do. He looks pretty good to me. I don't think there's any changes needed here. Oh, shit, he's just in Kamurocho. All right. That's my fridge. That's my fridge. Let's go. Uh, finalize. Finalize? I gotta quit that. Yes. Can't forget your name either. That's me. All right, give me your Sunday best. Uh, look at the camera, please, sir. Sir. Oh yeah, I hate. He's not looking at the camera. Also, he changed his clothes. Something weird. He's fast. Cool, cool. You do what you gotta do. I realize something bugging you. I do need to. Uh, wait, do I? When do I change my name? There it is. Yeah, this is this is. This is important for the role playing. There we go. That's what. Now you're looking at the camera. Good work. You have to send this to our GG. <laughs> Gladly. Mm -hmm. Uh. All right. Perfect. This is this is Yakuza now. Yeah, gotta say you're photogenic. Uh huh. Oh, righty. Well, that should about wrap up your enrollment. Again, you can call me Luke. We're just coach. Okay then. We're not professor. Ready to begin. There's no physical way from the that shirt. Let's go over the basics. They like open it up and like wrap it around him and staple the sides. Yeah, we'll tutorial it. Let's have you start by making it over to where I am. Feel free to walk or run. Ooh. Whatever gets you here. Oh, we'll go. Doing a dance later in the game. Uh, I do want to see that, Joshua. But I will, I will mention that it's potentially spoilers for this game. Luke looks like he was stung by bees all over his body like two months ago. Uh, his his forearms are actually bigger than his biceps, and it's excellent. So uh, this is this is Street Fighter Six spoilers, because it's a thing later on. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, just the the thumbnail of this. Come back in like a minute if you don't want to see anything from later in the game. I, that's just that's just Majima. That is actually just it's actually just Majima. How did they do it so well? Shit. My cure is not nearly as accurate as that. Yeah, look at him go! <laughs> well, we have this to look forward to. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, Majima, please. <laughs> this game rules. I, I've been very excited to play Street Fighter 6. Shit. Okay. Uh, you can come back now if you don't want to see any spoilers. Uh, I know. All it needs is you just got to drop in some vocal clips. And it's done. Ha has they posted their DNA code? I hope they have. Uh, walk over here. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh, my God. There he is. 
What's up? What? Too easy? Hey, it was still an important first step. Journey of a thousand miles and all that. Thanks, Luke. Anyway, moving right along. I placed some panels on the floor. You see them? Mm hmm I want you to pass through every last one and then make your way back to me. Okay. Sound good? It sounds great. Control the camera, you also press buttons while holding R1 while you control the camera. Even while using controllers, there's no right stick such as the arcade controller. They literally thought about what if someone uses an arcade stick to play this game. How they move the camera. Uh, camera settings can be adjusted, etc. Yeah, yeah, woo. Guy's so fast. Mr. Shakedown ain't catching me, that's for sure. Right on. Looks like you've got the hang of things. Thank you. Let's get right to it then. Okay. Show me how you are with your fists. Yeah, all right. There are two control schemes, modern and classic. Modern is a four button layout that allows players to enjoy a more free form approach to combat. Light, medium, heavy, special move. Note that modern is the only control type available in chapter one, so I'm have to use it. In explanation tips and instructional text, the command inputs required to perform moves are displayed as icons. Blue is light, yellow is medium, red is heavy. SP is special move. Switch between two styles of icons by opening multi menu options, game, command display settings. I'm not gonna remember that. It's fine. Play the battle story, why not? AKA same controls. Yeah. Move your left avatar left and right. By moving left and right, you can draw closer, move further, quick and tap, and you can put more dash. This is called spacing. Experience to find the spacing sweet spot that best suits your playstyle. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, woo. Complete. I did it, yeah! I moved. Jump over Luke three times. Professor, this isn't funny. Stop jumping. Professor, stop jumping over me. Ah, oh, shit, I should have made Professor Layton. I don't know how you could possibly make Layton in this art style. Um, crouch! You cannot move while crouching. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my, oh my god, oh my god, his spine. And his sh what is happening to his body when he crouches? Ooh. Ooh. He gets low. Yeah. He's, just, he's shrinking in like a turtle. Hit Luke with normal attacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Square's light attack. Light attacks deal little damage, but are quick and easy to land. More powerful attacks hit harder, leaving more open to counter attacks. Try to focus on finding ways to land the powerful heavy attacks unleashed by pressing circle. Performing an attack while jumping or crouching causes your avatar to perform a move corresponding to their stance. Press the same button multiple times can unleash consecutive attacks, altering the standard move. Yeah. yeah. I got him. Okay. Just target combo to drive rush cancel on a super. Easy. Special attacks. When using the modern control scheme, press triangle to perform a special move. Triangle flash knuckle. Click quickly close in on and strike your opponent. The move you perform differs depending on which direction you're holding on the stick. I mean, I've mostly been using the D-pad. It feels like if I'm using the stick, I need to, like, grab it from the top, like an arcade stick or something. Using my thumb... I don't know. I just... I've, I found from playing the demo that I gravitated towards using the D-pad more. I don't know what people feel. Uh, rising uppercut. Forward and special. Yeah. Oh, I missed. You get him. D-pad's better. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know if everyone's like, you gotta use the analog stick. Nice I'm work. like, hmm. Because fight, fight sticks are digital input, but, you know, they resemble a stick. Okay. When standing next to an opponent, press X and square, or L2, if you're using modern, to grab and throw. Throws are useful against opponents who are blocking. You get him! God, I wish that was me, though. Get over there. And get back over there. Hey, bam. Nice work. Pads the way to go. So I got a fight stick. Nice. I'm taking notes. All right, that about covers the basics. CQC. Kind of boring, right? <laughs> I knew it. That's how the basics are. Guy looks so good. Simple and boring. You'd think that I just modded the Remember, game and dropped in his character the model. Rockets, Yakuza. Need a stable launching pad for takeoff, or else they're just gonna crash and burn. You get me? Coach, how is any of that gonna help him handle this? <laughs> That was a hot foot coming in fast. It's just like Yakuza. I, from what I played in the demo, this game is actually just Yakuza. You'll see. Let's go. 
Siege is four buttons like Wazdi. Mm -hmm. uh, one, Vitality. Two, Opponent's Vitality. Three, Drive Gauge. Replenishes over time. Decrease your opponent's Vitality to zero before your own Vitality is depleted. Get his ass! Get him! Ow, shit. Shit. No, no, sir. Whoa, shit, he's fast. Shit, no, 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 hold on. Get him! Oh! Bosh, come on, man. Are you really gonna be the type to jump before you think? But coach, we gotta take this outside to make a street fighter. That was the kind of situation I want to learn to deal with. You're not here to punch bags either, right? <sighs> they love each other. Mm -hmm. Ah, right. This is Bosch. He signed up for the same regiment you are. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bosch. Look, both of you are my trainees, and you joined at the same time. So play nice, okay? He just wants to make friends. Just Look, like Kiryu. We both came here looking for strength. No, shake his hand, Bosh. Come on. If both of us are trying to find that strength, sooner or later... He still cut his hand out! There first. <laughs> what happens to the other person then? I didn't notice that when I played the demo with the slow hand. I don't bother pretending now. <laughs> oh, no. Bosh, my man. That's, That's so a sad. Really tough question. You gotta know what strength means to you before you go looking for it. <laughs> you go looking for the wrong thing. Really <laughs> might end up in that situation. <laughs> it's just the picture what? of the hand. Cross Shake. that bridge when you get to it. Oh, you two are still my plucky little trainees. Mm -hmm. Listen to what your coach says and put your hearts into your training. You got it, Luke. Focus on that. Bosh is gonna find the opposite style as you are in Pokemon. Right? Yeah. Luke's gonna be like, do you want fire punch or water punch? Yes. All right. Yes. Okay. Let's get back to business. You wanted something more practical, right? Let's we'll take it to the streets. Comes in many forms. The streets fighter. You want to start off on the right foot in this city. Hit the streets. He said it. He said it. Street header. Why haven't they made a game called Streets Fighter? Seems like... Seems like a street hitter. Hit the street fighters. Leaving the nest. He's pointing! Looks pointing in the trophy image. Oh yeah. So fun fact. When I booted up the demo and I was looking at the different um, presets. One of them, I was like, oh my god, that looks just like Mayor Hagar. I should make Mayor Hagar as my guy. And I booted up this and got this part. I was like, wait, that's a Capcom character. <laughs> I feel really stupid now. A city once dominated by the Mad Gear organization and infested with crime. But it's chill now. Thanks to the staunch efforts of former mayor Mike Hagar, peace and prosperity return to the city. Hey, look at that. Big building, huh? But to this day on the streets, there's one thing that hasn't changed. Oh, he's so wide. The denizens who survived that dark age are just as tough as they ever were. Here we are. New Donk City. Sir, you taking both wings, sir? Oh, fuck. Look at him! Actual hands-on experience on the streets? Beating up the bad guys around here should do the trick. Bad guys? Yeah, you know, just like people. Sorry, did the joke fly over your head? Um... At any rate, I was told this would point us toward our next steps. Oh. Oh, hang on a minute. I'm getting a message from Coach. There's an app on your device. Check it out. Did you get anything? What's a phone? Uh, oh, this. Oh, messages. 
Oh my god, it's Luke. Hello. From here on out, I'll be sending your training exercises to the missions app. Check it out, follow any instructions that pop up there. Whoa. Oh, over here. Welcome to the streets. Where you go and what you do is entirely up to you, but if you'd like to get a feel for how things are usually done somewhere, no quicker way than asking the locals. Look for a person named Alice. She'll show you the ropes. Talk to Alice. Okay. It's basically a to-do list. First thing we need to do is talk to that person right over there. Hey. That should be easy. Let's get going. Uh. They got birds in this game. Can I fight a bird? Your mission destination is denoted by a red mark. Try making your way towards the destination. Use the mark as a guide. You can also check your destination. Use the mini map at the bottom left of the screen. Access the map of your device. Okay. Yeah, woo. Yeah, woo. Fight a bird! Look at them. Um. Uh, 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 pause the game, activate the camera app on your device. Not only can you change the camera angle freely, you can also apply filters, stickers, etc. Images cannot be saved within the game. If you want to share, use the screenshot feature of the console. That's fine. You know what is better than this is selfie mode. Yes. And how do I hide the, the, UI, the UI HUD is square? There we go. There we go. There it is. That's... Na na. Na na. Do, de, do. Happy Pride. Thank you for the bits. He's got a very soft face. Yeah. Um. Where's the, uh. Oh. That ye. Ye. ye oh. Hmm. 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 Oh. Can be getting a lot of use out of this face. Hmm. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Anyway. Anyway, uh, 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 uh sh just fuck it. Yeah. yeah, good, go. Whoa. We got a level nine fire breather. What am I, level? I'm level one, but I have a thousand money. Uh, where? Hi. Okay. It's basically a to do list. That, I know. Fucking Alice. Why, hello there. I'm Alice, you two must be. A couple of rookies who just want to get stronger, I take it. Um, right on the money. How did you know it was us? Mm, nice. Seriously? Come on. It's practically written on your faces. <laughs> Kidding? Kidding. You're Luke's students, right? <laughs> he asked me to assist with your training for a bit. For starters, your little mission to come talk to me was a smashing success. Great. Next up, how about we have ourselves a fight? Okay. Definitely faces. Is that Molly from the big red couch? Yes. Strawberry shortcake. Everyone's making different references. Bubblegum badass. Don't hold anything back now. I'm a lot stronger than you two. I believe it. Ma'am. Land 10 hits with assisted combos. Land an attack with R2 pressed. You can follow up with a combo attack by pressing the button. Okay. Performing one will cause massive damage to your opponent. Give it a shot. Uh, you'll be able to focus on attacks like so this is X. When you get special moves, these moves will be used in assisted combos in the vein of your master. If you swap in a special move with another master, if that attack uses the same command, they'll come out in the same order in the assisted combo. The third hit of Luke's assisted combo 2 will utilize the special move occupying the quarter, quarter circle back slot. Oh, okay, I don't know what that means. Uh, hi. Eh. Kick. Kick, kick, kick. Oh, I, I see. Hey, Ma'am? I'll get you. I'll get you. Shit. Got N nip nibble nephew. Okie dokie. It looks like you're still getting your street fighting legs. As far as your next mission, how about you go fight someone else? Like I don't know anyone. You can challenge someone to a fight with Square. Talk to me again after you beat two opponents. And by opponents, you just mean strangers. Press square when close to an opponent to initiate a battle. Those who will accept your challenge will have levels displayed above their heads, indicating how strong they are. Try starting a fight with someone who's about as strong as you. Just like, uh... Just like, um... Hi there. New to the city? I'm gonna fight you! Get her! You can use items during battle. Press the options, open a pause menu, select the knife from your inventory, ask me to say, yeah. Yeah. 
You can fight the fucking brick. Yeah, he's level three though, so I don't know about that. Yeah. Ow. Shit. Ma'am, 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 get back. Good fight. I leveled up. I didn't level up. I got some experience. Hi, Catherine. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Ooh, nice Capcom sweater. I can't fight you, though. You want to fight? You want to fight me? You want to fight? You want to fight? Get, 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 get. <laughs> Shit. Give him the stink you like. Shit. Nice. Leg too short. Fighting makes you stronger. You have to level up upon getting your speed. You can check your current level. Yeah. You gain skill points upon leveling up. You have access to status app and then choose skills. You use skill points to make you more powerful. Ooh. Can I, can I, can I punch? Whoa. Hmm? Just, just. I sure did punch that pedestrian a lot. Uh, uh status. Check your style. What's your style? Some may seek to tweak their gear set for optimal performance. Others opt to focus solely on looking as good as possible. Uh, okay. Okay. Four types of attacks. Punch strength, kick strength, throw strength, unique attack strength. Five for each style will increase your level up. Equip gear set. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay. Luke style. Moves listing you. Becoming a student of a master gains you access to new special moves. There's a limit to how many you can use at once. One special move permitted per command. You cannot set charging type moves to neutral slots in modern control type. Grounded and aerial special moves can be set separately. You can also set different moves for individual styles. Sure. Uh, skills! You can use skill points to lock new skills, which can make your avatar stronger. Give you skills. Yeah, okay. Uh, skills you don't choose will carry over to later trees. No matter the order you choose to learn skills, it's ultimately possible to learn every last one. Nice. Try to keep tabs on your skill points. Research which skills make the most sense to you. Like to redo how you've unlocked your skills. Square to return all skills to their locked state. Doing so requires using up your continues, but it's a small price to pay if it means being able to try a variety of skills. Okay. Have a good one, Duke. Um, so I have how many? I have three skill points. Increase punch, kick, throw, or unique attack. Increase defense or increase vitality. Uh, let's have good punch. Yeah. Okay. Ma'am. Ma'am. Hi. That. It's not too bad. It's just they give you a lot of information, but it doesn't seem too bad. Gotten a feel for fighting yet? Nothing beats trying it for yourself. When you're out about, not everyone you run into will go as easy on you as I do. So if you're going to start a fight with someone, pick your opponent wisely. Anyway, I'll catch you two again sometime. Goodbye. Oh. There was a man sitting behind where she was standing, and I thought he was standing clipped through the floor. Sometimes you gotta talk to folks on the street and ask them for a fight. Think of it like saying hi on the streets, only with lots more punching. And if all that punching works up an appetite, go ahead and get yourself a bite. There's a food truck nearby. You never guess from the look of it, but they do killer pizza. Grab a slice. You'll see. Oh, really? Eating food is part of our training, too. Is Coach just messing with us? Although I am pretty hungry. Might as well do what he says. Pizza man, get me pizza. Go on, get me. What do you got? Shopkeeper biz. What can I get you? Food purchased from eateries can be used, eaten, used to restore your vitality or provide a variety of other effects. There are two types. Food used immediately upon purchase and food used during battle. The food lineup changes from time to time. Check your map screen periodically to see what's on the menu. What are you, boy? He's got green pizza. It's covered in asparagus and other veggie toppings, plus melty mozzarella. A great choice for supplementing your daily vegetable servings. Recovers vitality. Pepperoni pizza, the number one pizza in Metro City. Street fights occasionally break out over pizza toppings, but pepperoni's a universal favorite and fill in the boot. Increases, I don't need, uh, green sounds good. Oh, I ate it. Oh, I thought I was gonna store it for later. I guess he was hungry. Thanks for stopping by. Okay. <laughs> you know, I'd swear up and down that the food back where I'm from is the best in the world. But pizza is clearly like cheating or something. How do you compete with cheese this hot and gooey? Uh. Oh. I got a phone. Metro Man. Mm -hmm. 
They're in the second store. Oh. What I tell you, bomb pizza, huh? All pizza's good pizza, but uh, the pepperoni gets my vote any day. If you ever run low on stamina, eating something will get you right back on your feet. Some food will even have you hitting harder, moving faster. The works. Food can power you up in all kinds of ways. Don't be shy about expanding your palate. Now you're done filling up, why don't you pay a visit to that nearby alleyway? That sounds sketchy as hell, Luke. Oh, really? We gotta get to an alley next. Man, what is it this time? Also, that pizza man is very tall. Cool. Gets a pizza for free. Give me some pizza. Eh. Hey, Tony. Hey, Setsuna. Oh, shit, they got avocado burgs. Let's go. Temporary quote. No loitering. Pierre, what is... Oh, yeah, no, he's... No, I'm good. Yeah, hmm. I'm gonna ask you to pay. I think I did pay when I bought it. I need it. I know I hope my games would do it. They're pretty funny. Mm-hmm. I've seen some screenshots of some of the text conversations in this game. They're very good. Looks like a Splatoon map in that building. Fighting two or more opponents. When getting into battles in the city, you may find yourself up against multiple opponents at once. The number of opponents in the given battle is displayed at the bottom of the screen. Hi. Okay. Got him. Oh my god, we're synchronized! Me and Bosch. Thank you, Negative Space. Oh, hi. Oh. Are, you, are you a Capcom developer? Hi, we hope you're enjoying the Street Fighter 6 video game. Howdy. We meet again! Oh, hi, Alice. Let me introduce you to my brothers, Tracy and Ryan. Hey. Luke asked us to give you a hand with your training. You know, get the whole family on board kind of deal. Hmm. Surprise, these box disguises sure are something. Uh -huh. You don't need a disguise if I don't know you. We're imitating the thugs around here. They hide their faces just like this. That's why they're wearing the boxes. They're attacking folks left and right. Be careful out there. Got it? Oh. Thank you, Polish. Well, man, thanks for the two, too. There'll be times where it's not just one opponent, too. Some city denizens may attack on sight. This is, this is incre- Everything they add makes it more like Yakuza. Some examples might include gang members wearing cardboard boxes on their heads or otherwise obscuring their faces in some fashion. Keep your wits about you and an eye open for sus characters. Aggressive denizens' names will be colored red. So yeah, sometimes the street will bring the fight to you. That's when it's time to bust out the self-defense. Trust me, there's some places you do not want to wander around in unless you got the chops. Consider this training to help you traverse the streets wherever, whenever. Cool, next lesson. See the sign for the apparel store? I want you to do some shopping there. Oh. It's just a prank. It's a prank. An apparel shop. I've heard of those. They sell clothing and the like there, right? I've never been to a place like that before, but if it's in the name of training, I can't refuse. We're gonna get some new kicks. To have better kicks. Dripping style. It's so drippy in there. I got a hundred zenny. Wait, when did I lose money? From buying a thing. I'm good. Beat square building. Hello. Pardon. Thank you, for coming. you can purchase wearable gear at clothing shops. Such gear not only affects your appearance, but parameters as well. The product lineup changes from time to time. What are you buying? Give me a cool hat. Yes. What is that? It increases my punch strength and my defense. Nice. Oh, sh look at him. This soundtrack is... excellent. Cool hat! Yeah, I'm equip it. You can equip purchase gear at any time, but having any status and then gear. Come again. Cool. Hey, crowds. How you doing? He also has the hat now. This doesn't exactly go with what I'm wearing, does it? It looks great. You know, Bosh san, it takes all kinds in the city of streets. We match? Is that supposed to make this less cringe? Is that how people around here put it? Nani? <laughs> you misunderstand. Matching is really not the issue here. <laughs> Same hat. Hi, Shiv. In fact, it only makes it worse. Ha ha ha. Uh, uh. He's just Kiryu. He's just Kiryu. I'm so glad 
I accidentally stumbled into making him cure you in the demo. I had no idea that the world tour was structured like this and worked like this. Like, everyone online is like, it's it's a Yakuza game. Like, I'm not the first person to make that connection, but I just completely fell backwards into like, oh my god, every part of this is just perfect. Congrat- thank you, I made this. Shopped till you dropped, it doesn't even matter if you're the fashionable type, TBH. A little bit of attention to your outfit can make all the difference in a fight. And hey, doesn't it feel good when you find that outfit that just speaks to you? Cool, let's wrap things up for the day. I'm wandering around the city as we speak. Let's see if you can find me. Hey. Coach is on his way, and he says he wants us to find him. He should be easy to find. He stands out as much as I do. Let's go. There he is. He's already in the back. <laughs> you can already see him back there. Oh. And then he got draw distance away. Luke, no! Professor! And whoop. There he is. No, 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 When you get draw distance, he's not skip shoulder day. No, he doesn't. It's just biblically accurate to cure you. Hi. Oh, yeah, there's a thing that I noticed. Uh, they have all the Street Fighter games. And adjacent, like Final Fight. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. They got everything here. They got them all. Although, I, I'm, I, are the Street Fighter games canon within this one? I don't know. I'm not thinking about it. I just think it's cool. And there's, there's the six. That, it's this one. Our way. Yeah, we, we did this. Um... Getting hungry, final feast. That's pretty good. <gasps> Toy game! Strawberry Fight 6. With Blanca Chan. That's great. Routine fitness. Get the buyer's dreams. Let's exercise. Push the limits. Beat your beat yourself? Beat. Cure you? Nani. Uh hi. Luke. How are you? What's you know. up? How's the city treating you? Getting some practical experience on the streets? Coach, are we really getting stronger by running around like hold this, up, eating pizza up. and buying hats? Doubting the wisdom of Luke Sensei, are you? Thanks, Luda. Let's see where you're at, then. Right. Don't worry about taking turns, both of you. Let's go. Alright, alright, okay. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Ow, shit, fuck. Oh my god, he's strong. Uh. He's only level 10, which is actually kind of low, it seems. He also has a lot of HP. I'm down. I died. Respectfully passed away. No. In a fight, right? In a fight? I think Bosch has him. Oh. I say, I think Bosch has him. Not bad. No. I'm sure someone out there has beaten that fight. So, you two check out the city, see the sights, rack up some wins. And then you come back with the confidence to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with your lovable coach. I guess that practical training paid off in spades. Am I right? I didn't learn anything. I'm- he's too world, wide, he's blocking Bosch in the shot. You can. Ryan like crazy. Not let up. Not for a second. The road to the top is long. He's but too wide! Kiryu, you're to too wide! Step at a time. Sir! He's too wide! That first step you both took just now? I didn't do this. This is just Kiryu. It's something to be proud of. I can't see around my wife. You are great students. I like. I like when he smiles. He looks like he's in pain a little bit. Enroll. You became Luke's student. You can now use his master action. Becoming a student of a legendary fighter grants you access to their Stroil, which you can in turn use in battle. Each style includes moves specific to that legendary fighter. Seek out legendary fighters and find a style that works for you. Unique attacks are normal moves that possess special properties. How many you have and what they do depends on which master's style you're using. Unique attacks can be performed by using the directional and an attack button together. If you'd rather not worry about doing them accidentally, you can always remove them from your move list altogether. They are all usable by default. I see. Yeah, 
We're just gonna. Huh. You know what? Uh, you make a darn good team. Okay. I don't think it'd be the worst thing for you two to take on the world together. World tour. Yeah. Let's team up, Bosh. Absolutely. Do some training like we did at the gym and around Metro City. Then, the two of you can go and travel the world. You can really get to know each other. And take on all comers. Seriously, you'll have a blast. I'm sorry, I can't. What? I, I need to be strong and I need to be it now. I'm not like you. I can't go around treating this like a game. Bosh, come on. Coach, I'm done with the course. Oh, no. The guy in the background is jamming. Things I need to take care of. But you're right. This did give me some confidence. Thank you. Our only fight ended in a draw. Wish we could have had a rematch. Oh, he's so sad. <laughs> oh, he's so sad. Oh, man. We we'll probably have to meet up with Bosch and do his side story later. Seemed like something was nagging at Bosch. But chasing after strength in a mad rush is a recipe for disaster. Let's just hope he doesn't stumble down any weird rabbit holes. Thank you for the foreshadowing. Uh. uh. You know, to be honest, I don't consider myself much of a teacher. Then why'd you open like a dojo where people enroll with you? Prez said I was too much of a hothead. Had me teach new students to help chill me out a bit. How can I put this? I'm giving it the old college try, but maybe my methods could use a little work. Moving on. That does it for today's lesson. I'll contact you using this sucker moving forward. Ah, right. Is that a lollipop? That's right. If you see Alice, tell her I said thanks for helping out with the lesson plan, yeah? All right. She's got a ton to teach you, so I hope you two don't beat each other up too much. Goodbye, Luke. Oh. You now choose, I can make it classic if I want. Classic's a six button control scheme that Street Fighter players will immediately recognize. If you'd like more nuanced control of your avatar, we recommend classic mode. You can change battle controls, go into options, then controls. Modern is recommended for those who prefer more streamlined controls. Classic's recommended for those who want to play Street Fighter like they always have. Play around, see what you prefer. Changing your battle controls will affect your special moves you may need to adjust your setup. I have obtained the rising uppercut. Isn't beating each other to the point? Yep. First time student. I am tempted to an avatar pose. I don't know what that means. I am tempted to switch to classic for a bit. And try swapping back and forth. I think I'll do that. Uh meh, meh, my controls. Um Avatar Battle. Classic. Give that a go. Go the say arcade. <laughs> is is there an arcade here? Uh talk to Alice. Hi. Wait, I should probably not in here in the there. So this is, I think, where the demo stopped. So now this will all be new to me from here. Uh, status. Moves. So I have Flash Knuckle. I have to buy it? How is this? I don't... Uh, it said they're equipped by default, right? Try and move. Oh, that's cool. An opening. An opening. An opening. Is that not... There we go. Yeah. Get him. Those are equipped. Uh, oh. Hmm. Quit? With those arms. So I have a quarter circle back punch and a quarter and a, and a forward down. I don't know what that's called. <laughs> Not a quarter circle, but like a, you know, whatever. Uh, okay. Cool. That's a real training menu. DP. Dragon punch. God, thank you. You came all the way over here just to thank little old me? Come on, it's been my pleasure. How about you, starting to get what this strength business is all about? I still don't understand. I'm just a little bit dumb, you see. Okay. I feel you, that's just how it goes. So hypothetically speaking, let's say somebody, me, for example, gave you a list of step-by-step -step instructions on how to get strong. If you followed those instructions to the letter, would you be satisfied with the result? <laughs> Probably not, right? Strength is something we all must find on our own. Mm, right. And in order to find it, you gotta talk to people just like you're doing now. You'll want to look for fighters worthy of being called legends and ask them to impart their teachings to you. Take my style, for example. I learned it from a fighter named Chun-Li. 
If you're looking for a guidepost towards strength to call your very own, it'd be well worth heading to Chinatown to meet with Chun-Li and learn her style. Hmm. Where's China? Is it that way? Is that, is that where Chinatown is? Points called miles are earned throughout the game by performing various actions. A notification will appear when you're in miles. They're used to continue after losing a battle. Why are they called miles? The city contains a wealth of things to see and do. You can chat with people you meet, do part-time jobs for Zenny, or you can find rare items in the most unexpected of places. The people you meet along your journey will, allow, will show you the path forward and help you grow as a fighter. Clear. I got some caramels. New items available to shopping. Check shop locations for that. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Miles helping me. Milestone. Is, 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 it is Capcom. They like their Zenny. Uh, using classic inputs in mind. Even using my controls, it's possible to use special moves to command strings in the classic way. From the fifth special moves onwards, you need to input the classic controls command. Oh, so even if you're using modern controls, it has simplified controls up until the fifth slot, and then you actually have to input the command. That's interesting. I didn't mean for that. I wanted to... This. Uh, items. Caramel. Incoming damage cut small for 30 seconds. And I have a tough jawbreaker. Outgoing damage boost. That's cool. Um, Kung Fu lessons in Chinatown. Head to Hong Hulu Chinatown. Done. Uh, customize. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I can customize my... Yep. Yep. Oh, classic. Good. Great. I mean, you gotta go with the goddamn... The old school. Uh, expressive with emotes, master actions, shortcuts, L1. Yep, okay. Uh, mm. Uh. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see. So you can... That's nice. Hello. Oh, that's a very good... Up He's really good in there. Um, can we have a cat background? Hi, Gene. Let's fight! Let's go! Oh, shit, he's got the moves! What? Hey! Oh, he jumped out of my grab! I got him! I murdered a man. Woo. This game's great, actually. <laughs> uh, obtain title pesky little squirt. I don't. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm supposed to go over here. Oh, you can sprint. I did. I did say there was more stuff in the store. Hold on. He just wanted directions. Come on. That sure is a tough. Yeah. He was trying to run. Certain pieces of upper body gear considered parable can be worn alongside other gear. Parable clothing can be found in selected by up upper body gear. So a piece of gear parable, regardless of how you pair items, it will not affect their original parameters. Okay. Um. I'm really hoping that. Oh. Uh, on top of the hat, even. On top of the hat, even. I, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, dressing this man feels horrendous. Uh, oh, oh. Shit. What, is, what do the cat ears do? I don't have enough money for him. It, it, it has SR temperamental. Super art gauge, gain boost, drive gauge, regen rate cut. So it makes your drive gauge regen slower. So they're punishing you for putting on the cat ears. God... Damn it, Capcom. Then undress him. That's not any better. Um, de defense. Give him a shirt, increases defense. Pants increase defense. Everything's so expensive. I can't afford shit. All right, goodbye. Do it later. Um, there's also this store. Style Lab Beauty Salon. Oh, it just lets you tweak your guy. Get your avatar's appearance. Leaving the shop with your altered appearance will cost a thousand zenny. Change your appearance can be saved at no cost. Put aside for a later date. So you can mess with it and then change it later. Uh, okay. I'm good. Why do we change perfection? No, it increases my... Just stop it. Let's go say hi to Chun-Li. 
I'm gonna give her uh, unprompted give her my phone number. Hey ya! Huh. No. You're going to travel all over to get stronger from here on out, right? Probably as good a time as any. Take the bus. Chinatown's that away. Hard to miss its big gate. Anyway, good luck out there. After examining a bus stop for the first time, it become available as a fast travel location. Selecting via the map and your device will allow you to travel there instantaneously, even from far away. Make an effort to check out every bus stop you happen upon across the city. There's also fast travel points that can be unlocked via missions. Look out for people wearing t-shirts with a bus motif. If you're a fan of fast travel, it could be worth your while to talk to them. Well, damn. That's nice. Boop! Now I can bus. Alright, goodbye. Going over here. Oh. Oh, oh! Oh, look, look at him climb. I've never seen anyone in a video game or any real life. I've never seen anyone climb a ladder like this. That's... It's quite good. Oh, I'm hot, level 28, huh? Hello. Hi. hi. <laughs> it's a very gentle hello. Hey there. Me? I'm a hero. Are you Capcom man? It says Watcher, but why the... The seas. I protect the city from the shadows. Hey. I sense destiny in our meeting here. Care to talk shop? And by shop, I mean justice. Uh. Well. Allow me to begin. Ahem. There was once a young man. Seeking strength, he traveled here to Metro City. On his first night, he went in search of food to sate his empty stomach. But along the way, he encountered foul ruffians who stripped him of his every possession. Right. If the story ended there, it would be just another tale from the mean streets of Metro City. But oh, my friend, and it did not. A martial artist intervened, aiming to strike down the rampaging ruffians. And strike them down he did. And they all lived happily ever after, perhaps, had the story ended there. But you see, the fighter chose to relive the gang members of, to relieve the gang members of their money. It was their reward for winning, you see. In that very moment, the young man had an epiphany. Uh. Martial artists and gang goons are cut from the same cloth. To strike down evil is a righteous act, without question. But that alone is not enough. One's reasons for striking down evil and their sportsmanship afterward are equally important. When you raise your fists, you must do so for just and meaningful purposes. Well. You're a fighter, hmm? Is there meaning guiding your fists? Uh, I don't know. Right. I see. Uh, you'll find a clearer answer to that question in time, I imagine. But you must never forget to fight with the spirit of righteousness. Sorry for the trouble. Listen to me blabbing on. Sorry about that. Here, as thanks for listening to my story. No need to be shy now. Take it. He handed me an elixir? What? It, what? Uh, what is What is that ball that says HP and that ball says... What is... It's just... Traditional herbal medicine to draw out one's inner strength. The bitter taste, the results speak for themselves. Fully restores vitality and drag gauge. Great. No, I, under, I understand HP and just what... It's it's a glass jar. It's like a Chinese medicine? It's just like a ball that doesn't fit in the jar held up with paper. Why not just hand the paper over? I don't know. Anyway, eat it. No, maybe later. Uh, details. Whoa. You unlock thing? Oh, no. Oh, no. I just thought you'd run around and fight dudes, but it's like, no, if you beat him with Luke's style, you get a magazine? If you hit him with a super art, you unlock the luxury heat pack. That's... Sorry. Sorry. Oh, this game is dangerous. Fight him? Um... I mean, I suppose... I suppose I could. Uh, I don't know what that says. Uh, ooh, paint! What, what are you painting? It's good. He looks easy to fight? Yeah, I probably could take him. In, in, a, in a fight. Um. <gasps> Whoa. C Cern? Sir? 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 Open. I got punch booster. Brick busting banana. Why not have the physique of a farm vehicle? Uh, it permanently increases stat. Oh. Oh. I better eat that then. Um, give me that punch booster. Is this drugs? 
Cool. Hooray. He already has that. He already looks like farm equipment. Well, I got a brand new car here, you harvester, and I'll give you the key. Let's fight. Put her there. What? What? Can I drive attack? I can't. Whoa, shit. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. No, that's scary. That's scary. That's a bit scary. That took out, like, all my HP, bro. That's fucked up. Get him with the rising uppercut. Shit. No, no, no. No, no. I don't think so. Oh, get him. Get him. Get his ass. Get, get him, Kiryu. Get him. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I died of natural causes. It was unrelated to the fight. When your vitality is reduced to zero, you can choose whether or not you would like to continue. If you choose to rise to your feet, your vitality will rep replenish. The fight will go on. If you choose to give up, the battle will come to an end, and you'll have to restart the game from a set location. You will not receive any rewards. I would not... Thank you. I have no continues. Goodbye. Oh, God, his body. Uh, he's fine. He's okay. Throw a bike at him. I know. Where's the bikes? I thought this car was empty for a second. Can I fight the car? Wanna... Oh shit, you can punch someone's car. I'm so sir, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sir? I didn't, I didn't mean, I didn't mean... To... He seems surprisingly calm about it. Punch this man's car. Haha. -ha. I think he's angry, lol. Anyway. Uh... Right. Whoa, hot dog! Let's go, Liam. Oh, he's tall! He's a tall man! Shit. No, stop it. Shit. Oh, right in the boing loins. Anyway, how are the hot dogs here? Are they good? I throw three times, I get my money. You wanna go get it? He seems a little winded. Might have to fight him again later. Hey, you got any hot dog? Sorry, Alexis, I didn't... I was just standing there. Sorry, I don't know my own width. Brett! Neat. Good. Oh shit, they got Wendy's here. Uh, we made it. Hello. Is that Fred Durst? Yeah. There she is. Lee Fen. Yeah, you got it, Fluffy. <laughs> There's Kiryu in the back. Give her a kiss! Oh. Dead. Uh, Lee Fen, I'm disappointed in you. Chun Li. There she is. It's all that fooling around on your PC. I'm not fooling around. You're just way too good. Trying to get the thighs carry can have. I didn't mean to get you involved. Wow, you're very you're very wide, sir. Is there something I can help you with? Rip. Oh, Rib. Oh, Katamari. Hello, Rib. Hey, don't hope we had a good stream. Hello, hello. We're playing a uh, uh, Yakuza 6 fighter. I just met up with Chun-Li. 
You're in pursuit of strength. Correct. Mm -hmm. That's a feeling I understand all too well. I've had a long career as a fighter myself. I've faced all kinds of opponents. That includes fiercely powerful foes. And friends forged in the fires of competition. My Kiryu and Chun-Li fanfiction is finally real. Uh. But after all those years of fighting, I decided it might be time for a break. Hi, Calvi. Let's cure you. That's why I'm here teaching the locals Kung Fu. Now then. I can't promise they'll provide you with the strength you're looking for. But I'd be happy to teach you a thing or two. Now then. Let us begin, Li Fen. She's got a little Blanca Chan. Hi, sleepy time. Have a good snooze. Thanks for the raid. Come on, hurry. Hello. Oh. Feel bad for whoever's standing behind Kiryu now. I need Chun-Li to break my arms and Kiryu to nurse me back down. <laughs> oh. He's not really good at it, but by God, he's trying. Oh, he's getting it. This is better because it's cure you. <laughs> it's just it just worked. I would be saying that the entire time I played this. Ah oh, fuck. Ugh. You became Chun Li's student. You can now use your fighting style, basic moves, and unique attacks. You also learned her master action and the 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 thigh size slider now goes up to 250. Kikoken! Fire key blast directly forward, useful for attacking opponents at range. Back forward punch. Spinning bird kick! A series of rotating upside down kicks with your legs extended wide. This move does a lot of damage. It's useful while performing combos against opponents who have left themselves wide open. Use a style. It's right for you. Becoming someone's student grants you access to more styles. You can only use one style at a given time. Finding a style that suits your own approach as com to combat is key. Open status. You'll find this style. Style select at the top of the gear menu. Scour the lands for legendary fighters to study under and try out as many styles as you can. Special moves you learned are yours to use as you like, even if you change styles by combining the diff special moves of different legendary fighters, you can design a fighting style that's entirely your own. Of your device status and special moves. Number shown on the upper right gives a general idea of the damage output, but factors like your level will affect this. Special moves must be set for each style and control type, and changing one of these will change your setup. Whoa. I see. So, did it automatically switch me to the new style? No. Oh. Oh, yeah. And then... Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. He's got the moves. Hey, thanks, little birdie. Yeah, I'll take some candy. What you got? Okay, so then I don't... Yeah, I don't... So I could swap those out. Um, how do I try? So what was it? it, was, it, was, it was it back forward punch? Oh, God. Um, why am I jumping? Hit. You guys see a spinning bird kick. I know. How do I, what do I, how do I, where's my, do I not have those here? How do I see them? Hold back and then forward punch. All right, I was, I thought I was holding it. Gotta charge it. How long do you have to charge it? Um, and then down up kick. I see. Wait, no. Put me back. Put me back. For about a third of a second. Gotcha. Hmm? Do you let go, or do you just rock it forward? Eh, eh. Oh. Also, I keep jumping, and I don't know why. You rock it. 45 frames. That's very precise. You rock it after me. Uh, I switched to classic. What if I do... Oh, God. Oh, God. Sir? Traveling down and back? Hmm. I'm like two thirds. Think you can dodge? Oh. You can crouch charge. Okay. Think you can dodge? Hmm. 
That is way longer. I am using the D-pad. I just, I guess I keep Think accidentally jumping. Oh, weird. Think you can dodge? Think you can dodge? Think you can dodge? Think you can dodge? I know, I was trying to do that. Anyway, uh... And then kick. There it is. So there's no visual indicator that it is charged. Can you tell I've never played as Chun-Li? There he is. Boy, that- you really gotta charge- you gotta cook it. Yeah. Wow. As long as you're only back in any capacity, even if you jump backwards, you're still charging. Oh, so you can- you can, like, flip backwards and then... Wait. Wait, shit. Shit, come on. Stop jumping. Stop jumping, sir. Shit. Didn't mean to do that. Hold on. Jump, hold down, fire, and release. So, uh, wait, I get that. You have to kick. Shit, fuck. No way I want it. Fuck. Yeah, I've never really messed with the charge characters at all. Shit. There's a minigame that teaches. I, I think I need it, because <laughs> it feels really weird. Did I mention earlier that I pretty much only ever played as Kiryu because I learned how to throw out Hadoukens and accidentally throw out... Oh my god, you can't even tell what's on the shirt. Oh no, Kimberly, what happened to you? Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh yeah, fashion leader. That's me. This will not affect your base stats. I hope not. This is who did... She looks like me. I... Uh, not on Kiryu. I mean... A bit... Apparently, Kimberly is really fun. She looks great. Uh, training pants, training shoes. Yeah, they they gave everyone goodies. Favorite gear. I look great. Anyway, hi. Um, am I fighting all of you? I uh, maybe I'm fighting all of you. Hello. Hello, a new student. She's beginner friendly. That sounds good to me. What do you say to a little sparring? Uh. Uh, ma'am. So, so a fighter style changes your normal moves, but your special moves are what are more impacted by. Yeah. yeah. Apparently, I did a challenge. Got it. That they used a lot. Oh my god! He, the fuck! They're giving him Chun Li's animations. I don't know how to feel about it. Gear coloring item. Whoa. That hey. sucks that that's a consumable, but okay. Tell that you and I move the same way? That's because we're both using Chun-Li style, given that we're her students and all. Even if you're doing something as simple as throwing a punch, the movements change entirely from style to style. Picking a master whose style is a good fit for you is one of the fundamentals of success. Yata, he's too wide to pose. <laughs> if you prefer Luke's style, you could but change back to it from your status app. <laughs> Earning enough of a style's EXP will cause that style's rank to increase. If you increase your style rank, your master in that style might teach you new moves next time you talk to him. You might also gain a stat boost. Style XP can be earned long, large quantities by talking to masters, by talking to masters, or by fighting against citizens who use that style. So you want to identify people using a style and use their style against them to better level up that style. Or you just stick to the style you like and then, yeah. Uh... While exploring the city, you may sometimes notice citizens with master icons attached to them. So you don't have to guess. Good. Uh, the citizens are talented fighters who use the moves of that icon's corresponding legendary fighter. It will yield a large amount of XP if defeated in battle. Oh, no. So if anyone's style. Maybe. Or am I just misunderstanding? I thought they were saying, like, if they use chun Li style, use chun Li style against them, and you get a bigger boost to chun Li's style XP than if you use, like, Luke's style or something. It's both. You just get more XP if they use that, but is there an extra multiplayer, mul multiplier if you use their style against them? That was my understanding initially. Ma'am? Miss? Madam? Lao Mao's level 4. I don't know if I'm ready for that. Um, let me try. Use the style of the XP as well as fight people off that style. Gotcha. Hi, Lao Mao. Greetings. Have you heard of Master Actions? You can learn new actions from every master you study under. Incredible, wouldn't you say? Becoming the student of a legendary fighter grants the access to their master action. 
Press R2 and an attack button to perform the master action assigned to that button. Oh my god, he is flying across the alleyway. Some master actions can be used to destroy wooden boxes and barrels or leap to faraway platforms. Different actions consume different amounts of a drive gauge. Using a master action on a civilian can lead directly to a battle. You will start the engagement with a preemptive attack, tilting the scales ever so slightly in your favor. Master actions, while convenient, do consume drive gauge. Keep an eye on how much you have left in the tank. So, uh... <laughs> huh. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, alright, okay. Okay. I just, I just. What did I come into? Hey, welcome. Don't worry about it. Wait. Yeah, get it. Oh, my arms are too short for a lot of grabs. Ah, fuck. Ma'am, ma'am, I don't have that move yet. Please refrain. Or maybe I did unlock it and I just didn't pay attention. Ah, no, no, madam. Madam? Get her ass! No, no. Come on. Shit. Yeah! Ooh, almost died. Whew. Got her. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> Hi, yay. I need I need to eat, I need to eat something. This is the wrong thing. I don't kudos? The fuck is Oh, that's when I lost pesky little squirt. How do I equip that? I don't- I don't know. Probably profile, which I can't do yet. Uh, I need- I, where's- is there a food vendor? Around here? Um, ma madam? Preemptively strike the elderly. L listen, you're making it sound as bad as it was, but also how dare you. Wow, what is happening over here? What's going- can I? Can't talk to you. Um, ignore. Ch oh, Jesus! Ign indignant intern really wants to fight. I am looking for food. I get. I guess I can just eat what I have. Um, I don't want to. I feel like it's a waste to use an elixir here. Fight the. I can't. Can't kick the police. I mean, I could try. Uh. uh um. Uh, I'm looking at the map. I feel like there's gotta be. A food. Oh no, they don't. They. Oh, everyone wants to fight me. Shit. No. Oh my god. Oh, there's. Oh no. Oh god, in the back. This is bad. This is a little bit bad. They got me. Pressing backward is. That's how you block. Yeah. 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 Mm. Sorry, Master. He's fine. Everyone's so mean to me. <laughs> they put me all the way back here. Oof. Hey, Michael. Oh. Chinatown, head west down Main Street until you see a big gate that just screams Chinatown. Chinatown! You really can't miss it. It's right next to downtown, but... Oh, what with the gang activity and all, I'd suggest avoiding downtown and taking Main Street instead. Thanks, buddy. I'm gonna fight you! Uh, 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 yeah. <laughs> In the fucking back. Spinning bird kick. Yeah. Uh, shit. No. What are you? What are you doing? What are you throw? Are you throwing knives? Whose style is that? Shit. No. No. Yeah. Wait. Wait. Shit. Nah. Stop jumping! Chop him. There are no rules. I started this. <laughs> I know. I uppercut a man in the back and go, Why are you throwing knives at me? It's rude. Rude. 
Wait, okay, I need I need to go to the pizza vendor because I don't know where the hell else I can get food. I'm sure there's other places and I'm oblivious, but hey, shopkeeper biz. Welcome. Hi. I'm a takeout, please. Iron bar caramels, tough job breakers, and flight tickets. A single piece of paper is all you need to travel to another country. 800 money. No. Um, none of this replenishes my health, so you gotta come here to replenish your health. They have jelly donuts. This old, the old reliable, it's chewy goodness is irresistible to Metro City cops. Moist, but not too sweet. There's almost something stoic about it. Bagel. Around, starchy favorite. Great with cream cheese, lox, and everything in between. Um, give, give me that. Bagel consumed. Oh. Thank you. Nothing beats a jelly donut. Bagel. I will eat the bagel. Uh, there's gotta be a bus stop over here, right? That I, no, no, gentlemen. No, hey, you. Um, but bus, bus stops, bus. I would like to take the bus. So every time I die, I don't have to walk all the way back here. Yeah, so what what happens if you... Oh, I can talk to you. Officer Sawyer Briggs. Hey there. Nice mustache. Traffic restrictions lead to traffic jams, and the public never lets us hear the end of it. But in a world without restrictions, people get hurt or worse. A lot of good those complaints do then. And what if I... Spinning bird kick. Man's good at blocking, I'll give him that. I'm impressed. Can you save and respawn somewhere else? Uh, well, they said that the fast travel is with the bus stops, but I just don't know. All right, um, Lao Tang. Oh Greetings, young one. Did you choose to become Chun-Li's student after being captivated by her beauty? Oh, no need to worry. You'll get no judgment from me. Choosing teachers on a whim is perfectly fine. That said, putting your heart into studying under one master and honing their craft is an equally viable approach. In check what you're studying under by opening your device and selecting masters. This menu displays your bond points with each master, your rank in their stoil, as well as their profiles and information about their fighting technique. Oh. Um. Is, is, it, under, is it under status? Masters. Unless the legendary fires are trained under, you can view your channel ranks and your positive masters way to pursue perfection or single master play the field and the rest was up to you. Check the space to see if new okay, that's nice. You see if new conversations are available from here or if they have a new move to teach you. Oh god. I hope Gerard isn't trying to complete this game, because it seems like there's a lot in this video game. Uh I can add aerials, but I don't have any aerials. Cool. Red. Okay. Jard already completed it? What the fuck? The fuck? You, YouTube? Beer Bros got three weeks early? Three weeks? That is not a lot of time. The Completionist Street Fighter. Two days ago. What the fuck, Gerard? What the shit? Hey, real Oh, sorry. What on uh, Intarnation? He has a... His section on World Tour is only like five minutes long. Or like eight minutes. He has sections on World Tour Fighting Ground and Battle Hub. What the fuck? He need a break from trying to complete Tears of the Kingdom. I, then this is not a break. This is, It just seems like there's a fuck ton in here. Anyway, uh, let's fight. Get him! Built different. No kidding. Dude continues to impress. Yeah. Yeah. Just keep kicking. They can't get you if you just keep kicking. Shit. Fuck. No, he blocked it. Nope. Boom! Here you find the Chinese Mafia? How original. I know. They're really, they're really treading familiar ground in this one. Level 9.
Hey, Fen. Level 12! Oh, God. Sup? My name's Lee Fen. I guess I also count as one of uh, uh, Jeje's students. Doesn't Jeje mean sister? Is Lee Fen Chun Li's sister? My Mandarin is. Or my, my, my Chinese is extremely wrong and out of date. Yeah? Uh, that means big sister. Oh, rad. <laughs> Just so you know. Not that we're actually related. Oh, well, fuck. Adoptive sister. Okay, great. I was gonna call her mom. S stop. Calm down. I basically just hang out and soak up her coolness and her cash. Oh. Okay. Um. Okay, I don't have to fight her. Thank God. A former high-kicking ICPO agent, Chun Li looks after Lee Fen, a victim of the Black Moon incident. With Shadowloo sundered, she now runs kung fu classes and has become a well-loved member of the local community. Fighting style: Chinese kenpo. Chun Li took the Kenpo taught by her father and added kicks and energy attacks, creating a flowing freeform fighting style. Hello. Never again. Mom, stop. She's a sugar bit. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What's Mama Mandarin? Uh, I think it's just Mama. It's just Ma. Because I, I, I mean, maybe I'm misremembering. I just Ma means like eight different things depending on the tone. Because a Chinese, I don't know anything about Cantonese. I learned Mandarin. Um. But uh, and learned is uh, not put, putting it lightly. Um, but Chinese is a tonal language, so saying ma versus ma or ma are different words. So I think ma was one of them. It just is mama. Gotcha. Is that Laura Bailey? Is it? That's cool. Shadow kind of made seven black moons, almost destroyed the world, so that Bison could get an EX install. Yeah, I guess the, the, the everyone's just kind of chilling. Martial arts spinning bird kick. Uh, apparently that's this one. Have you had a chance to talk to other students and learn about apprentice, apprentin, apprenticing? It's Jenny Kwan. Ooh, nice. Oh, Laura Bailey voiced her in like five or something. That's so cool. I know you're currently trying to master my style, but I can't say for certain whether or not my techniques will be a good fit for you. Only you can discover the style that truly is yours. And the only time, I every time it cuts the camera. <laughs> He looks great. And the only time you can do that is in combat. There he is. <laughs> That's my fighter resident. Yep. Goodness, our new student our new student is serious about training, I see. Really now. Lee Fen. I wanna ask you. Uh, if it's alright with you, would you mind keeping an eye on Lee Fen for me? She's quite talented, but I fear she lacks direction. Seeing someone diligent like you might make might light a fire under her. I'll see what I can do. Hey, how you doing? Jizz is always nagging me about being on my computer all the time. I wish she'd get it through her head that I'm a white hat hacker. I'm not just watching FooTube all day on here. And I mean, it's not like I don't like training or anything. I'd love to get ripped like you guys. Oh, on that topic, there's been some guys causing trouble around here lately. They call themselves the Canary Crate Gang, I guess because they wear yellow cardboard boxes on their heads. Whatever the case, they've been attacking people at random. Uh, wow. If you're looking for an opportunity to test your skills, you could do that on them. What do you say to going over to their turf and taking them down a peg or two? Now that you're Chun-Li's student, you can use the Spinning Bird Kick Master Action, right? With that, you can spin your way into action against the Canary Crate Gang. They hang out over on the street to the west and wear yellow cardboard boxes. You can't miss them. Victor's about to take initiative, landing master action. Your opponent's ready to start a battle. The ties are right to in your favor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I got a blue die. Yeah, woo. All right. Yeah, I ran over here a little bit early. Everyone's just hanging. Were Chun Li's hips buffed? I mean, she's just kind of always had them proportions, right? Thighs for days. Yeah, blue. Yeah, blue. Yeah, blue. Yeah. Uh, let's get him. Hello. Don't fight me. Don't fight me. Get him. Spin. Sup thighs that can support a bridge. Oh, he was rather weak. Also, I am low on HP. This is dangerous. Uh, <laughs> every time he does a Chudley post. Part of me, part of me ascends to heaven whenever he poses. Who are you? Oh man, are we getting raided again? 
Yo, thanks for the raid, Canary Crate Gang. You just, you're just chilling now? Freaking typical. Could you quit rampaging around so much? It makes us feel like small fry, to be quite honest. Just mess him up. Keep going. Thank you. Hit him again. I did. Um. Hello. I'm gonna wait for Charlotte to stand clear of uh, Shang Zhao over here. Spin! <laughs> he couldn't finish his taunt. He's like, hey, and I just fucking zoom over and throw him to the ground. That's very satisfying. <laughs> Get him! Oh, banana again, girl. You have too many poop. We gotcha. Gotcha. Come on, we're just an up and coming gang that's trying its darndest to be a big deal around here. We. Why is everyone out here looking to ruin this for us? Don't you see how hard we're trying? That's right. I want to get stronger so I can start throwing my weight around. I just don't know where to start. Yeah, okay, kid. Yeah, okay, kid. No, I missed. Oh, God. Hip, ho, hop, hip, ho, hop, hop, hip, ho, hop. Hip, ho, hop, hip, wait. Wait, let me just let me just charge it up. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, let me just There we go. Boom. The Chun-Li style is sending me to space. It's fu it, it he's got the moves. What am I gonna do? Reality is a tough pill to swallow. Ain't a great look of people trying to make it as gangsters keep getting whooped by regular old city folks. Do I look like regular old city folks? <laughs> <laughs> it takes them like an hour to turn around. It's just incredible. My God. Uh, well, I, I guess. Oh, let's go up here. He climbs up ladders like a rat. Breaks signs using master actions. Uh, signs, boxes, and barrels. Any small object that has yellow shimmer to it can be destroyed. Doing so may cause items to drop from within them. Press the tap button along with R2 to perform master. You only perform master. You have enough drive. Yeah. Um. Hey man, how's it going? Jesus Christ. I got an energy drink! This really is just Yakuza. Hey there. Impressed? I, f I, I broke a sign up on the roof, and this guy is impressed. There you go. Take that for later. His shoulder's so fucking dis- Yeah, it's rough. It's rough out here. Uh... Spinning this game is absurd. Back at it again at the Krispy Kreme. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Uh, we give shape to your dreams. Urban Metro. The city of the future where you will live will be filled with dreams. Even on a day when the sound of raindrops are dancing in the air, you can't help but want to take a walk in the alleyways with your dog under a red umbrella. We will help you create such an ideal town. All right. Hey, Baldwo. Trigger pressure time three times. I don't know what pressure time is. Yeah. We wear these cardboard boxes on our heads to show the world just how serious we are about the, the gangster life. If that doesn't convince people that we mean business, nothing will. First to two battles. When encountering boss enemies stronger than your average opponent, you may need to fight in a best of three match. Your vitality will be fully replenished for these fights, and they're not over till you've won or lost two rounds. Take care not to throw in the towel early to start your celebrations ahead of schedule. Okay. When your opponent's body turns white during battle, that means they're vulnerable. Landing an attack during this time will inflict more damage than normal. And the time at which they become vulnerable depends on the opponent, often occurring before or after they perform certain actions. Remember, these timings can prove, prove useful for gaining the upper hand in battles. Okay. Yeah. Oh, shit. No. Kick. He dodged it! Kick. 
the shit. No, no. Get, get, get him. Get, get him. Got there in the end. One more. All the moves. This reminds me of a puzzle. Yeah, same. Shit. Think we can dodge? Whoa. Wait. Wait, 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 hold. Wait. There it is. Yeah, I do not have that rhythm down at all for the charge moves. It feels so slow to me. Ooh. I imagine it's easier in modern. You probably just tap a button and you do it, right? Whoa! Thank you, Arok. Thanks to you. I mean, I'm getting there. I appreciate the help and the patience. Yeah! Wait. Shit. Whoa! How did... Did my grab go through him? He's blocked! Sir. Take a Come on, fuck. Stop blocking so much. Or at least I can just fuck it. Stop it! <laughs> Got it. Hey, thank you. That. Mm-hmm. This sucks. Nice dashings. What's your deal, dipwad? Hey. His name's Kiryu. You a friend of that guy from earlier? Bosh or whatever? Hmm? Nani? Uh, came at us not so long ago, just like you're doing right now. I wish I could unlock that cardboard box hat. He dropped this card. Uh. Whoever that Bosh guy was, he squeezed us for info on Mad Gear. Mad Gear? And then bounced. You heard of them, right? They're one of the gangs in this town. Mad Dull Gear. Bosch wanted to know where they do business. I heard Mad Gear's in bed with some huge organization. Uh, Apparently, Bosch wants to swipe whatever cash is supposed to get passed around in the process. Hmm. Uh. So I told him, of course, if you want to get your ass killed, by all means, be my guest. Break a leg, maybe even a skull. If you're gunning after that fool, too, let me fill you in on a little something. The deal's gonna go down at night, in an alleyway on the south side of downtown. Huh. Why don't you swing by? Might even get to catch a glimpse of your pal's mangled corpse. Oh no. He looks nervous in the photo, he's probably a little camera shy. That's a very fun detail. Land well, normal attack on an opponent who has changed color with trigger pressure time. If you can land a special move, it'll take you one step further, you put him in his stunned state. Learn your own moves well, observe your opponent's movements, and aim for that perfect timing. Yeah, that sounds hard to do, though. I unlocked Boston glasses. Chapter 3 unlock. Wait until nightfall in the hangout. Hmm. Why don't, do I have Chun-Li's number yet? Uh, just asking for a friend. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Get missions. Set, set. Oh, God. So I can... I see. I see. Okay. Yes, yeah, fine. And, um, oh god, there's many. Good. Just say mama. Could just say mama. Uh, he gives the best hugs. Something. Don't know if I can. How am I supposed to break that? Spinning bird kick. I can't turn while I'm doing that. Damn it. When you're shaped like a fridge, you can hug anything. Bottomless hugs. Listen. Now available at... <laughs> it's like... Chili's. Like, welcome to Olive Garden. Do you want to try our bottomless hugs? Uh, those who practice a martial art to find its meaning. Many people finally gain self-confidence as they train, but that confidence could also end up putting you in danger. 
Some have even lost their lives because they got overconfident after just learning the basics. Wouldn't be me. Did anything like that ever happen to me? No. Martial arts have definitely been a positive in my life. Now then. But for you, what role would they serve? That's something you have to figure out for yourself. Oh, yes. You have a phone, right? Let's exchange... Just... Just... just. Let's exchange contact. Yeah, sure. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, it's fine. Let's see. Just press this here and... Okay, there you go. There we go. Looks like you've been at it. <laughs> I'll message you if anything interesting comes up. Nice. Another lovely day. Are you getting used to my fighting style? In that case, let me teach you a new technique. Kokosho slash aerial Kokosho. Double quarter circle forward. Uh, light punch. Create a mass of energy directly in front of you at swift speed and invulnerability can quickly turn the tables on an opponent. Fires a mass of energy diagonally beneath you while jumping, making it useful to create combos from jumping attacks. Hmm. Super art! Oh, it was a super art. That's why it's a double course circle. Okay. Super arts are powerful. Special moves that can be performed in battle by consuming the gauge at the bottom of the screen. There are several levels of super art. The amount of gauge consumed when using them differs depending on that level. The gauge fills when landing attacks on your opponent. So whittle away at your enemy, look for an opening, and hit him with your powerful super. Execution of super arts differs depending on your control scheme. If modern, it's uh, special and heavy at the same time. Classic and mythical man for that move. Which is, of course, you go forward twice. Once you have the gauge for it, give it a whirl. A whirly swirly. Studying under multiple legendary fires will grant you access to multiple super arts. You can only use so many at once. Choose what super arts you want to use by navigating your status. And so, uh, number showing the skills upright gives a general idea of the damage output, etc. Listen. Preparation before battle is key. Never forget this. Just so you know. This city's filled with all sorts of people, young and old. My students are no different. Young children and the elderly alike train under me. You probably think young men with hulking physiques are the epitome of strength, right? Yeah, sounds about right. I think that's something that Kiryu would say. That's certainly not an uncommon view. Youth and physical size can give you an advantage in a fight, absolutely. But in the pursuit of strength, age, gender, and size are barely factors at all. This is especially true in Chinese Kenpo. Whoa! Two, two up? Yes? This hairstyle? I usually have it like this when I'm here, actually. However, in the past, I just let it grow out, though. By the way. I don't have any particularly strong preferences, but I do enjoy some variation in styling. Braiding it, tying it this way, and that variety is the spice of life, after all. Why not try changing up your look if you get the chance? It may give you a whole new perspective on life. Chun-Li is now more likely to pose in photo mode. What? Huh? Like this? Ma'am? Uh... How does... Huh? She's 55? What the fuck? Hello. Ma'am. Kiryu's so happy to be here. How do you... Change NPC poses. Oh, that's... Oh! Oh, uh, it's random. That's very fun. Let her go! Whoa, 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 whoa. Those shoulders, yeah, right? Where? Oh. I understand it'd probably be too complicated UI-wise to, like, select them. But you can see I'm hit. Oh, shit. This oh, oh, ma'am. Oh, God. <sighs> this is very strange. <laughs> Does it work in selfie mode? Sure seems to. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Done. <laughs> He's so fucking wide. You can't even take selfies with him. Just blocks everything. All right. All right. Sure is there. Kind of. Hey. Your skills are coming. That's very cute, though, that the friendlier you get with them, the more poses they have when you do that. That's fun. Street wider. Your skills are coming along, I trust. Care to test them against me? No, no, no ma'am, ma'am. Make sure you're well and truly ready. I, hold on. I, do I got perks? These skills are not necessarily always beneficial. Some of those we should for. Yeah. Okay. Drive regen boost versus nothing with the gloves. Here you can wear glasses, right? Why not? 
So I do have that equipped. Um, new interactions available. Got it. And then how do I... From, from this. Gotcha. So I can quickly go to the camera. Okay. And you can change what those are. That's sweet. Wow. All right. Let's get my fucking ass handed to me. Let's go. All right, then. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. No. No. Ma'am, ma'am. Shish at me? Jesus. Shish means thank you. Feels very condescending after doing one pixel of damage against her. You're welcome. It should have been me. <laughs> Defeat is the most valuable teacher. Continue to prove yourself, I'll face you once more. Okay. Now then. Best be focused on your kung fu for now. Kung fu refers to strength cultivated through practice. Listen. Your kung fu is lacking. Heard that one before, have you? Okay, I think that's all for gift. Oh no, it's a dating game. Oh no, it's a dating sim. Oh no, I'm gonna give Chun Li her favorite present every day. Hi, Alice. Howdy. Howdy. Sounds like you had no trouble meeting up with Chun Li. Well, buckle up, because now it's Alice time. I know you're trying to get stronger. I cooked up a special lesson plan for you. <laughs> special but simple. Just complete the objectives I give you while you're in a fight. Piece of cake, right? When you're all prepped and ready to go, just say the word. Submissions separate from the main story can be separate from the main story can be identified by their green icons. Some rewards can only be obtained through submissions and may be worth putting the main story on hold to engage with diversions from time to time. Mission accepted from Alice. Howdy! Your objective, knock down your opponent. Getting a knockdown is, well, it's exactly what it sounds like. It's all about knocking your opponent off their feet. And opponents can't do any attacks once they're down, giving you the advantage. Try out a different moves and figure out which one's knocked down. A crouching heavy kick is always a great place to start. Well? Ready to give it a shot? Yeah. She looks like she's following a cotton candy machine? Yeah. That is a very high low kick. It's basically kicking her torso. I'll just about do it for this one. I'll have another assignment for you next time we meet. You better be looking forward to it. It'd be nice if it, like, after the little mini game submission cuts back to her and she just has just cuts and scrapes all over her face from being knocked down repeatedly. She's like, wow, great job. Who's texting me? Luke! Looking to kill time till sundown? City's not the friendliest place at night, just FYI. Def can't recommend wandering around like everything is rainbows and gumdrops. But if you're absolutely gotta, there's an apartment over at Beat Square. You can use it as a hangout if you want. Buckler owns the place. It's kind of like a rest stop. Pretty damn good place to pass the time. Luke says swear. And the perfect home base if you're on the road. Thanks, Luke. He is just looking up at the majesty. Alright. Hit the road. Aw, oh, I don't move with cars. Oh. Ma'am? Hey. Well, well, haven't seen you around here before. Are you a martial artist? Are you Chun-Li? I've been looking all over the city for you. I can tell just by looking at you. You got this look about you. The look of someone determined to get stronger. Hey. Oh, that's right. Let me fill you in on a little something. Have you ever received an item or two after a fight? As a matter of fact, you can get all manner of interesting items by meeting specific conditions during a fight. Mm -hmm. Sort of like a reward for putting in the extra effort, I suppose. Keep that in mind, I'm sure it'll come in handy if you're trying to buff up. Each opponent has their own set of victory conditions called drop locks. Winning the battle with these conditions will grant you the associated reward. If you want any specific rewards, pay close attention to the conditions and adjust your approach to match. Items can be obtained via drop locks or shown at the start of battles. Press options during battle to view drop lock conditions and their associated rewards. Opponents with a treasure box icon displayed above their heads possess rare rewards. Check the drop lock conditions, see if you can take the prize. What do you have? Defeat her for red dye. Made out of her blood? Sounds good. 
should you find yourself in a fight against an opponent you don't stack up to, you can attempt to escape. They'll start a timer over your avatar's head. Running down this timer without being defeated will result in a successful escape. They will not receive any rewards, and there may be battles where escape isn't an option. I am not running. The guy in the background's like, oh shit, let's go. It's fight time. Stop, stop, stop it. No. Get it, yeah! Ow, fuck. No, no. Shit. Damn it. <laughs> the fuck? I got greedy because she's only missing a pixel. If your vitality is running well, you can top your meter up at an eatery. Best shortcut to becoming stronger is to cut down the number of times you get knocked out. Thanks. Rise nuts. He's so dramatic when he dies in Chun Li mode. To win, don't lose. Yeah, thanks, game. Um, uh. Hey, Bernard. <laughs> it just, it doesn't get old to me. Just walking up to some poor guy and uppercutting his spine. Got him. He's on vacation. <laughs> yeah, woo. So, uh, wait. Oh. See you later. Nice meeting you. Um, learning in the city. Uh. Meet Allison once more. Okay, I gotta find her again later on. Three days from retirement. That's the map. The map can be used to view the positions of the following. Main player, you. Main mission, destination, submission, legendary fighters are four. That's the star. Part-time jobs are uh, uh, the little the clock thing. Uh, clothing shops are clothing. General stores and eateries are the shopping. Body shops is the guy. Fast travel points is the nine, which is the arrow. Okay. It looks like the same arrow as the player. That's a little bit weird. Stri a triangle will bring up the list of fast travel points. Uh, right stick place a pin. And use different pin colors to mark up to 20 locations. You can change what information is so shown with L and R1. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, the shit. We have part-time jobs available. I, I, I kind of... I do kind of want to see... What a part-time job in this game is. What that means. Is that this way? Am I going the right way? Yeah, down the street. Just chilling. Delivering pizza. Three square meals a day. How about three round meals? Pizza in the morning, evening, and supper time. I like you, Sir Bello. If you're as into pizza as we are, would you perhaps be interested in making pizza yourself? It's up to us to turn pizza dreams into pizza realities. Sure, there's a little technique involved, but the better you do, the better the tips. So you ready to make some pizza? Talk to a resident in an area marked with a Z icon and work part-time jobs. Z icon? Where is this Z icon? Uh, receive Zenny based on your performance. Uh... Oh, I thought that was a clock, but that is a little Zenny coin. I see. Part-time jobs can be worked as many times as you like, making them a great way to fill your wallet when Zenny's running low. Plus, hey, Sadie. This is Yakuza. This isn't real estate. That's later. We gotta meet Nugget first. You'll receive an item as a reward the first time you beat a certain score. Once you got the item and progress the story a little, new part-time job difficulty levels will become available. Yeah, I wanna help All you right. make pizzas. Time to work that dough. Ready, set, pizza. Perform commands. Oh my god. Enter the commands shown. Follow the icons from left to right. The white arrow gives a hint on how to move. Yeah, it's showing like, just do like a quarter circle. Get stars by performing commands flawlessly. More stars means a bigger reward. This is excellent. Time remaining completed. Score command. Yep. Hado pizza. Hado pizza. Hado can excuse you. Uh... Oh shit, it was a circle. No! Viva Hado 
pizza. <laughs> Good. This is a good game, guys. This is pretty good. Uh, I'm good. I'll do that again later. Viva Hotel Pizza! Yeah, I can play it on a harder difficult. Okay, we're done. Welcome. That. New orders waiting. Yes. All right. I just, I just need to. I just need to. I just need to. Um. Yep. Yeah, that's just. You know what it is, chat. You already know. Don't even pretend you don't know what I'm queuing up. Uh, enter the command zone. Yeah. Let's go into normal. Is it any different? 30 seconds. More commands for a bigger reward. More stars. Means more better. If you want to score big, you need speed and precision. For something like this, imagine sliding your finger. Focus on the first and last input. Keep your finger on the controls. Don't take it off and then tap it and take it off and tap it. You just slide. Yeah, okay. Pizza. Ready, get set, uh, shit. Shit. What do you mean, no? I got it. That was fun. Boy, oh, I got an energy drink. Mm. Nice. Viva Hado Pizza. Oh, give me the pizza. I gotta fight the pizza man. That was pretty good timing. <laughs> Buongiorno. Welcome. Life is like a pizza toppings. No, I'm good. Thank you. See you later, bud. Good chat. Boy, howdy. This game's good. Bruises and band-aids. I know, that's the only thing. Uh, huh? Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Is that your drone? No, you're just taking selfies. Where the fuck did it go? I wanted to punch it out of the sky. What the shit? Okay. Hold on. Eh, eh. Meh. Energy drink. Good. Um buru 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 Hi Tracy Hey ya Hey ya Those box wearing bullies aren't as nice as us now are they That's why you need a special lesson or two to make sure you're tough enough to take them down It's simple stuff I give you missions and you clear them when you get into fights When you're ready let me know Might be time for some cat ears uh, might be your task is watch for an opening to throw your opponent. When an opponent is exceptionally good at defending, normal attacks won't do a speck of damage, right? If a strike won't work, what can you do? The answer is throw. You probably guess this means nothing but throws are going to take me down today. Give it your best shot. Hey. How about it? I'll get you. Only throws. Well, this is fun. Heavy. 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 Heavy.
Guy in the back is loving this. Yeah, throw him again! Woo! Evil moment 69! <laughs> My god, he just keeps throwing him. Nice. They knocked it out of the park. Let's call it there for now. Thanks. Ooh. This is some of my blood. Use it to stain your clothes. I'll have another mission cooked up for you next time. Bye. He's gone. I guess he was a ghost after all. Um, what the hell? What the? Whoa. What is that? Hey, Kit Kat. Hey, Dawn. Why is Yakuza 2D? Try something different this time around. Hope you're doing good, Kit Kat. Uh, uh, style. Drip and style. All right. Okay. Um. Sure, sure could. Super art gauge gain boost. Drive gauge regen. I mean, the regen cut is small. And it does make me look like a kitty cat. Here, you say me out. God damn it. Jesus Christ. Oh, he's so very, very wide. Oh, uh, oh, the pants. Hmm. Don't show me your butt, sir. Uh, eh. I don't want to double down on this temperamental situation. Or is that? That's just what my current stats are. That is that not? No, that is caused by my accessory. Okay, that is what I thought. Hmm. Green shirt for the shaggy aesthetics. Ow! Oh. Oh, I don't... I don't know about that. Uh... Ooh. Onsta's fridge. Perks. Where, where does it say perks per... There it is. So is that... Okay, so then that... Hey, I see. Oh, I don't want to turn him into shaggy. I do, I do like business, business serious. They'll be great when we get into real estate later on. That's pretty good. Oh shit. Sir, I'm a business cap boy. <laughs> Sir. Business cat boy. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Now all we need is a chicken. And maybe pants that aren't sweatpants. Shit. Welcome. Hi. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Those are higher defense. Business casual. Tapered pants. We got any business shoes? What kind of business shoes you got? Kick strength. So these have the big, biggest kick. But they're also the fucking boots. These look great. These look excellent. There we go. Alright. Great. Perfect. Great in that. Business casual carrier is ready to punch a man. That shirt is painted on. Hey, Nathan. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Hey, well, you have, you have a treasure. Uh, hit with two overhead attacks. All right. Wait. Hold on. Wait. Stop jumping. Stop jumping. There we go. Yeah, he's kind of turned the center arm strong a little bit. A card dropped by a fighter used to gamble with maybe doesn't seem like it's worth much on its own. Oh. Okay. Well. Shall we wait for nightfall? Nano machine, son. <laughs> Got a minute? Who's talking to me? Hi there. Hi. Hi. Uh, influencer. What's up, influencer? Coming at you. Footuber at large. Can I take back all the nice things I said about this game? When you when caps lock is on, but you hold shift to capitalize anyway. So when it's lowercase, all caps. Just curious. Or that's the plan. I'm just starting out. 
That fight you had on the rooftops in Chinatown earlier was off the chain! That's what they call an all-timer. If it's cool with you, mind if I use footage of the fight for a video I'm making? Please don't. Come on, dog, do it for the views! Please don't. Come on, dog! For the views? No. Come on, buddy, for the vine! Thank you. Diggity, we doing this, info freaks! Is it too late to say no again? He got something on tonight, like tonight? Stand back, info freaks, we got a badass here! For real though, you look like you're only getting stronger. Somebody tells me my audience will eat that right up. He's gonna do it anyway. Foo Fighters content creators. Yeah. Cool, mind if I borrow your phone so I can plug in my contact eats? No. No, Chun Li touched this phone. Don't touch it. Why do don't touch my phone? And stun. So, still getting the hang of things around the city. No problemo. I'll tell you everything there is to know. So, the title of today's video is. Extreme Foodtuber meets Extreme Fighter? Gone sexual. What's up, Info Freaks? Can I punch him? I want to punch him. Yo! Well, he's sending me stickers. I just had to message you. The first time I saw you, I got goosebumps, like, for real. Like, there's 0% chance you don't end up famous. And just like, for the record, I was your very first fan, alright? I got here before you blew up. Nani? Kiryu, do you have non-business contacts on your business nya phone? No. I don't believe you. You change time of day of passing time in a hangout. People you see out about changes depending on time of day. During the day, you see lots of people walk in the streets. At night, you encounter more enemies who will attack you on sight. Great. Can I block him? Yes, can I block him? Oh, yeah. You've been making sure to check out shops? You bought those caps with Bosch, right? Do more of that. Kind of goes without saying, but each store sells different stuff. They even get new inventory from time to time. Poke your head occasionally and you might find some new gear to make you stronger. So basically, train's about more than just hitting the gym day after day. Food for thought. Thanks, Luke. Saying I should go back to the store? See what they have now? It's Alice again. Bow. Bow. Uh, everything looks the same. Thanks, Luke. You lied to me. Please come again. Is there another shop? What about... Was that the switch snap sound effect? Hi. You just got the same shit. Different day. Same day. Give me some pizza! Eh, eh, eh. Wait, Corkwood, 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 Corkwood. There it is. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. Got. I want to find Nugget. Nugget's a Street Fighter character, right? Like, between all the Street Fighters, there's a guy that's literally just a small chicken. Normal, normal chicken. Gary? Sir? Alice! Howdy! Hey there! Welcome to Metro City Nightlife. Plenty of rough and rowdy types rolling around at this hour. All the better for finding some fights. Stay sharp, but don't push your luck. I know you want to improve ASAP, but fighting recklessly is not the way to go. Wouldn't want to get laid out and get let all that training go to waste, would you? Without further ado, class is now in session. When you're all prepped and ready to go, say the word. Let's boogie. Your com objective, land combos from a jump attack. Ever land a string of hits, one after the other? That, my punchy friend, is a combo. Once the first hit lands, your opponent can't block the rest, giving you the edge. I want you to practice landing combos from jump attacks. Jump, hit on the way down, hit again as soon as you land. Try to land the jumping attacks as late as possible. Well? Ready to give it a shot, Oki. Hey, shit. Hit. Ow. You don't need a hit back, ma'am. Good. Right on, here you do it. That'll just about do it. Uh, we were saying about Nugget. There he is. He's fossilized inside of there. You could sell this for money. I. Why would I sell it? He's my friend. 
I'll have another assignment for you next time we meet. You better be looking forward to it. He's in there. If you hold up to your ear, you can hear the clucking. Meet with the Mad Gear Gang. Where is this, this, this way? That's this way. Let's go. Oh shit. They are dancing over there. Okay, that guy is wearing business and he's walking. Charles, he's fine. So as long as you walk and pretend you're all about business, and I don't meow, you should be good. I, like the way you move. I didn't meow, I didn't meow! Shit! Fight. Ow. Ow. Check out my moves. <laughs> they just don't know what to do with this. They're scared of me. Mia. Ow. How dare you? Come at me. Fight me if you dare. Spinning bird kick. Yeah. Got it. Flawless. Flawless strategy. Chun Li's kudos have reached the required amount. Hair buns or bust. Is that can I, can I talk to her again? Is that the well? Oh. No, I'm good. Hold on. Level 16. Shit. No, I'm good. No. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus. Run. 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 May I? May I? How do I run? Start photo mode. Oh, God. During the fight. Um, Escape. Please. 15 seconds. Oh, shit. Am I escaping? Is it is it happening? Yeah, there's a timer above me, you know. Ow. Goodbye! See ya. Yeah. Spinning bird kick. No, don't bingo. Don't say bingo. She's not here at night. Board breaker? If you're looking to break boards, you came to the right place. No need to fear, it's all for a bit of fun. Boards will come in from every direction. It's up to you to break them, just like in a kung fu movie. Perform a style, and I'll reward you handsomely. Shall we begin? Let's close to winning. I mean, they when they hit me, it did a lot of damage, so... We're not risk it right now. Take it away! Break ten boards within the time limit. Mm-hmm. Just... Okay. Sure. Kung fu. Oh my god, the film grain. Shit. Uh, shit. Uh, wait, shit. Fuck. Wait, get- fuck it. Turn around! Fucking get- get the fucking board! What are you doing? You're facing the wrong way! Fuck. You got- you got any more? Get- just fuck it. Nailed it. Almost 69 seconds. That went great. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No. No. First try. Yeah, I play Kung Fu Target on new difficulty. Sweet. Um, where am I? Where am I? I'm going this way. Shit. Uh, let's uh, uh map. I sure went the right way. Uh, fast show. That's that's really the only fast show I still have. Yeah. Bring me back. I'm back. Okay. Over here. Oh, hi. You're wide boy. Yeah, I'm Kiryu. Business casual. Kazuma Kiryu. Oh. New Yakuza came out. Did you know that? You got some hat? Yeah, right. How you doing, Michael? I don't know what day it is. Shit. I, same. I just got back from GDQ yesterday. I just got back from Europe after a month. Oh, that's right. Ah, uh, fuck. Everyone wants to fight me in this game. Oh, that guy's name is Sketchy. And he's living up to his name. Should I punch this man? Absolutely. Alright, hey, check this out. 
I know. You can fight any. I mean, these guys are gang members, but you can fight anyone in this game. It's great. So it's just like real life. Just like real life. Yeah. Get. Get him. Get him. Uh, right now I'm fighting in Chun Li style, which is why he's so graceful. How's the donut? Look, what, at, look at the moves. He's got good moves. Oh my gosh, that shoulder gesture is. Mm-hmm. I can. Top tier. Mm. Shit! I'm... Fuck! Very angry. Oh. Ladder boys. Hold up there, Buster. This is Mad Gear Turf. They wear boxes on their heads. Mm -hmm. Quick Bean Daddy, sucker punch Barry, get the preemptive strike. <laughs> Just a. <laughs> yeah. If you ain't got business, punch yourself in the opposite direction and get lost. You do have business. Yeah, that's where I'm wearing my business casual clothing. Like I care, shove off. Rude. Oh, we're fighting. Check this out, check this out, check this out. Spinning bird kick. Now, wait. About what you've done with your character. Sure. Is you in real life mm -hmm. can do all of those things. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. That spinning bird kick I've seen you do. It's like your signature move on the dance floor at wedding. Yeah. Oh, yeah. When, when, when the YMCA hits the stage. Mm-hmm. I'm just spinning. Can't stop me. An unstoppable force. Trigger pressure time. I don't know how to trigger pressure. I mean, they told me how to trigger pressure time, but I'm bad at it, so. It's not gonna. Yeah. Oh. Get him. Get him. Get some of the bullets. Right? Wow. I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. Oh. Oh, right in the bind loins. No, stop. He's get out of here. I'll leave you to it. Hey, thanks. And maybe uh, I sent you a thing. We got you on a list. I'm on. Damn it. In a bad way? No, in a good way. And I know, like. I mean, this probably has me on a list, so. Jews historically. Just, like, not necessarily thanks, Mike. <laughs> Doing here of all we get nervous when we hear the word list. Um, no, Found them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks, bud. Uh -huh. Get you later. Oh, oh no, oh, purse. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Goodbye. We're fighting. You get that thing I sent you? Chun Li's kuda. Why Chun Li like that? <laughs> Thank you, Chun Li. No, wait. No, stop. Hold on. I'm trying to do my thing. There it is. I don't know you. We get our affection level chummy up. It's she just like got a tweet like Kiryu's fighting a man. She's like. Like, <laughs> we've both gotten a lot stronger. Our coach was right. If we stuck together, it really could have been something. I'm really sorry. I still have something important I need to do. Nice. Nice. Oh no. Damn it. No time to explain. Hey, you. Stay away from me. Got it? You didn't see me. Just get out of here. Hey, you ugly. Over here. Stand back here. <laughs> Thanks for your big one. Hey, punk. You know that guy? You got something going on with him? Mm, uh. <laughs> Man, whatever. That guy was carrying a bag that looks like this, right? Right? This is uh. very valuable. It belongs to us. He just stole it. Uh? So you're gonna tell your buddy to bring it back safe and sound. If you don't know him, then you're gonna have to do us a favor. Uh. You get me? I want you to find that guy and give us back what's ours. I really don't give a shit if you two were friends oh, or not. We language! Want back and we want it Kiryu now. can't hear that language. Done, or you're pink slot. 
Mm -hmm. Get your stupid ass moving. You understand? You ain't gonna have a moment of peace in this city until we get that bag back. Huh. Oh, well. Obtain title wearing a Chinese dress. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Oh, she gave me a jawbreaker. That's nice of her. Mad Gear Alyssa. Hello. Listen up, punk. Is someone trying to fight me off screen to the left? Do you find that stinking bag and bring it straight to me, you hear? Do that, I'll consider letting you keep at least one of your kneecaps. Sound good? Well, that's very nice of you. Whoa, hey, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, the, okay, well. See you later. No, 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 no. No, I don't want to talk to the influencer. Just make it a day. Just make it a day. She's from Final Fight 2? Oh. What'd she look like in Final Fight 2? Uh, uh, Final Fight. Uh, 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 Eli- Oh, it was Eliza. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh. Eliza and Mary are two of them. This is one of the sprites. She has shorter. Gotcha. That's cute. She had less clothes back then. As did we all. Thanks for the hydrate. Um, so maybe, maybe, maybe it's a good time to get caught up on alerts because there's been a few of those. Give me a sec here. What the hell? What is that noise? Is it just... I got 10 miles from doing that. Anyway. Um... Oh. Pardon. Oh, uh, where did I leave off? Uh, World Peace Villain. Thanks for 8 months. 1 month's berry. 7 months is streaming. Smash Man, thanks for 69 bits. Extra thick Kiryu. Amphi, thanks for 69 bits. Kiryu's cake counts as a weapon for heat moves. Blue Abomination, thanks for 25 months. Who's honking at me? Oh, fair. Uh, Smash Man, thanks for 10 bits. Don't want my... Uh, don't, uh, the, 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 don't want to take away from the Capcom developed Yakuza game, but I got a notification of Pepino Plus. He's a restocked fan gamer. Uh, so just y'all get one when you can. Back to Kiryu Body Horror. It, it's, it's a body gift. This man's body's a gift. Beauty thanks for 34 months. Taking a break from my Tears of the Kingdom. Self-torture to watch for a while. 99.95% I'm going insane trying to find the last thing I need. Koroks were the easy part, lol. These bodies are biblically accurate. Uh, Jammy Jess, thanks for 100 bits. What a day to be gay. Bara. Happy Pride to Barry in chat. Happy Pride. Midnight Sky, thanks for 14 months. BLJ Wall, thanks for 40 months. Polarish Bear, thanks for... Thanks for a tier 2 in 39 months. Her 39 is the new 27. You heard correctly. Oh, yeah, he's got a stretch. Public key reveal party, thanks for 14 months. Wide lad alert. Steel Meister, thanks for 22 months. Fight me. Crowds, 43. I thought he was done. Dequel, thanks for 55 months. Ludological, thanks for 11. Barry. I know cute chat says it all the time, but I really appreciate your stream slash work. I just graduated summa cum laude. And that ordeal wouldn't have been nearly as bearable without all your content keeping me sane. Keep being a cool Kringus and punch people real good. Okay, back to Vodley now. Goodbye. Ludo. Congrats on that accomplishment. That's amazing. Uh, thank you. Bear bearable. Bearable. Thank you for, so much for all the months of support. Thank you very much for the kind words. And congrats to you. Captain Shrike, thanks for 42 months of doki to you. Sick as a dog, and yet I get to watch Barry come back from the raddest SGDQ. Good to see you back in one piece, Baz. Little Sparrow says, Baba Mabudi. You're raising a poet. Thank you. Fluffy Snowfall, thanks for 38 months. Wow, Barry, that is quite the triangle, man. Thank you. I mean, it's just his model from... Um, this is from, from Yakuza 0. His model. It looks a little bit younger. You know, you can tell. Uh, Reb, thank you for the raid earlier. Hope you had a great stream. Little Birdie, thanks for 54 months. Enjoy your card key. Barry, would you like some candy? Yes, please. LJ Right Home, thanks for 35. Smart Massar, thanks for 13. Bees, 13 berries. Spark of Light, thanks for 27. Aeroc, thanks for 52. What am I watching? Uh, Yakuza. Like a Dragon. Psychohexane, thanks for 30 months. Enjoy your Doki. 
I've escaped. No, that's a uh, outhouse key. Ah, dope key. Thank you. Enjoy your outhouse key. I've escaped from the Zelda mines. Congrats. I'm very much still in there. I briefly ducked my head out for GDQ. I'll be back into it soon, I'm sure. Like a dragon punch. There it is. There it is. That's good. That's good. Thank you, Psycho. Mr. Teriyaki, thanks for 63. Thanks for 63 months. The Mr. Raw, thanks for four. Sadie, thanks for four years. Show your key card. And a tier two. It's been four years. Let's celebrate with pizza. Thank you. Yeah, nice. Night, right? I got five miles for doing that. Wasn't even a green light. Everyone else is waiting. Uh, TFK Wall, thank you. We're making pizzas with our fists. We sure are. The other Joshua, thanks for. So all traffic stops when you step into the road? In both directions. It's not just like one car stops. That's a lot. Hey, you doing? I can't get up on there. Eh. I have to like. Work my way up there. Oh, I'm out of draw. Oh. Boy, it takes a while to recharge your drive. Uh, it's because he's so. Yeah. Yeah. They, they see him stepping off the sidewalk, and then. They, they see him step off the sidewalk, and they're like, oh, I guess the parade is starting. Do you realize there was a parade today? Um, the other Joshua, thanks for three months. Enjoy your silver key. Dr. Verbs, thanks for 20 months. Howdy from Japan. I can confirm that random combat encounters with roving groups of sunglasses wearing hooligans are very common here. Agent Honeygan, thanks for 26. Your streams are always a bright spot of my day. Thanks for the good vibes. Thank you. It was very kind of say. Hero, thanks for five months. I will never wash this phone again. Moonless Dark Relics for a year and a half. Oh, neat. It's baby two time. Uh, how about Pure Bone? It's a good name for a baby. I made it. I made it onto the... What? What? A gentleman? That is snug. That is, that is, uh, pick a lane. My God. Which one of you are the asshole here? Uh, it seems that city planning is the asshole because you're both within your lanes. They're friends. It, it's, when two buses love each other very much, uh, they make one of those really long conjoined buses with like the connector bits that bend. That's when they... Never mind. Raven Penguin, thanks for 69 bits. Senator Armstrong is in Street Fighter. Here he is. Senator Mnastrom. Uh, same touch button, thanks for 48 bits. Gotta head off. Really miss these barrel streams. Have my remainder bits. Thank you. Have a good one. Banjo Fan, thanks for 23. Please get out of the street. I'm stuck in traffic three rows back and I'm falling asleep. Just, hey! Hey, you! Get off the bus so I can get home! Yeah! Wide man! On the bus! Double-decker buses? Are, when two buses are really good friends. One decay, thanks for 27 months. Why are you fighting these streets? What did they ever do to you? I mean, look at them. Look at the absolute texture work on them. If only I could punch the ground. Then I would. Uh, alright. What am I... How many M70 bus... That's the only bus they need. Because... Not gonna do anything about that, huh? Also, I don't know if those shoes are standard issue for police officers. Those just look like some nice loafers you got. I mean, they are nice, but. Goodbye. Bye. Mmm. I'm in the market for a JPEG of a chair. Do I unlock an apartment I can customize? And can I buy a JPEG of a chair? Because, uh, that's what this game is lacking, I think, at this moment. It has everything else. It is quite crunchy. It's a pretty crunchy chair. Geek Squad is <laughs> cop. Loafers, former gophers. Do I look like I know what a JPEG is? Hi, Officer Tyrone Reed. Hi, Officer uh, Billy Kid. Oh, shit, they're dancing. Yeah, look at them go. What? 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 
I'm just walking here. Oh, they're walking towards me. Uh, hey there. What is it? No, it's fine. Um, uh, the indifferent cat. Thanks for soup. I am predominantly listening to stream it, even though we keep memeing on it. Every time I look back at stream, I'm taken aback by the sheer width. Yeah, it's. It's how you know it's a good design, because every now and then, even watching it, you get used to it, and then the novelty hits you again every now and then. It's just like, my god, he's wide. If your friend was looking to get away from the Mad Gear gang, you may have gone to Chinatown. The Canary Crate gang that hangs out there could barely hurt a fly, but they're enemies of Mad Gear at least. Oh. Huh? huh? Looking for someone, are you? Got a picture? So this is him, huh? Hmm. Well, I got some good news and some bad news. But the good news is there's nobody that looks like him in our morgue at the station. Thanks, Officer Reed. The bad news is I haven't seen anybody that looks like him anywhere else either. Let's go! Let's fucking go! I tried the spinning bird kick. Hit him with the super. Yeah. Boom. It's not a crime if you win. <laughs> uh, it's probably a crime regardless. <laughs> he was invited to the cookout. Uh, why does he have a yell? Oh, so, uh, the, the green is because they're, like, weaker than me. Uh, yellow's around my level. Okay, I didn't even notice that there were different colors for the level. Uh, there's someone else to talk to over this way. Don't fight me, don't fight me, don't fight me, don't fight me, don't fight me. I think I want to switch back to Luke style. I mean, it's probably just because I played a ton of them in the demo. Rather, that's all I played in the demo, but... It's just, uh... You know, is it better without the hat? Oh. I mean, I am getting, you know, a couple points in a punch strength and defense, but man. Man. Mm. Shit, he looks good. Oh, is this what I was trying to get up before and then lady showed up? This sucks. Spinning bird kick. Spinning bird kick. Fashion over stats. Something on my face. No, I'm not even looking at you, ma'am. Oh, Wendy's. Let me go to Wendy's. Is there a Don Quixote here? In this part of town? Wait, Chun Li had something new for me, didn't she? Is she is she here? There she is. Ma'am. Listen. Hi. Street fighting isn't like participating in a tournament. You never know how many people might join in. If you find yourself against the wall, you can always call for help, including mine if you so desire. Fucking Wendy's. You know, fight alongside your master. If you call them upon them in battle, they will join the fray? Is this Marvel versus Capcom now? What is the hell? What? What? In exchange for all of your SA gauge, your master will join the fight alongside you for a limited time. Masters are available to help you with battle will be displayed at the bottom of the screen. After a master is fought with you, they will not be available again for a period of time. De deepening your bond with masters will grant more opportunities to fight alongside them. Okay. I fucking wish. Mommy's gonna protect us. Great. That's why. I... Okay. Shit. Yeah, I did get her up to rank five. That bond is five out of a hundred. That's huge. We may be pupil and master, but there's no need to be shy. I prefer to keep things casual. This is going really well. If you want to chat about anything fun, don't hold back. Now then. Best if you focus on your kung fu for now. Kung fu is strength cultivated through practice. Oh, well. Um, do you want any energy drinks? Okay. I'll go now. I gotta go up there. How do I get up there? Uh, is there like a ladder? Um... Hmm. Fun like snapping? <laughs> uh, can you snap me in half like a Slim Jim? Perhaps here. Street Fighter Dingston, please? That's what this is. Pounch! Oh! 
money. Eight zenny. I did thought that say that said zero for a brief second. Sir, get sir, get down from there. What are you doing up there? You're breaking all the goddamn signs. What are you doing? What are you doing, sir? Shit. Thought I had a, a meter. Eh. You like a cat? Yeah, sure. That's what he is. Okay, you're gonna climb to the top of the tower. Spinning bird there he goes. Yeah. I made it. Just like they showed me to. I love that I have to rising uppercut in order to just punch my way up into places. God damn it. These fucking cat ears making my thing recharge even slower is pain. Well, I guess I can... Oh yeah, there's the... God, that is strange. But yeah, if you hold R1... That works. I like that even if you're playing with a fight stick, <laughs> this mode works. Let me in. Spinning bird kick. Spinning bird kick. Listen, he's on his he's on his break from this corporate office job. He's not gonna be that into it when he says spinning bird kick. No. Shit. Fuck. 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 Shit. There we go. Just seeing this triangle of a man helicopter from rooftop to rooftop is pure bliss. This is this is this is what Zen feels like to me. Spinning bird kick. It's nice. Spinning bird kick. It's, it's good. Yeah, woo! Fuck! I guess I'll just stand up here for a while now. Going for all the sightseeing vistas. Oh, the places you'll go, Kiryu. Don't look at me, ma'am. I'm just recharging my spinning bird. Hey, Patricia. What? The few thousand times knocked down three times, throw three times. Well, I could go for some miles. Uh, you want to fight? Boom! Let's go. Oh, she blocked it. That's one, and she's down. Well, good fight. I'm sorry I don't know my own strength. He's got new skills. Wait, let me get this goddamn thing. Oh, but yeah, listen, I'm fine with that, Zacatron. Because Gam, every time I would turn that off, Gam would turn it back on. So this is, this is, all, for as long as it lasts, this is all I have. Uh... Uh? Oh god. Um. The says <laughs> I hate the way you phrase that game. But thanks. Not gonna last long enough. God damn it. I'm a bully. I'm not a bully. Kiryu just is a very wide, strong man. Sometimes, sometimes accidents happen. Yeah. Boom. How the hell do I get up there? Um, it doesn't look like things connect from this side. In fact, there's probably a way to just look at the map and be like, oh, that's where I go. Um, yeah, never mind. That doesn't really help. Well, let's loop around the corner. Oh, it doesn't drain. Thank you. And also, that is a cumul cumulative total of 100 gifted subs, which is wild. Ow. So thank you for that. And also, thanks for giving us something to Afterglow. Here. Okay, great. Uh, When do we lock bigger slide bar for the boobs? He's got MIDI out to here and it's not enough. Out of fudge. What do you need? Hey, yeah. Stop it. Hmm. 
Need that Max Mini. Yeah. If only I got the game on PC. I'm sure there's already a mod for it. Uh, when can we double jump? Yeah. I don't see an, uh, another... I don't want to accidentally punch someone is the thing. Just trying to get up here. Eh. Uh, well, I mean, it's not ultimately where I need to go. Looks like there's money up there. Oh, you probably zip across. So... Hello. Ay! Hey! I will kick! Kick him! Remind me of Chows from Sonic Adventure 2? Don't know if I see that, but I'm glad that you do see that. Okay, yeah, you gotta, you gotta zigzag back and forth. Uh, spinning bird kick. Spinning bird kick. Eh. eh. eh, eh. Whoop. Pardon. Shit. Sometimes he just doesn't turn around. It takes him a bit. Oh! Um, that's, um... Yeah. Let's, you know... Brothers. <laughs> Found this guy on the street today. Looks just like me, lol. Uh. Yeah. Um... Tone down the brightness. There you go. That's... A little less blown out. I don't- I don't know if I care for the DreamWorks face. Which they have listed as disdain, and I- that's what I feel for this face. But that's not what the face is expressing to me. Uh... Yeah. Where's the OL face? That's this one. Hmm. Oh. Oh! Oh, it's- that's- it's very jittery. Ink. Th this effect is called thick. Don't know why, but... Oh, it's very wobbly. Hmm. Comic. It's just like my manga. I miss Kiryu. That's, that's what the... There's gotta be like a noir, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sir, there you go. I miss Kiryu. Uh. Uh, 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 uh. Hmm. Mm -mm. There's, 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 ma there's many, there's many. Sir, gonna ask you once, and only once. To never smile again. Honda jump scare. Ooh. Uh. Eh. 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 Nit. Not get. Kitten. Hello, kitten. No, 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 I will kick you in the nuts until you die. How dare you. No, the cat- Oh, the cat's back. Hey, buddy. Where are you heading off to? It's- I just- I'm not interested, uh... Yeah. He was gonna punch the cat. I was ready to punch him. For even thinking that. There was a spinning pile driver on you? Mm-hmm. Turns out it's Zangief's cat. Spinning bird kick. Bubble tea. Boy, I sure do love waiting for things to fill up. Money, money. Money. 
So now I can zip over to that. So, hold on. Is this where I want to? I don't know. Be nice if I can unlock a shortcut, Dark Souls style. Dulcim is a master for this character. Oh my god. Oh, that is so gonna happen. Oh no. Oh no, he's gonna have stretchy fucking limbs. Oh shit. Max kick strength boost. Give me that. Give me that. Yay. My legs got stronger because I ate some crisps. Okay, so this does... Oh, okay, Kiryu. <laughs> the confidence is inspiring. Not really what I meant to do, but... You know. Who can say no to him? Nice. Nice, nice property damage, bro. Pretty sick. How the hell do I get up there? Probably right there would probably do it. Ladder I've been running past for an hour. Nice on, sir. No, oh. you guys, you guys cool? We cool? Seems like we're cool. Oh, that's rad. Hey, remember me? You want to fight again? You what? You asking us where Bosch is? Why the hell would any of us know that? Wherever he is, I can't believe he actually went and raided the Mad Gear gang. Talk about cracked. He might be the most unhinged dude alive. And that's the bag he made off with, huh? Hmm, all right. How about this? I don't know where Bosch went, but I might be able to help you with your bag problem. Speak of the devil. Or I know somebody who can help. Get yourself to Skywalk Lane and track down a counterfeiter. Okay. Ooh, money. Piece of candy. Oh. Uh. Spinning bird kick. Nailed it. Yeah. Count or fit? I'll choose fit. I mean, because I already got the drip. You know, like me. Yeah. I'm good, thank you. Ooh, blitz stick. Isabel. Oh, mm. Eh. Mm. No, no, not gonna. Ooh. Money. Run! No, I'm not running. <laughs> I'm just walking fast. I have long legs. Uh, I, don't, I gotta get up there. Uh, where's the map? Uh, hmm. Hmm. This map's not very useful when they use the verticality for things. I seen you Maybe through here. Hey, what's up? Hello. Nice to meet you. Nope. Whoa! Is this Mr. Shakedown? Man, things have been real rough for us lately. I blame the crows. Always strutting around like they own the damn place. And their head honcho is a real shady character. Wonder if we could do something about him. Okay. I'm making my way downtown. Oh, Blanca Chan. I want it. Let me have it. How do I get up there? Uh, no. Eh. Stop yelling. Oh shit, they got the moves. Uh, this is good. I want this. Isn't that also a guy from Final Fight? Probably. Uh, supplement that per permanently increases certain stats. Coco Agogo, a hit with the Swole family. How dare you? How dare you? Uh, okay. Eat that. Good. That's useful. Give me a live a fraction of a hit longer. How do I go up? How do I be up high, up above? How do I do? I want to get up there. Yep. Yep. Oh. Um. Maybe. Can I? That. Um. Hey. No, no, no. I'm, I'm cool. I'm cool. We're, oh, Jesus. Oh, I turned. I made a wrong turn. Hey, how you doing? 
He's got a skateboard. Jesus. That's illegal. You can't do that in street fights. No! You've done it now. You've awoken the beast. Boom. It won't solve my problems now. This is probably a shop where I get my marketable Blanca plushie. I need a marketable Blanca plushie, goddammit. Hey, doing? No, 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 no. I'm just gonna run. I'm running through. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Hello. Hey, how you doing? What's up? Do you guys have a means for me to maintain altitude? Hey, cool. This works. I made it! Sorry. I didn't mean to... Um, there's a ladder right here that takes you up there. Oh, it's past these guys. That's why I missed it. Okay. Two curious could not know. Two curious holding hands need like a four lane highway. Oh, get it! This is just like Animal Crossing. <laughs> This is delightful. Wait. Oh. A lot of people drop in their spare cash. Is there a... Yeah. No! no I, you shot a rocket at me! What the... What is this? Can't grab it. This is real park. Yeah. The Highline. It was above ground rail. They turned into a park. Okay. Oh, by the way, there's also stairs <laughs> that let you go up to the high line. Well, here I thought you need to be fancy. People's rather cash procure your deals and doubloons. Yeah, everyone's like, ah, uh, we don't live in a cash based society anymore, but yeah, have fun. Hello. I, I don't want to fight you. You're level 11, and I'm level, uh, not. I'm level 11. Hmm. New skills of it. Oh. Where, where is, where is he? Where is Luke? Because oh, this is not helpful. Um, at all. What, the shopping's lit up? Uh, okay, whatever. Hmm? Counterfeiter? Can't say I take kindly to that particular title. My title is uh, Chinese... Dress? Well, uh, well, well, I don't have a title. I don't know. Shit. Goofy Dumb Fun, despite me not liking fighting games. I mean, it's like they made the entire single player campaign for people like me who are like, you know, I'm interested in fighting games, but like, I feel like I might lose interest just doing online ranked matches. I'll probably get my ass handed to me and be like, I'm good. Whereas this is just like perfect. Bottom right of the map is where Luke lives. Gotcha. Okay, good to know. Luke can't get near Skywalk Lane for fear of copyright infringement. Holy shit, it's Kazuichi Soda. I don't know who that is. It looks like that guy from Danganronpa 2. Is his name Kazuichi Soda? This game gets harder to end game. I bet. Yeah, that one. Sure, I sell counterfeit brands to mark visiting to marks visiting from outside the city. You got me there. But what I'm really selling here is experiences. Oh god. Uh, I do, I do, I do see the resemblance. I do, yeah, I do, yeah. Hey, thank you. I mean, it's definitely not nothing. Hmm. Um, thank you, Strawberry Mango. Cough. Thank you. I'll get caught by that a little bit. Uh, oh my god, I got like the best deal. That's the kind of once in a lifetime experience I deal in. This is great. So what exactly are you, you looking for? All right, count me in. Seems like a job worth doing. The materials needed to pull it off could be a pain to scrounge up, but if you're willing to put in the work, I'll handle the rest free of charge. What do you say? It would be one hell of an experience, don't you think? Kiryu you be like, well, I don't know about ripping off tourists, but I suppose if it helps my friend, All right. I will engage in illegal activity. That's the spirit, Kiryu. It's a deal. How about those materials we need? 
The texture on that bag ain't something you're gonna get out, out of the kind of leather they sell in shops. Notice how this place is basically crawling with thugs? Well, I'm thinking you can get the materials we need by wiping the floor with them. Re real? Really? That's... That seems odd. Um, where's... Where, where... I need to say hi to... Okay, I need to get off the high line. Can I... Can I just, like, do that? Sure can. Uh, so he's bottom... Oh, there. That's Luke. There he is. There he is! Shopkeeper Udon and apparel clerk G Gamora? That is a name? Uh, so I need to go straight and right. Past the Hado Pizza. Get back here! Yeah, woo. Oh, oh. No, didn't mean to disturb your nap, sir. Hi, Ryan. Hiya. Hiya. Just want you to know you got me in your corner. I really get it, you know, the whole wanting to be strong thing. So if that's cool with you, I got like a task to make you stronger and hmm. stuff. I think they could help you out anyway, probably. So try them out. Just let me know when you're ready. Hiya. Hey, you, you land a four hit combo. Your combo counter will tick up when you land a string of hits on your opponent one after hmm. the next. Some moves will count as a combo on their own. Try working those in if you want to land big combos. When you hit your opponent with two or more moves without them being able to block, well, that's a combo. Try hitting your opponent with a normal move that immediately follow with a special move. Cool? Well, well ready to get started? Yeah, sure. I, I'm good at combos. Can I just light punch repeatedly? Um. Boy, I'm really good at combos, huh? Two hits. Hmm. I am on classic. Much to the dismay of everyone watching, probably. So how in the fuck do I get a decent combo going? Because I just kind of punch. Well, that was a three hit combo. So. Eh, eh. Yeah, it's like I am repeatedly hitting, but that's not a combo. They're just too spaced out. Jump in and then light medium heavy. Ow, my foot! Uh, light meat, light meat, light medium. They're so spaced out. Ah. Doesn't always link. Use that super. I mean, I guess I could. Oh. Shit. No, 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 hold on. That's how it goes sometimes. Get the Hi. fuck back here. Hmm. Yeah, wow. yeah, yeah, yeah. Four medium punches. Medium punches combo? Oh, they... Yeah, okay. I mean, I get that they can't tell you what will combo because they don't know what style you're in, but... Yeah, all right. Thank you. <laughs> Red Elevator 8, the latest entry in the RE series of universally acclaimed horror games. Someone might like this. Oh, Capcom. Canned herring. What it says on the tin. The can is bulging courtesy of the gas form during fermentation. Someone might like this. Is chun -Li like horror games or old fish? As he scratches his head, uh, he rubs his head against walls and things. I'll have another task for you next time, hence the cat ears. If you see me in the city, come and say hi. Okay. Botulism? Mmm. Mmm. Botulism. So, uh, he's over here? Oh. Two, one. Boop. Hooray. Luke, you in here? You in here, buddy? Yeah, I'll go inside. Luke likes games. Oh. There he is. 
Hey, bud. A contractor for a PMC. Metal Gear. Luke uses his elite military background to teach mixed martial arts. He stays off or spent eating junk food, playing video games, and fighting. But make no mistake, Luke plays to win. Fighting style, mixed martial arts slash military martial arts. Charges head on through the opponent's defenses. Deliver a full body bombardment. Well read. Someone said they could put the cat ears on him. He can't take them back off. He doesn't even know they're still on anymore. Yo. Got a minute? I'm going to teach you a move that will blow your mind. Hope you're taking notes. A Vulcan Blast. So, quarter circle forward twice and light punch. Fire multiple <gasps> high-speed sand blasts. So, it's his, his level one super. Right. So, this makes a useful projectile warriors and in combos. Hey, thanks. Come to think of it. I won't charge you for this training sesh. Just be sure to use whatever's at your disposal to improve and get stronger. <laughs> Better not use that strength to pursue a life of crime, though. Imagine how guilty I'd feel then. I can't have that. Whoa. A present? Cool if I open it now? You like video games? Hold up, hold up. You want me to play this and tell you what I think? Did I uh, get on your bad side or something? Word is, this is crazy scary. Uh. Just opening doors and walking down hallways is supposed to be pure terror. Sounds like serious nightmare fuel. <sighs> But it's a gift from you, so I'm gonna give it a shot. Ten minutes a day, or five, depending on how it goes. He liked the video game. Basically, I work for a PMC or private military company. Like the name suggests, we provide security and peacekeeping services on a contract basis. My company also does training exercises and lectures for other companies in the same field. The course we're doing here is the basic version of that which we make available for the general public. Ah, right. It's basically a crash course in unarmed combat. I think the cool kids call it CQC. It's not exactly what you'd call self-defense, but more to give you the confidence in knowing your way around a fight. <laughs> After all, the Buckler Company's slogan is the strength to protect. Luke will now pose in photo mode. I'll be the judge of that. Is he... Is he... Is he gonna- is he gonna pose? He's not posing. He's just stand- he's just- oh. He's just standing there. The strength to protect Riku? He doesn't wanna- These guys are having fun. They're having a great time! Luke, he looks ill. You can see them in the mirror in the distance. <laughs> well, I mean, they said more likely. Maybe he just... Maybe he's just not big on... Imposing. <laughs> Ever think about entering a tournament? Maybe with some sweet cash prizes? He just yorfed on the carpet. It seems to work in regular By camera way. mode, let alone... Or, or selfie mode. There was this tournament in Nashal I got caught up in, and who, buddy? Uh, sorry if I said much more, I'd be breaching my confidentiality agreement. That's probably a reference for you Street Fighter lore fans out there. Um, is there anything in here that I can grab? Okay. Goodbye. Nyash. Oh. Ken lost all his crypto that day. Is that why he's homeless now? Ho Hobo Ken is a very good aesthetic. That I'm a fan of. Alright. Um, hot dog! Oh, he was just right the hell over here. Oh. Oh. I get it now. I see where I am. Don't look at me. Um. Yep. I left 20 minutes from there. Nice. I got 5,000 miles. And I would get 5,000 more. Just to be the guy. We walked 5,000 miles to punch you in the face. Baralata. Baralata. I should probably be eating food by. and using that to augment my battle, because that's like a big thing in the video game. Um, straight up ahead, there's more shops over here. This, wait, this way? This, 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 this way? I'm very confused. So, b back and then along the main... I don't know why this is so difficult for me to process how a map works. It seems like 
I'm walking straight down a road. I I was looking at my cursor. I was like, why am I pointing at an angle? I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm alright. Don't don't worry about it. Um further this way. Oh, this is the oh the block. Okay, I was like, why haven't I found a food the thing of a thing of food over here? It's because they blocked it all off. Shit. Okay. Let's fight some people. Thanks for the hydrate. I need to hydrate my brain. Just pop open my brain and splash a water bottle in there. Mm. This is just like the Super Mario Brothers movie. Pepper. Wait. Hey there. Ooh, money. Huh? You got business with me? Uh, cat business? Yes. I'm in the market of cats and cat related accessories. Please, sir, uh, uh, take a look in my briefcase. And he opens his briefcase and eight kittens just jump out of it. I'm looking for leather materials. I'm selling these fine leather jackets. Ah. I guess you've come to the right place, because I got some. Or I'm wearing some, I should say. You want them? Uh... <laughs> yes. You're a bit of a weird one, you know. You're a bit of weird one. I'm a bit of weird one. You know that? Well, you'll have to peel them off me. Well, don't threaten me with a good time. That's just the kind of city this is, and that's just how we roll. I love it here. Oh, he's nice. And then they kiss. We're engaged now. Happy Pride, everyone. Oh, do, do, do. Damn, you're strong. Message received. A promise is a promise. The leather's all yours. Losers gotta do whatever the winner says. Dems the rules in this city. Can you imagine what a mess this place would be if nobody followed the rules? What? Peace. Soft leather for processing. True fans of leather jackets probably have some of this. It's a quality material useful for more than just clothing. Hey, how you doing? Oh, they dodged! Yeah. Um, this way. Woo, 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 woo. Hey there. Mm hmm? You doing some sightseeing or are you here to scrap? Uh, Whatever. Keep us company for a minute, would you? Making visitors feel welcome is what we're all about around here. Oh, that's nice. Everyone's so nice. Wait, that's the wrong... Uh, I keep doing a medium punch instead of a light punch for the super. Stop it. These guys look like they block a lot. <laughs> Eep. Yikes, you're tough as nails. Well, uh, here, take this. Forking over your possessions after getting your butt whooped is another thing we're all about around here. Peace. Everyone's so nice. Wow. Cool. Leather materials again. Aha! I can't leave that way. Ooh, a thing. Ah! There was treasure in the corner. Okay. All right. Why are you all just... How do I obtain trigger pressure time one time and I get a fine leather jacket? Okay. Oh. I'll just keep throwing them. I didn't, I didn't get it. I murdered him. Why am I so strong? Uh, 
<laughs> I just want to make friends. Call backup. I didn't realize I was that low. I was just fucking around. <laughs> that should have been me. I have three continues. Uh, rip. No way. Oh, okay. You good? He's good. He's fine. He's fine. He's relaxing. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, get back over there. What the? F this has been here the whole time. Don't I feel silly? Let's drink an energy drink, just like here you would. Um, um, I have 12 of these outgoing damage boost for 30. Okay, I have to eat it right before battle. I see. You staring at me? Don't. Hey, 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 yeah. Okay. You guys are low level, so I don't care. Stop it. Yep. Boom! Hey, Tensei! Is this the fight? Yeah. Yep. Sure is. Thank you. Hope you're having a good one. I, I, I still... I know how to get up. You just stop it! I need you to not... Stop it. Boom. The Frost family lore is a wide cat boy. In this house, we stay on a wide cat boy? God, look at him. Jesus. Imagine seeing that run down the street after you. I gotta go up above, down over the... Jesus. Oh, wait, I wanted to get the thing in the corner. That's me in the corner. That's me in the spotlight. Being a wide cat boy. Yep. Yep. Eh. It is crazy. That is the. Oh, God damn it. This is the first time they've actually made a street fighting game <laughs> in a game called. I mean, it makes sense, right? But. It, it seems a, a very good idea, because this could have backfired. Horribly and been really awkward and jank and not very fun and just kind of a waste of time, but no, it's real good. I just gonna I'm just gonna scooch through pardon This works hey The final fights are way more than just the last fight. Hey, they had a lot, a lot more fights in there these leather materials I had in mind all the damage is taken from getting pounded. It gives it some real character. Look how worn it is. Where'd you get this anyway? Uh. So that leaves one last ah, thing. That's right. I was looking at what kind of clasp this thing would need, and it turned out to be quite the special little article. I called in some favors and was able to get an artisan in Rome to make something just like it for us. There's apparently some kind of festival happening at the Colosseo, which is where she'll be expecting you. Uh -huh. Here's your ticket there. I mean, unless you're really in the swimming mood, consider the ticket a very special present from yours truly. I just met you, sir. Off with you then. Go and get that clasp, all right? I got five flight tickets. Are we? Are we? Are we? Gonna make a new friend? Why the fuck this game so go so hard? Open the world map from your device and select the country or place you want to travel to. Or travel requires a flight ticket. In the event you do not have a flight ticket, returning to Metro City will be the only option available to you. 
acquire flight tickets by buying them from general stores, defeating enemies and carrying them as drop blocks. I fucking love this globe. Look at this. The texture on it is great. I just want to listen to this fucking song. This game is like if you gave today's technology to devs back in 2001. That, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Thank you, Clage. Yo, thank you. Hope you had a great time just chilling at home. It was nice to be back. Street Fighter. This shit is just insane. I knew it'd be really sad when I backed out, but I, I couldn't just listen to that all day. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I wanna just quickly grab this shit back. Hi, Richard. Nice squat. Ooh, an elixir. It was worth it. Okay, back to the map. Hope this is good DMCA. I mean, Capcom's usually pretty good. We'll fucking find out. We're going to Italy. Link to the song. Thank you, one. An arena where gladiators fought to the death long ago for festivals. They bring in lions, just like in Roman times. Seats up to 50,000. I have less than zero interest in fighting games in this map. This is incredible. This is so fucking polished. Holy shit. Okay, you ready for the big woman chat? All I want to do. Oh, shit. Yeah. Big woman? Who are we meeting? You'll see. Man, he fits in perfectly here. Hey, Italy, you good? Oh, yeah, Italy good. Marissa. Big woman. Come here. Just give it a hug. Give it some cuddles. It's just a big kitty. Hmm? Something I can do for you, wide, wide, wide man? No need for concern. We were just playing. Italy, you good? And Kiryu goes, ha, ha, ha. I see. Oh, let me guess. You're here in search of a craftsperson. Why else would I be here? Is this what you're looking for? I, why? Thank you, convenient woman. This is very nice of you. <laughs> Surprise? Don't be. After all, the craftsperson here is me. It's something of a hobby, you see. My day job is, well, it's what you see before you. Uh? Anyway. Oh, big yawn. Well, then. You're here, so let's have ourselves a little fight, shall we? Okay. okay. Oh, God. I hope I lose. I mean, I hope I lose. I mean, I hope I get stopped. I hope I said, I mean, I hope I. Yeah. 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 Ow. That hits hard. Fuck. No, ma'am. Oh, 
Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow, my foot. <laughs> she was just messing with me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, God. She hits hard is an understatement. I'm just dancing around her and she punches me three times and I'm down. I just gotta keep her in the corner and... No, 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 no. Oh god, she has armor? Of course she has armor. Fuck. Oh my god. That was a beautiful fight. Yeah, it was pretty good. She's level 18. Wonderful? Not bad. Not bad at all. Right now, victory and defeat aren't what matter. <laughs> what we're doing, it's communication, and it's given me a taste of who you are. Take this with you. <laughs> Normally, I'd be worried about giving it to just anybody since it's good enough to pass for the real thing. But yours is a fake? But you, I'm not worried about. Farewell. Whatever you use it for, I bet you'll make it work. Buongiorno. But Buonasera. The clasp of a true artisan, in this case, Marissa, who has a fondness for designing jewelry, popular for its unusual design and released in limited numbers. Hey, thanks. Oh my god, there's a fixed camera here. This is very silly. Look at him fucking shuffle. Go to the world map? No, not yet. Just kind of take a little look around. Can we be your student? Yeah, yeah ma'am. Hmm? What do I think is the nature of strength? <laughs> my someone is certainly full of pointed questions. Very nice. Uh, oh no, I'm not complaining. I appreciate it. Care to hear my answer? Yeah. General Punk, General Public can punch me. Possibly. I just have plan to keep doing this for now. But I'm not opposed to doing more streams of this if people are interested. We'll see. Hi. Lucius is a clever boy. He's never eaten a human, but he gets moody when he smells a coward. Oh. I'm a brave kitty cat, just like the lion. I'm the lion of Dojima. That's it. So, you want to prove your strength? It's all about taking that first step. Uh. <laughs> Kiryu, it's all about taking that first step. Kiryu looks at his fucking foot. <laughs> That's really funny to me. When I saw you take that step back there, I realized just how serious you are about your search for strength. Visit me whenever you wish. On the subject of strength, we have much to discuss. Yeah. Woo. You become Marissa's student. You now use her fighting style, basic moves, unique attacks. You also learned her master action. Gladius. Quarter circle forward punch. Hold the button to change effect. Can be powered up by holding the attack button. Oh, yeah. Oh, her alt color is very good. Phalanx. Leave it to the air and come down with a powerful downward punch. Allows you to move first, even if it's blocked, making it effective for continuing offensive pressure. Well, damn. That seems pretty good. Uh, yeah, let's let's give that a go. Um, Mashta. Obtained avatar pose, Marissa. Oh, oh, yeah. This lion is now a kitty cat. I mean, this kitty cat is now... I mean, this... Yeah. It yeah, woo. Hey there. What's your- Oh, I can't do my other actions here. Beast style. You wanna fight beast style? Hey. So, uh, about the freaking elephant in the room, am I right? Or a lion in this case? Is that thing real? Taming a lion's one thing, but fighting one? Uh, check please. Yeah, nope, couldn't be me. 
Now that takes some guts I'll never have. Fight me. Fight me right now. Yeah. So that's the that's the phalanx. Ow. Yep. Get get Oh my god. Okay. Yep. She's in the back like, yeah, yeah, just like that. So what was the, uh, bu, 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 bu. Gladius is just quarter circle, but gotcha. Ah, shit. Whoa. He's, 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 de he's, de he's deceased. He's dead. I'm mur- Yeah, he's gone. Well. Shit. Fuck. Yeah, that center arm showing energy. Uh, have you any plan on doing multiple streams of Street Fighter 6 to beat the main story? I heard the story mode is 20 hours long. That is beefy. Um, uh, I don't know. At this moment, I'm having fun. I may do more of it. Chat just gotta let you guys gotta let me know. Hi. Talk about a slick costume, black and gold, and bursting at the seams with gladiator gladiatorness. All I'm sweaty soul is fun. I mean, that's kind of what I why, what, what I would expect. That blazing head of hair to match? Hold me back! Did someone turn up the heat in here? Hello? Why does everyone talk here? Why does everyone here talk like they're a side character of a 90s sitcom? It's all hello and check please. Is that just what Italy's like? Hey, ma'am. Dead. <laughs> I wish it was just game. Just instantly just concussed on the ground. That just happened. God. What's the back throw look like? No, hey. Hey there. Come on. Come on. Wait. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. I want to try a back throw, Elise. Ma'am. I might like Marissa. I mean, I already know I like, I might like her style. It's it's pretty silly. New skills available. Oh yeah. I do probably have some of those, huh? Um, I have 35 points. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I probably should, you know, put some points in earlier. Um, so I, okay, and I pick, uh, Unique attack strength or throw? Well, I gotta throw up. Wide man. Her style fits his wideness. That's also true. Increase max. Yeah, this is probably. Yeah. Increase number of special moves you can select. Sure. Champion. Oh, God. Increase max capacity of drive gauge. Increase number of accessories you can equip. Increase vitality. Increase kick strength. I said pick one of each, so. Drive gauge up is good. Um, greatly increase pounch. Get discounted rates when shopping at general stores and eateries. Increase unique attack strength. Yeah, well, give me, make me strong. And increase vitality. Yeah. Enables use of drive stall while moving. Drive stall can be used to slow down time by using your drive gauge. Increases the number of special moves you can select. Reduces damage taken by enemy attacks while outside battle. Increase defense. I mean, it ain't sexy, but gets the job done. Um, as for these, I mean, that's uh, drive stall sounds neat, so I'll probably just wait and get that. Yeah, it's nice you can get all of them. Mm -hmm. I like that they tell you straight up, too. They're like, don't worry, you can get them all. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Uh, who's gonna like canned herring? I don't know. I'm not aware. Um, okay. Return to Metro C Oh, I, right. Hey, hello. Oh. I'm going to teach you one of my moves. Well, Go ahead. Unleash it. Javelin of Marissa. Bring a full power pounce down on your opponent with a wide swing. Hold the button and increase the damage. Jesus. That looks, uh, looks a little bit spicy. I'm sure she does. <laughs> Great. Uh, try move. Oh, 
My god. Wait. Shit. Wait, no. Wow. Boom. God, if you connect with that full charge, that's nuts. All right. Very Senator Armstrong. I, I, I am gradually turning Kiryu to Senator Armstrong, which I never thought would be the case. But, you know, here's where we are. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mashta. Luke has more to talk about. Can I just, like, fast travel to him? No. Nope. All right. Merchant Hawker. I don't know. If he, he might mess me up. What do you got there? Uh, prepaid card. 2,000 more damage. Perform a combo. Yeah. 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 No, I'm, I'm good. I'm gonna go. See you guys later. Nano machines, son. Uh, If you, if you look closely, the, the globe is Pac-Man. Because, don't forget, that's what all games are. They're all Pac-Man. Luke. Hey. When do you usually take your showers? When would, when would here you take his showers? This isn't me. I, I'm a morning shower person. Cure you. I feel like he might be a night. Yeah, I think he's a night showerer. I feel like he's got a hose off at the end of the day. He seems like a nighttime guy. Got it. The daily grind really works up a sweat. I totally get it, but I'm all about that morning shower life. Wash away all the sweat and grime, get that facial hair in order, and it's off to the races. And by races, I mean night night. <laughs> It's all about spending your morning at peak efficiency so you can start the day at peak performance. Luke liked that conversation. What's up? Whatever path you walk, you gotta be able to put food on the table yourself. Making ends meet through fighting ain't easy, but strength and stamina gives you plenty of options. For example, I used to scrap car cars part time. I could bust up an SUV faster than any machine could. There might be work at the factory in town. Couldn't hurt getting used to taking odd jobs, if you ask me. I mean, I shouldn't be surprised that there's a car-destroying minigame in Street Fighter. So, does he mean his eyebrows? By facial hair, he means eyebrows? Yeah. Puts work in. He puts the work in. He shaves. He's in good shape. He works for Cars for Kids. Is that what Cars for Kids yeah, does? They just punch the crap out of... Don't honk at me. I'm too wide to be honked upon. What's Marissa's phalanx? Oh, you can just do that whenever you want. That's fun. Uh, back of this away. Kira takes a shower when he's at his boyfriend Tachibana's house. That's correct. Inaccurate. Oh, fuck. Get him! Ah, my butt! Roomba bit me in the butt! That man kicked a Roomba to death! Woo! Yeah, that was a great fight there! What do, you, what do you call that style? Kicking on things style. Shit. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. Ooh. Careful, little man. Ah! Oh, shit. <laughs> that doesn't get old for me. <laughs> just... Just do it the little low kicks. Uh, shoo, 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 get away from me. Eh, eh, got it. Red die. All right, I got you. I went all the way to Rome, made friends with the lioness. You don't say. Got the class, did you? The one who made it is a talented up-and-coming designer, but I hear she doesn't sell to people she doesn't like. I was worried the whole thing would fall through, but hey, looks like you pulled it off without a hitch. 
Right, so I just gotta attach that here, and... Huh. There we go. And as promised, I won't take your money for it. I'm just happy to have had the experience of making it. You're the nicest counterfeiter in town, Leonardo. You had yourself a good time too, yeah? Feel free to swing by if you need my help again. A rare brand item knockoff. Still, for a phony, the quality is remarkable. Whoever crafted it wove their initials into the lining. Quite the playful touch. Double KO gum. The hell is that? What the heck is that? Um, uh, uh, double KO gum gift item. Made by a pharmaceutical firm using pricey ingredients, this gum for fighters is renowned as the most expensive on earth. Yeah, all right. Yeah, oh, okay, all right. Yeah, okay. Um, where to? This way. Do, 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 do. Hey, don't. Stop punching me in the butt. Which strong woman to give it to? Mm-hmm. I got super armor. Well, uh, yeah, I'm using Marissa's fighting style, and I it looks like some of her moves give you super armor. I don't know. I, let's, I don't know how fighting games work. So your task, win a fight while in burnout. You're going to start in burnout mode right from the uh. get-go. What does that mean? You'll have to wait longer before acting after blocking attacks. Special moves will whittle down an opponent's vitality, even if they manage to block them. Coming out on top from such a disadvantaged position should push your skills to the limit. Well. Oh no. Oh, I'm all drippy. Shit. Eh. Nope. Stop blocking! Stop! I can't throw him either. Okay, he's just... He's just reading me. Don't block. Yeah. Because if you're in burnout and get hit while blocking, it just fucks you up real bad. You complete that task with flying colors. Triangle, triangle, quarter circle, forward triangle is a good combo. For Marissa style? Soup! Chat. I'm at soup. A gift, a gift item of soup that begs to be eaten cold. Seasoned for savoring at low temperatures. Someone might like this. That someone's me. I know him. He's me. A veggie-based snack food made with tons of chopped celery. Has a curiously divisive taste. Someone might like this. I'll have another task for you next time. If you see me in the city, come and say hi. Soup. Soup. Boop. What does the sign say? Skywalk Lane. Uh, eh. Get it. Alright. Well, oh, pardon. Just punches some boxes. No, that's not a euphemism. Sounds like it might be. Uh, oh, you can also get up there from me. Wait, what? There, there I am. There I go. It's Bobby. It's his world, and we just live in it. Hiya. Oh yeah, bus, no stopping. Hey, the name's Bobby. You a resident bus liker? You know, I'm not as big a fan of that Resident Evil spin-off, Resident Bus Liker, but you know, I think it's okay. It's just a little bit overrated. You can travel from stop to stop for free. Ain't that convenient. I was scheduled to install a bus stop in Chinatown, but there's a situation. Some canary crate dudes taking up shop and refuse us to move. It's holding up the work schedule, but nobody can tell the guy to scream. Why don't I do it, dude? No way. I'm a wuss. Mission accepted. I gotta go murder a man in Chinatown. Beep, beep, boop, beep, beep, boop, boop. They need to find somebody to bring back Leon when he's 65. Uh. Uh. Um. Uh. Uh. The, you? Is that you? Uh huh. You want me to move? Yeah, I'm thinking no. I'm here for a very good reason. If you want me to leave, you'll have to remove me by force. Okay. Uh, 
Yeah. I'm gonna reach you with my tiny little arms. There you go. Eye right, holes are off. Probably makes it harder for them to fight, but I'll it take sucks. it. Oh, come on. Uh, here, I thought I was going to be the first one on the bus. For real? I'm in the way of the bus stop's installation? Well, oh, crap. Sorry about that. I'll hang tight till the bus stop's ready to go. I, I absolutely fucking do. That's what it was going to be about. Hey, Bobby. Thank you. Thanks a bunch for shooing that guy away from me. Wait, what? He was waiting for the bus? All that worrying for nothing. Uh. I better get that bus stop up quick so we can ride then. He was just a bus like he was just like me for real. Street fiber. Street fiber. Good. S street. Street fiber. A tough fibrous material capable of enduring bouts on the streets. Street Bowder doesn't have the same ring to it. Used for the efficient enhancement of body gear. For your torso. I, so, okay, that, it was grayed out before, but the shops have a menu for enhancement. And it seems you gotta have items to do it. Wait until nightfall and hang out the meet with the Mad Gear game. Let's do that. Let me go eat a pizza pie. Get myself back up to full. Street Fiber sounds like a meal supplement. For your health. Hey, Biz. Welcome. And, um, 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 I don't, how, I don't know how much I need. Oh, that's what my vitality is at the moment. Oh, you know, you know what's fun? Is when I was menuing before, I was just looking to recover vitality plus like 4,000, 6,000. I was like, I don't know how much that is. And I'm now seeing that directly underneath it is a visualization of what that actually means. So, uh,. Let me eat some za. Goodbye. It's a laxative. Street Fiber 2 Turbo is a laxative. Yeah. Wait for the taxi. He's not here. Oh, pardon. Oh, pardon. Oh, excuse me there. Pardon me there. Let me just scooch past you there. All right, there we go. Oh, boom. Turbo. Hi, Caitlin. What are your details? Hit with three aerial attacks. Yeah, okay. Oh, right in the boiling lines. Eh. I'm coming for you. I guess standard attacks don't count as unique attacks. Like specials and stuff. She has a nice blazer on. Yeah, she does. I got her. Marissa has more interactions. Good. We'll go sad or later. Ugh. All right. I'm gonna scooch back up over the ladder. I I didn't I didn't ask for listen. I Jesus Christ. Calm yourself. No, don't look. Don't. I'm not. I don't go outside to be perceived. Hi. Well, look who it is. I assume you showing your sorry face around here means you got that bag back. Very nice. I gotta admit, I'm almost impressed. Right, so you can get lost now. Quit playing dumb. As if you get off that easy, chump. Oh, no. We're gonna tussle in the road. Why don't we tussle in the road? No, 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 no. I don't think we should. Oh, let me let me text my girlfriend. There you go. I really like Phalanx. That's a really nice move. Oh. Oh. Beautiful. There's a man hiding in a box to you. Mommy, help us! <laughs> Damn it! What the hell? Ugh. Seriously! Mm hmm. Ugh. How are you so wide? When we said we wanted the bag, we meant what was inside it! Ugh. 
Nani? Are you actually this stupid? Yes. Thrash your damn. We got ourselves a freaking comedian here. Nice, smart ass. We need to I talk. can't see him. I'm too wide. Get up here. That keeps happening. I'm too wide for the cutscene. <laughs> He's so wide. That angle is very flattering on him. He looks really good. Yeah, we'll go say hi to Macho Man. Thrasher's got something he wants to talk to you about personally. Well, what's the holdup? Get moving. No, I don't. I'm good. Wait, there's a gift down there. Hold on. Go away. They don't know how to climb ladder. There's a thing. Shit. Wait, oh, I thought these ones. Meow. It's just a cat, guys. Let's leave him alone. Yeah, whoop. Okay, bye. No, 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 no. Nice. What's with all these boxers? Oh, you. Thank you, Cave. Pounch. Pounch. They call me the barrel puncher. On account of all the etc. Hello, gentlemen. Wow, I beat up all these guys, huh? I'm kind of a badass, huh? You know. You know, like meow. So what do you want? Bosch was the guy who screwed over our deal, yeah? You're not an accomplice of his, are you? <laughs> if you were, I'd bet you you'd be hiding away together, huh? <laughs> hmm. Uh. Listen up. No need to be so stiff. I'm just planning to buy you out, that's all. I ain't pulling your leg either. You fought my goons and came out on top. You know what I mean? You're the cream of the crop. And me, I like winners. Yeah. Same with Bosch. I hate the game he's playing, but I gotta admit, the guy's a player. I want guys like that on my side, plain and simple. Plain and shrimple. Anyway, now we've gotten to know each other, how about you do a little favor for me? Uh. Listen up. Oh, it's nothing serious. Just need you to look into something for me during the day. You know, the opposite of night. You seem confused by the concept. All right. No well, joke. don't give me that look. Just help me out a little bit. Nothing bad will happen to you. Promise. Help me out. What do you need to look into? Just some of my. Just talk to some of my goons nearby, and they'll fill you in. Sound good? We met. We met Thrasher Dan. Uh. The ah has to come from, like, deep within your throat. Uh. You almost have to forget that you're even speaking. It's just kind of, uh. What? Thrasher wants your help with something. I think I know what's up. Have you heard that there's going to be a martial arts tournament held here in town? We've already made it to the tournament arc. That was quick. There's been lots of threats getting called and demand the whole thing be put on ice. I bet he wants you to go talk to the fuzz about it. Ain't no chance in hell any couple would be willing to hear people like us out. That's for damn sure. I see. Huh? Hey, so I hear you're gonna go talk to the Popo for us at Thrasher's request. I love your tattoos, sir. They're usually pretty riled up at night, so you best pay him a visit during the day. You know, nightent. You know, like when you go snooze bye-bye and then it's brighter outside? That part. <laughs> Hear me out. You help us out with doing a bit of work during the day, we'll put you in our good books. We'll even let Bosch off the hook and settle for just beating him within an inch of his life. Sound good, yeah? Yeah. Hello. Um, I don't really want to fight you guys, but this is... This is my path forward. No, 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 no. It's cool. It's cool. We're chill. Or chill. Huh? I really want him to drop drop down like that and just sprain his ankle. And, you know. They said a sword. Yeah. We haven't even done the school arc. I know. I mean, we kind of had like a school with Chun Li a little bit, but. What is it? You're wondering about the stadium? They're building this thing called the Mike Hagar Memorial Stadium in the west end of town. 
There's a plan to celebrate its opening by hosting a massive martial arts tournament, but we get threats every now and again telling us to cancel it or else. Mm-hmm, I know this. Uh -huh. The threats coming in about the stadium, I'll have you know, we're investigating them very seriously by loitering outside the police station. A lot of them seem like regular old pranks, but we also get some that seem really, really real. The tutorial was the school arc. For instance, there was a flyer calling for the tournament's cancellation around the Masters Foundation building to the east. To the east. Shit. Fuck. No, 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 no. Oh, you fucked up. What does he need? Land the first attack. That'll do it. <laughs> Woman walked up, saw me kick a room, and went, Yeah. I mean, shit. If I was walking around New York City and saw a guy just kicking the shit out of in a very aggressive Roomba, they'd probably start cheering. Yeah. Oh, whoa. we're making it to the heart of New Donk City now. Hmm. Warning, the martial arts tournament, uh, martial arts, Mike Hager Memorial activity. Goes ahead, there you have. The poster's torn in places and impossible to read. Kiri doesn't know how to read either way, so doesn't make a big difference. Uh. Hi there. The poster that was over there, I tore it down. Sorry, I can't remember what it said. But if you're looking for another just like it, I think I saw one in Skywalk Lane. If you're curious to find out what it said, why not try heading over there? You're mildly inconveniencing me, Jacob! Let's fucking tussle! In the road. Okay, alright, buddy. Don't throw knives. Shit. Oh, he jumped! No, 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 no. Is he throwing Molotovs? God damn, dude. It was a wrench? I dodged. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a knife. As the saying goes, Marissa wants to talk again. But I'm busy, Marissa. I'm fighting people. The way you always wanted me to. Angry accountants. How angry are you? I mean, I'm not an accountant, even though I look like one. Yeah. You're full of it. Hmm. Full of what? I did have that pizza earlier. Rachel, look out! I'm defending her against the accountants. Okay, oh, yeah, you said triangle, triangle, quarter circle, triangle. I don't think I have her trying quarter circle. Medium. Lucky hit. You look like someone who hasn't put the cover on their TPS report. Spinning bird kick. In game. Spinning bird kick. <laughs> I. I definitely vibe with this style more than Chun Li's charge style. I'll say that much. It's quite satisfying. Although, if I was playing against real players, I'm sure they would just abuse the fuck out of how slow I am. But for against the, against NPCs like this? Psh, that did- I attacked it 7-7 seven, seven damage. Oh my god. They're upset about the 7-8-9 scenario. Okay, well now you done it. Now you done it. What did you do? Um, throw twice. Okay. There it is. There's the throw. Now that's a trip to the hospital. Only in Metro City, am I right? God, I love this town and the hot dogs ain't too bad either. Sir, you got um These buns look like shit. Fries with cotton kit. French fries with cotton candy? What's the great? Yeah, I was gonna be like, hey, like, I, I realized, like, I mean, maybe that's, like, meant to be, like, mayo. 
I mean, I don't know. I we, I used to get get uh, food a lot in New York from uh, the halal carts all over the place, and they would always have like a like a white sauce. It was fucking delicious. It's the left audio. <laughs> Fuck Mystery Who. That's fucking funny. God. Dick. Alejandro? Yeah. Pardon me. Nice shoes. Mayo good on hot dogs. I mean, I, I like mayo, but the idea of mayo on a hot dog is kind of bad. But also, my opinions are bad, so, you know. I have had some, I've had some weird burger. I mean, bur what the fuck? My brain. I've had some weird hot dogs that probably had shit like mayo on them, so. There was a hot dog place on St. Mark's in Manhattan that had like bacon wrap dogs. All kinds of fish. My balloon! Spider Man! My balloon! I gotta charge up. Hold on. Still charging. Oh, it's, uh, it's gone. Spider Man, my balloon! <laughs> Sorry, kid. Sometimes you gotta learn a lesson not to let go of your balloon. Uh, thanks, Kiryu. I feel a little better now. Yay! Mayo and ketchup on hot dog slaps? I mean, yeah, it probably does. Martial arts tournament at Mike Hagar Memorial Stadium is a front for criminal activity. If this tournament goes ahead, there will be casualties. You have been warned. Collusion between the government and criminal organizations will not go unnoticed. Metro City Denizens Alliance. Take down the poster? No. I'll leave it up. Am I supposed to am I supposed to maybe I'm supposed to destroy it? Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm taking it with. I see. Okay. A poster calling for the tournament's cancellation. It points out a shady syndicate's involvement and warns of potential harm to spectators. Could this be a shadow loo? I say knowing almost nothing of Street Fighter lore. Oh. Yep. Uh yep. Sorry, kids. Guys with robot armor wreaking havoc in Hell's Kitchen. Mm -hmm. uh, hand the threatening poster to Thrasher. Gotta get back to Thrasher. How do I get back to... Pardon. I don't remember how to get back up there. Uh... Oh... Oh... Pardon? Excuse me. This... The, the right. The ladder that I unlocked. Via punching in the streets. Shadow Lou's destroyed, but maybe they're coming back, you know? Shadow Lou 2. Shadow Lou hey, Harder. You look into that tournament thing for me? What? A criminal organization's involved? Damn it. Ah, come on now. We're talking about a tournament where the, ha the Hagar is inviting a bunch of famous fighters. Whether it's us or some other jerks, do you seriously expect me to believe that a criminal org could be involved, could get involved so easily? Some metal and townsfolk are just trying to get the tournament canned by spreading dumbass rumors. If the blame for this somehow gets pinned on us, I am gonna be beyond pissed off. Cool. <laughs> Thanks for looking into things for me. Sounds like Bosch still hasn't turned up. Probably turned tail and ran. Well, now what do I do? Do I do I have uh missions? Um Bosch's whereabouts. Past time doing other missions till Bosch is found. All right. All right, sweet. Uh, map. Uh, 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 everything's that way. And probably do those during the day, though. That's probably easier. Uh, square. It's got a electric shadow loop. Neo shadow loop does exist as of SF5. Hmm. D. Hagar. Oh, hi. Hey, Kazuma Kiryu. How'd everything go? Bosch got in touch with me earlier. I guess you two got wrapped up in some kind of... F Stop texting me so fast, Luke! Um, I guess you two got wrapped up in some kind of gang stuff while wandering around the city at night. I get it. You can't wait to toughen up, but that... And that's one way to do it. I was basically a street punk myself as a kid, so far be it from me to lecture you. Just watch yourself, okay? You're wondering about Bosch? I think he mentioned something about heading to England. <laughs> Cammy? Is that, is that, we're gonna meet Cammy? Is that, is that where Cammy is? Head to King Street in the United Kingdom via the world map. Uh, yeah, okay, sure.
A foggy street in the rainy UK dotted with vestiges of the industrial age. Its historical buildings house tea rooms loved by the locals. Yoga pants. I mean, Cammy. I mean, yoga. Her new design is very good. Oh, Godzilla was up. <laughs> Oh, see, okay, when two buses like each other very much, sometimes, you know, it's, oh my, look how good we look. Steam. Inconspicuous. Seriously? What are you doing here? Sorry, I'm just being wide. What's wrong with you? I said to stay away from me. I told you I can't play around like you. My card. Oh, oh shit. That ain't Cammy. That ain't Cammy. Ah, oh, fuck. Yep, all right. You must be gosh. Saw your friends just now, but I don't think they're coming. They ran into something nasty on the way. It's jewelry. Uh. <laughs> God, you're an idiot. You thought a gang would let you off, like, oh sure, here you go. You've got nowhere to run. Why she ride her bike barefoot? Ooh, you for real? Something, something. Idiots. Feet? Is that we're too stupid to know when to quit? <laughs> Stop, kid. You're killing me here. Is this Lark Scenes VA? Maybe. And only one of us is allowed to do the killing. Ma'am? She does not know defeat. <laughs> How about my face to your foot style? Shit. Nope. No, 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 bad. No! I almost got her. Come on now. Ain't. Give me a little bit more. Level 25. Yeah. Her top is cool. Mm -hmm. Oh no, spoons. So, the hell's your deal? Uh. They told me to tenderize little Bosh here real good before bringing him in. But they didn't say anything. About leaving his geeky friend alive. Ma'am. Mia. Wait! Leave him out of this! He just came to give me something I left behind. Is are these cutscenes I... different if you win these fights, or are they just impossible to win? Seems like they're all doable to win. I'm just bad at the game. Sorry for the trouble. Huh. I really mean it. Data. That I, I, this is the first I've heard that there's data. Get the bag. We're going. I'm trying to make sure the cutscene instead. Oh, that's a bummer. Damn. I like the color red. <laughs> Yay, red flags. I love red flags. That's a lot, Retro. Thank you. Oh, you made Kiryu mad. He took his friend. A data card Bosch handed you, protected by special security measures. Clear. Clear. Whoa. Go to the world map. No, no, hold on. Maybe Cammy's hiding behind a bush. Um, no. Maybe, I, maybe if I go into the... Maybe I can't go in here. 
This music's nice. I want to see Cammy. Where's Cammy? Well, it is cool that you basically just get to run around on the UK level. Like I've seen in gameplay, this is this is like Cammy's stage or whatever. You just get to run around. It's cute. Yes. I bet that data chip is. It's just. It's just all photos of Jury's feet. Uh, okay, back, back. Wait, I got, I do, I do got to talk to Marissa. Give me some more moves, girl. This is Professor Layton. See, there's the puzzle. Now, Luke, listen carefully. There's one really, really big woman, and another woman who's not quite as big, but has bare feet. All right, what's the professor? What, what's, what's, what's the puzzle, professor? Okay, are you, are you looking at the big woman and the other woman? This woman's name is Cammy over here. That's quite a revealing outfit, professor. Good. What's, what's the puzzle? How many picarettes does it work? Take a look at this alternate outfit for jewelry, Luke. Is the answer C, Professor? Yes, Luke. See these feet. Hello. An arm in the air with a finger extended? Do you know the meaning of this gesture? I surrender. Cool. Looks like someone's been studying. You're exactly right. But actually... Athletes competing in the ancient Pancration use this pose to signal their surrender. What? The college my friend housemate made Layton in Street Fighter Online. I think it was SF. Then I used his card some carry. Huh. Really? I mean, I thought it was memeing. To be like, one. Professor, I want this woman to crush me. Uh, Luke, Luke, you see. Uh, 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 a man is trapped underneath a mountain of rubble. Oh no, Professor! Did, was he in a cave exploring some ancient ruins? No, the rubble is several women, Luke. Look, see, that's me at the bottom of the rubble, and the rubble is all comprised of various women from Street Fighter. Uh, uh, I, I, see, I see. Um. And look, you, you can see that there's a rope leading from the man beneath the rubble. Oh, he has to pull on the rope in order to, to pull himself out. No, 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 you'll see the rope is attached to a camera, and when you pull it, it takes a picture. I, I... I don't understand this puzzle, Professor. I pull on the rope. That should do it. Every puzzle has an answer. Look, you took a, look, look, Luke. It's a picture of me being stepped on by a big woman. The puzzle's been solved. Hooray! Luke isn't old enough. He's old enough now with New World of Steam. He's older. He's fine. Um, strikes to vulnerable organs and biting aside anything was fair game in the pancration. Pan- pan- am I pronouncing that right? There were referees rules for announcing surrender. But regardless, it said that more than a few fighters lost their lives mid-match. I know all too well how a pancra- pancratiest of old must have felt. Oh. They refused to give up to the very end. <laughs> and now their blood courses through my veins. <laughs> This puzzle is worth two feet. I mean, ten toes. I mean, it's worth eight picarats. It's good work. Hello. You know, historically, pancration is meant to be performed naked. Nani? Oh. No weapons, no armor, just you and your birthday suit. It's not my birthday. Cure you, please. That wouldn't fly today. Oh, the lion in the back had a big shake. That wouldn't fly today, so I begrudgingly wear an outfit into battle. But... <laughs> How I'd love to go in there with my fighting spirit bared for all the world to see. Marissa's now more likely to pose in photo mode. I, uh, I, uh, You're here. Wanna go around? Very nice. Hit me with everything you got. Gamma's made an announcement. Oh shit, let's go. We're fighting, we're fighting. Ow, fuck, ow, shit, ow. What? 
Nope, shit. No, no, bad, not good. Ah. Thank you for the backwards nice as I lost and she stepped on my face. Uh, good timing. Whoa, there we go. Boom. That is very satisfying to hit. Oh God. No, 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 no. I didn't charge it because I was scared. I'm probably, it's probably good I didn't. She just stood there and took that. No, ow, no. No, fuck. Nah, fuck. She's also pretty barefooted. It's true. It is true. Hey. I think you might be overexerting yourself a bit. She liked that. Shit. Bar sweat. Oh god. Hey, Trent Krim from the Independent. Do you care to comment on the allegations of you having to take a week off to find legal counsel if you're blatantly violating the copyright that hit the HBO show, Barry? I'm not going to talk about that at this time. Uh, thank you for the um, inquiry. My lawyers, my lawyers have told me to shut the fuck up and stop streaming because you just keep digging yourself into deeper and deeper holes. And then I say, like, listen, they can't own a word, right? Who are they, you know, to copyright things? You know, that, that'd, be, that'd be like copywriting the phrase Street Fighter. It's like, I could go fight people in the street. You can't own that. Boulevard Brawler. I thought this was America. Feet Strider 6. World Toes. The nature of strength. Ah. It's so obvious it slipped my mind. It all begins right here. Oh. Hey. It's in the dictionary. It means Bingus Bungus. See Bingus Bungus. And then Bingus Bungus redirects you back. I walk the path of pancreation. What's pancreation? Only the oldest martial art in human history focused on bringing down the opponent with body alone. Oh. If you want to know what strength is all about, pancreation will get you there faster than anything. It, it, it feels like it shouldn't be pronounced pancreation. Pancreation. I think it's pronounced pancreation was an unarmed combat sport introduced into the Greek Olympic Games in 648 BC. These boxing wrestling techniques, but also others such as kicking holds, joint locks, and chokes on the ground, making it similar to modern mixed martial arts. It comes from the Greek pancreation, meaning all of power. From pan, all, and kratos, strength, might, power. Oh shit. That's why he's named Kratos. <laughs> if you want to know this, pancreas will get you there faster than anything. Got it. Thanks. Ah. Eh. Alright. Kratos? 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 Um... Well, goodbye. Go to the map! Are they nude in the old Olympics? They sure were. Uh... So there is a master at King Street, I just don't. Don't have it yet. Uh, right. Take a picture from this before you go. Ah, shit. Shit. I'll do it later. USA. Only way to make sure you're not cheating. Hmm? You gotta be safe. Whoa, so that's what happened to Bosch, huh? Telling you to ignore the situation is pointless, I know. But TBH, you guys stood no chance. Not yet. Either way, what's next for you? You got wrapped up in something bigger than you and paid the price. No shame walking away for now. I mean, common street thugs are like mosquitoes to you now. It's, it's fuck it, Luke! <laughs> so you got pretty much graduated from the intro course IMO. Still, uh, I've got some gas in the tank if you're looking to keep at it. You mention it yourself. Kazuma Kiryu, the search for the meaning of strength, and wherever that search might take you. Oh, hey, here's an idea. How about a change of scenery, something a little brighter and upbeat, and if you find any funky souvenirs, be sure to drop by and show me, okay? 
Where is he sending me? Oh. We can either go to Ranger's Hut in Brazil and look for a souvenir for Luke. I'm assuming that's Blanca. Head to Bather's Beach in Jamaica and look for a souvenir for Luke. I'm assuming that's DJ. Where are we going, chat? We have a choice. We have a say in where we go. Brazil? Do I need to buy something more fitting? They don't have any new clothes in the store. How do I want to? I want to look the best. I could blend in the jungle. It just makes them look like Shaggy. I can't. DJ got us dancing. That's true. That is correct. Although maybe I can. Uh, I can change my gear in the gear. We could. We could. Oh fuck. Oh god. No. Nope. Can't do that. We, we could we could just be double cheeked up and go to Brazil like this. Thick Shaggy, yeah, that's just bad. Oh no, where's on that? Don't worry about her. She's fine. Flip, flip a coin. Mm. Uh, uh, flip a coin. Um, okay. Uh, uh, heads, we go to Brazil. Tails, we go to um Jamaica. And flip. Yeah, heads. We're going to Brazil. Brazil. Can we go to Aruba? Bahama? Oh, shit. They do have different sound effects based on your footwear. Come to Brazil. My god, my god, my god, look at him. This is what peak physique looks like. Uh, this is, this is very intimidating. Oh, gee, Jesus Christ, sir. The sun is bright. It's illegal to display this level of beef. Yeah, you're probably right. This cured my body to sport for you. Ah, shit. Uh, uh, yep, yeah, okay, yeah, and then with, yep, yeah, sure, uh, uh, world map. How does he wipe? Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know. He just, he uses a bidet. Ranger's hut, a village deep in the jungle, tours have begun with the goal of attracting visitors, said to be protected by some mysterious creature. People white sand beach teaming with tourists. Clouds flock. To enjoy music at bars, breath things side of the sea at sunset. To the Brazil! He doesn't have tattoos yet. Correct. Bananas? I can explain. Yacht Club, I, I can't explain. I can explain. Give me time to explain. Just hold on a second. Welcome, Raiders. Uh, we're playing Street Fighter 6 World Tour. I made cure you. Oh. Thank you. Blanca! Hey, you. You okay? He's just like Donkey Kong. Okay. You got a second? Hey, Blanca. Uh, thanks for the raid. Hope you had a great stream, Yacht Club. Hey, he was! Hey, you doing? What's up? What are you guys up to? Maybe playing some some of the, the, the DLC for... Yeah, what's up? Yeah, it was good. Rad. I mean, I, yeah. <laughs> it's it's it, the, the DLC for um, Pocket Dungeon is out, right? Nice. Hell yeah. Determine the green fuzzy lump. Yeah. 
You're saying Seth Rogen's gonna play Blanc in the Street Fighter movie? Yes. They're gonna make a new Street Fighter movie. Out today. Nice! Hey, chant. Pocket Dungeon's real good. You should check it out, and it's got free DLC. It's free, I think. 50% off. The game's 50% off. Is the DLC free or is it paid? I should probably not. I'll stop shilling. Listen! God damn it, Yacht Club, you're allowed to shill. This is a safe space for Yacht Club to show how amazing their games are. It, the DLC is free. This looks like the Hulk after a lockdown. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Cozy Elf, thanks for gifting Yacht Club a sub. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoy the eating most Yacht Club. Chill away, chill away. Uh, quick question. Are you Kazuma Kiryu from the Yakuza video game? Did you run into a weird green guy just now? Wait, that wasn't Blanca? In the suit? Nani. I I I took I had him take off his shirt because he was going to Brazil. And I thought he'd be a little warm. Um, it's it's fine. That's a mirror. Gua, not nice. The name's Blanca, jungle tour guide. The weird guy you saw was he all <laughs> doing the exact like like this? Looked like me. Sounded like me. Had an electric attack. You know, doing some weird kind of dance. Any Mina the Hollywood who's working on it. Hell yeah. Uwo, Uwo, I knew it. You did see him. You saw Blanca Chan, cryptid of the jungle. Wait, so he's not the. Everyone's like, oh, Blanca, he's chill. But the one that's clearly a guy in a suit is the cryptid? Any Street Fighter lore enthusiasts in the audience? Why, why is he green and have electric powers? I mean, okay, electric powers, that's fine. Everyone has magic powers. Why is he green? Shocked by eels? Not kidding. He ate his greens. He was raised by electric eels. I think it's just because he's Brazilian. Brazilians are green, right? He's got super jaundice. That's where his abilities come from. Eels. So he, at some point, was a normal... Normal... Brazilian gentleman and and then eels he was raised by electric eels we are green can confirm I don't like Blanca <laughs> it's it, it, it seems like um, maybe something that's I don't know I don't know I don't know where this came from but it's like in Street Fighter 2 you have all these different characters from around the world right and Blanca always felt like an outlier right but they just kind of stuck him in Brazil. We're like, oh, he's from the jungle. I don't know. But I, at this point, it's just like, yep. He's just, he, this is a Brazil. Behold, a Brazilian man. It's just the, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Have you ever been to Brazil? Very average. They don't give a fuck about Plunk. <laughs> I mean, maybe it's fine. Maybe it's for the best. It's just like, don't worry about it. Look at Blanca Chan. Look at the dancing silly man. Don't think about it. It's fine. One Brazilian. You saw Blanca Chan. No. Gosh, you have no idea how lucky you were. Blanca Chan is a rare and mysterious creature, even rarer than Bigfoot. We saw Jury earlier. We gotta go online and let the world know. Get everyone buzzing about Blanca Chan and everyone will come here to see him. <laughs> I'll be there to guide tours and pretty soon the whole world will fall in love with the jungle. Ooh, whoa. What? What did I say? No lies detected, right? Blanca said, listen, you gotta respect the hustle. Is this not the custom character for Blanca? No, this is, this is, uh, well, I'm just playing as normal Kiryu. How you doing? Nelia, what are you, Blanca? Hello? Hi. Canonical Blanca, that's him. I, this is just the normal game. Erg. Blanca Chan's a sprite who protects the jungle. It's not supposed to be a person in a suit. I don't. If people start saying I'm the one in there, it's gonna blow up social media. And if the jungle blows up, that's gonna be bad for global warming. <laughs> 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 Fucking. <laughs> this game is very good. <laughs> so, like, think you can copy my moves? <laughs> I don't know about that, Blanca. Oh, bummer. 
I'll give it a shot for you. Uh, he's protecting the jungle. Who protects Blanca Chan? Who watches the Blanca Chan? Yeah, I'm gonna copy your moves. Lend me a hand, okay? Put this on and try it out. Who? I can dress up like Blanca Chan now. It's legendary. Nice. No. That's not it. Go fa- I'm so glad that coin flip came up heads. Okay. Okay. Treads right. Okay. Spin around right there. That's right. Just like that. Come on, Kiryu. Dance in the suit or Blanca has to do it again. Remember, this is canonically Kiryu inside the suit. This is the best side mission in Yakuza. Okay. You're pretty good at this. <laughs> Oh, he's so sweaty. Onsta, I'm so sorry I made him shirtless for this cutscene. Bro, I'm dying on the train. the strongest jungle sprite ever! He's doing the dance that Big the Cat does I in Sonic it. Adventure 1. I'll be here, show up whenever you're ready. I've enrolled in the Blanca Chan school. You can now use his fighting style, basic moves, unique attacks. He also learned his master action. As a reward for becoming Blanca student, new avatar skin customization options are now available. Electric Thunder. Hold a button to extend the duration. Envelop your entire body with- I am exhausted after these cutscenes. Ah, oh, envelop your body with electricity, shock your opponent, this move executes quickly, making it useful to combo into from normal moves. Rolling attack. Curl your body to a ball and fly forward with a spinning tackle useful for launching surprise attacks from far away. You can make green do. Uh, electric thunder, where is this? This really is a Yakuza side story. I, it's, fuck. I hate that it just works this well. There you- Whoa! Ooh! Oh, okay. Whoa, calm down, sir. Yeah, I got some t-shirts. I got business casual. And we- <laughs> it, They had to make it wider to fit his skeleton, and it, uh... <laughs> it's... <laughs> he, he got stung by some bees! He's just- Hey, whoa. Hey there. Hey there, how you doing? How you doing there? Oh my god. Yeah. How do I, uh... There it is. Nice. This is- Oh my fucking- I just- Too wide to be read. You can't. Fu you can't fucking read these moves. <laughs> how dare you? How? How fucking? I want to just freeze frame that fucking frame. Did I get it? Nope. I'm just gonna keep trying. Nope. It's quick. Oh, whoa. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> with the slight motion blur. Holy fuck! I, 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 I fuck it. Oh fuck! Oh my god. Oh, no, no, no. Down, boy. Down. He's just gonna take a shot on the floor. I... 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 Oh, fuck. I think I need to see... 
what he looks like without that. You give me that. Pant. Pant it up. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh, I don't. I don't know about this. <laughs> He's gone feral. Oh God, hear you. Oh, what happened, buddy? <laughs> He's up in there. He's. Uh... Does that mean I can do the? Uh... What was it? Got bit by a rabid weasel, and now every every full moon <laughs> turns into this. Uh. I just. An opening. An opening. An opening. Is he saying gay? Day. Happy Pride, everyone. Anyway, I I fucking can't with this. Are you kidding me? <sighs> Shit. There he there he is. Oh, oh there there you go. Oh boy. <laughs> Man is too wide. I can't. I fucking can't with this. The fucking MIDI on him is out of control. Depth the field. Turn that shit down. Oh wait, I don't, let me turn that shit up. There you go. Film grain. Kiryu, why is your selfie cam static? Simple blur. Just blur everything. There you go. That's a Mavali. Uh, there you go. It's good. It's great. Yeah. There you go. Just kind of <laughs> partially out of the screen. <laughs> I don't know. That's really funny. Street Fighter. It's just kind of love the old. Yeah, the old logo is great. Oh God. Graphic design is my pa oh wait can I cannot hold on hold on um uh, can I remove how do I remove how do I remove this reset how do I fucking delete a thing that I added already shit oh ooh. <laughs> welcome to Street Fighter. We have whatever the fuck this is. Uh, 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 ooh, oh. Ooh. Ooh. Rococo. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. This belongs in a museum. Have you seen this man? There. Oh, it reset removes it. I just, I just need to frame it. Okay. Lighting. Oh, it's clipping through him. He's too close. Have you seen this MIDI? Reward 1.5 million dollars. Can't wait for the thumbnail. Yeah. Right, right. Ugh. Have you seen this titty? <laughs> 1.5 million. I also have Kimberly on the shirt like, Hey, I didn't ask to be here. Wanted dead or a wide? You can't just say that. You can't just say that. I don't know about- Whoa, fuck. Uh-huh, uh-huh. The strongest fighter on the street. Where's the, uh... Yeah. All secrets revealed. 
I'm astral projecting into Kimberly. Mm, thank you, Hotstuff. There we go. I just need a. Um. I just need a. I can't. Unfortunately, I can't seem to move it enough where I can just focus on purely on the chest, but. Oh, God. oh that's very intense. Shirtless or shirted? Onsda is a sad thing. I fucking don't blame her. This is. This is a gift. I'm glad they gave us. I'm glad for two things. I'm glad that Capcom allowed us to just absolutely fuck up this character creator beyond recognition. And I'm glad they let us take selfies with it. Because holy shit. Spider-Man Pizza. Remember Spider-Man Pizza, right? Anyway. Um. Hey, how you doing? Hey. So keep this on the down low, but we're making some marketable plushies. You interested? We have way too many of these in stock. Just take it, please. A cute stuffed doll version of a certain mysterious jungle sprite. It goes uwo uwo when you squeeze its tummy. Uh, does Capcom have a, a merch store? Capcom, Blanca Chan, plushie. Um, it seems as if uh, there's a store called World 8. I don't know if these are official. Let me see. Blanca Scoots from whatever. Officially licensed by Capcom. Yeah. They have marketable plushies for $25. I don't know if they say ooh, ooh, ooh when you squeeze their tummy. Probably not. And also, this seems to be a member of the development team for Street Fighter V. Absolutely having a time. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. It definitely siphons your life. Well, how do you think it charges its electric attacks? There he is. So, God damn it, Capcom. Want this cutest form ever. This plush is crafted by Stubbins with high quality and lightly weighted material, making it perfect to sit beside you on flat surfaces or desktops. Official line of plush. Official license plush, standing at approximately six inches. This offers you a new way to show off your favorite gaming characters. So it's a brand called Stubbins that is sold by World 8. Okay. Oh, I... I... Mm, I made a discovery about this website. So you know, you know how, like, when you go over here and you're like, oh, it zooms in. Sure, great. Um, here's what happens with the Blanca Chan plush. It, uh, it, 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 it layers it, and it's a PNG, so... Uh, <laughs> here he is. Mm -hmm. Ooh, whoa. Ooh, whoa. It's, uh, it's definitely a feature and not a bug of it being a PNG. And also, it's great news to know that this is just a PNG. So, um... Anyone who wants a PNG or Blanca Chan, they... <laughs> oh, shit. Right. Good. You can take them anywhere. Right. If you get the plush, you can take them anywhere physically. But if you download the PNG, you can take them anywhere digitally. Anyway, uh, thanks, Capcom, for this. Um, I can fight him. Uh, I can get jellied eel if I give him a Blanca style. Luxury heat pack to be with gear equipped in every slot. Hit with eight unique attacks. I don't know about any of that, but, um, let's fight. Oh my god. Oh, he's... He's a spicy boy. No, sir. No. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. No. No! Get him with the tiny leg! Like a dog peeing at a fire hydrant. He's gonna fucking get me. There we go. 
Fuck. Get him. Get him. Ooh, I got him. Ooh. I got a jelly bean. Chopped eels in congealed jelly, commonly flavored with herbs and eaten with vinegar. Someone might like this. Is Blanca gonna like it or fucking hate me if I give him eels? A kind-hearted defender of nature, Blanca has become an adventure tour guide, confident in int confident his intimate knowledge of the jungle will serve as a springboard to fame and a comfortable life for his beloved mother. Fighting style, feral movement slash electric attacks. Moves with feral unpredictability learned through a life in the jungle and unleashes debilitating jolts of electricity. He's doing swimmies. Hey, buddy, you want some, you want some eels? Maybe give him the fish? Everyone was like eels. This whole thing is eels. So I feel like... Why do you like the eels? He has a mom. Momka. Is she also green? Was she raised by eels as well? I'm gonna give him the eels. This is for me. You're a really nice person. I'll take good care of it. Oh, good. Everyone crazy with the promotions, but I just did a dumpy guy with a sexy baby face. Listen, there's no wrong way to make a character in this game, as far as I'm concerned. He liked it. You said you want to get stronger, right? The jungle taught me to be as strong and wild as nature itself. And now I'm going to teach you. He received the Blanca Roar emote. You can set it by the settings app in your it's phone. Uh, yes, please. I have to... He's now more likely to pose. Good. Great. Um... Uh, uh, Blanca Roar. Roar just like Blanca. Unleash your wild side and conjure a mighty roar from the pit of your stomach. That's great. Um, I can do electric thunder. Can be used to cause electric machinery to malfunction. Oh, good. Um, that's fine. Let's, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you doing there, bud? Let me zoom out a bit. Um, oh, oh, didn't, that's upsetting. If you click on the right stick, it resets it, which is just very rapid. Uh, whoa, yeah. Well, that seems to be his one and only pose he doesn't want to get out of. But she's having a great time back there. I met Blanca, it, oh, looks like she's kicking my head, lol. Great. Is he wide cure you? Um, you can just say cure you. You don't have to say wide. That's a really, really big bird back there. Um. Like. Like. Like, just. That bird is the size of that woman. And also, they just let you get the camera over there. Extra wide. No, just standard wide. Watermelon. Anyway, um, in the tree. Hmm? Hmm? In the tree. In the tree? What are you? What's in the tree? Oh, back there. There's a bunch. There's selling a bunch of Blanca chance back there. There he is. Gear you wide, dry. Oh, there's another. There's like a toucan up there. And another one up there. Wow. This game's really got it all, huh? Nice. Thank you, Dave. Uh, let's go to Jamaica. It's a rat like some bandages. The winner is unanimous. I'm quicker than the flashes from the lights on the cameras. Oh, you the best. What a big cap cap. I can take you standing on my back. Don't listen to the chatter or any of the commotion. Where you're going, you're going, you're going, you're going. Jamaica, Bahama. Come on, Kamu Rocho. <clears throat> God, he just blends right in. Oh, nice. 
side, but now we're going to turn up the heat. He looks very lost. Do I see a frown out there? <laughs> nope, he didn't think so. Oh, that right. face was very good. You ready? ready Just a little bit of concern. It's Friday night, everybody. <laughs> Sup, ice cold quick. Cole, how you doing? Welcome back. Hey! What's wrong? Something on your mind? Bringing frowns to a beautiful beach like this just doesn't make sense, my friend. Wow. <clears throat> uh, hush! Didn't realize that's how you always look. <laughs> anyway, what you want to bring to any beach is three things, body, soul, and music. <laughs> Forget everything else, leave your worries behind, and get that body moving. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Do, 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 do. Just pretend it's a discotheque, Kirian. You didn't come here to dance, but to get stronger. Why didn't you say so? Head over there and let's get this show on the road. <laughs> You're about to get a dance lesson from the legendary DJ himself. I've gone feral. <clears throat> no. Shit. Shit. It's working? Never mind. and <laughs> magical. Damn. I can't help but fucking do that. Whoa, nice. I did a thing. Oh. No, 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 no. No! Did a little better round two. He's got the moves. Got such a glow up in this. Yeah. So what'd you think? Starting to realize that fighting and dancing are one and the same. Uh. The heart moves the body. And the rhythm gives birth to the beat. And from where I'm standing, it's all art. Yeah, 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 yeah. You had some serious rhythm going there. Enjoy that sweet, sweet beach sunset, friend. You've earned it. Hey, thanks. Oh, God. I am weak. And that there's an idle animation for when you're low on health, apparently. Oh. Yo. What can I help you with, Mon? I want to be a student. Mm -hmm. Oh. I don't want to tell you to give you up on your dreams, but this is one tall order you're requesting, Mon. Yo, Everyone wants to be a superstar, but actually becoming one is another story. Please. Okay. Your passion is too hot to handle, Mon. We'll give you an audition. Is it Friday night? No, it's Friday night. Hey, hey, my name DJ. Brought a mic every weekday since week. K with star. If you a dreamer, I'm a believer. Just keep it rocking and don't stop until your feet hurt. Do it. Uh. My name is Kiryu. Move your body. It rhymes Come with Kiryu. Let me see it. Uh, no, no, no. Come <laughs> on, yo. Where's the heat? You got to feel the rhythm. You got to feel the rhythm down to the floor. DJ taught Kiryu how to dance before Yakuza Zero. Keep it with that summertime feel. Heat up this stratosphere. Give them your full spec love. Make sure they know you're here. Oh, yeah. Now you got it. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay. 
He's having fun! Sorry about that. I thought you were talking music. You meant fighting. Yes. Then you should have said so. From this day forward, you're the main monet DJ's fighting academy. <laughs> Come on. Ask me anything your heart desires. There's plenty of skill to go around, my mon. They became DJ's student. You can now use his fighting style. Air Slasher. Produce a forward movement shockwave with a high speed uppercut used for checking opponents at range. A rolling sabat. Unleash fear spinning kick while moving forward. Best use so that the tip of the foot connects with the opponent. Depending on the strength of the button used, this move can be used as a feint or to perform two kicks in a row. Mm -hmm. Update Air Slasher. Hey, Brian. What? A souvenir? You got memories of your time here, don't you? Isn't that enough? Well, if you're just dying to find something, you can start by dancing with me. Let's dance. Oh, I'm still in Blanca mode. Oh, God. Ma'am? Is this how you dance? Ow. Fuck. I died. Shit. She's tall. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm wide. So, we're an even match. Mm, it's not bad for DJ style. So, it's quarter circle kick. Oh. Oh. Gotcha. So, the light is a feint. So, you can combo that into things? Oh. So, you can bait out. Oh, that's sneaky. And that's twice. Gotcha. And then it was, uh, it was a back. For the little air, air flash. There you go. Come on. Oh, and this one's Come also on. a faint. Oh. Shit. A lot of faints with DJ. That's not really, I, I'm not nearly at a place where I can get into the mind games, but. That's cool. <laughs> All right, let's go again. Fight me again. This time I'm at full HP. Let's go. What? Now then. He can face a lot of his specials. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's neat. Very different style. Hey, Nana. Ma'am, 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 please. Uh, shit. She's beefy. Okay, all right, hold on. I don't know how to do all these combos you're doing. Fuck. Damn it. Stop doing your flips. Shit. I did not mean to waste the continue on that performance. Yeah. No, no. Okay, thank God. If I wasted a continue and didn't win, that'd be pretty bad. You don't disappoint. The sculpture, it's just a local handicraft. That's very good. It's Flat Fuck Tuesday. A traditional wood carving said to have the power to grant wishes. Appearance won't win over everyone. We can really feel the craftsmanship. <laughs> DJ. Hello. Bless up, Mon. I've been looking forward to this. It's time to teach you a crazy new super. Hope you made sure to press record. Great so bad. Remain in place and put your whole body into a single spinning kick. He executes quickly, making useful in combos and as a counter. Thanks. <laughs> Maybe on. I turned my music into a business, but I didn't do it alone. My manager, Rick, he was a lifesaver. Always helps to have a main man. You said yeah. it, Mon. We're practically joined at the hip. When you're fighting one-on-one, -on -one, the only person you can count on is yourself. Artists are no different. The only beat we march to is the beat of our souls. <laughs> but having friends to rely on elsewhere? That's a true godsend, Mon. What about you, my Mon? Uh. All right. Good talk, Yo, Kiryu. We went from vinyl to CDs, CDs to streaming. 
But the soul of music hasn't changed one bit, man. No way it can change. In the yeah. end, it's all about performers and an audience meeting heart to heart. Hey. Same as it's been since the caveman times, I bet. Get with it, emote. Get with it. Ooh, yeah. Also cassettes. Yeah, you know. You know, people call me the tropical comet. But everybody says you're a rising star yourself. Wow. Listen, though, when you start walking the road of a fighter, you gotta be in it for the long haul. Stick with me, and you're gonna go far. He's now more likely to pose in photo mode. What? Yep. Eh, 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 eh. No one's posing. Literally, no one is po. There he goes. Oh. What? What's his other pose where he disappears? What is he doing? Where is he going? Uh, uh oh. You got it. Shit. He's so fucking wide. Sir? He do- He doesn't seem to- Oh! It's just his instant transmission. Why is it so rare? What? Okay. Fine, what if- Maybe I don't want to see it. But that guy's doing- is it based on proximity? Oh, shit. Are you gonna... What the fuck? Why is this so weird and unreliable? I just want to see... Oh, there, there he is. Was that so hard, DJ? Apparently so. <laughs> He's literally ducking. To the world, man. Back to Metro. I had cabbages. They went down to babbages. India. Can't go there yet. Stop pressing the vote button. Never. I hope we get to meet Mayor Mike Hager. That'd be pretty cool. Turn back to Luke. That's so far. Stretchy cure you. Yeah, I want that. Mirror babbages. Here I come, rougher than the rest of them. My name is Knuckles. I like cabbages. Heading down to Babbages. It's me, Knuckles. Should probably put on some shoes. But you know. Hagger's in the game. Oh, just statues of them. My stream died. Oh no, John. He's just standing there, zoning out. What's up? Hey. <laughs> How you doing, Luke? Thanks. Brought me back a souvenir? Ah, oh, shucks. You shouldn't have. Yeah, well, can I have it back, though? This is awesome. I want them both back. What the heck is this? It's awesome. Honestly, I love the weird souvenirs like this the most. The zanier, the better. A while back, I went to Kyoto and ended up buying some shurikens and a wooden sword. Now then. I'm rambling, though. There's another souvenir I've been looking forward to. <laughs> the souvenir of seeing just how much my student has improved during his trip. Oh, I've barely used DJ style. Finally! Drive impacts. A powerful attack can be used to nullify an opponent's attack and throw them off balance. It can also be used to break through their guard if it connects while their back is to a wall. Use L1 and R1. L1 or R1 and R2 simultaneously. It consumes drive gauge and we also use to turn the tide of favorite battle in your favor. Right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh shit. No, he fucking got me. No, stop it. I'm rebuilding my meter. Stop it. God damn it. Stop it. Leave me alone. Stop it. I'm burnt out. Leave me alone. And time in. Fucking God. Thank you. Drive parries. They delayed it. They haven't got. Technically new to this game. Uh, the drive parry is the ultimate defensive maneuver that can deflect any and all attacks. It consumes drive gauge for as long as you hold the command used to perform it. It's either L2 or triangle and circle. As a more refined form of this technique, performing a successful parry the moment an attack hits will result in a perfect parry, which does not consume gauge. 
It allows you to move before your opponents. Once you get the hang of all the controls, start aiming for perfect parries. Hit me. That was the wrong button. L2 was... Yeah. Oh! Was that perfect? Seemed pretty good. They some bits. Fight Luke. All right. Overdrive. Special moves can be enhanced by consuming drive gauge when performed this way. They're called overdrive moves. Someone says you press two buttons of the same type when inputting the command for a move. Overdrive affects each move differently. Some do more hits. Others may change the move's behavior dramatically. Your body will glow orange when you do it right. While performing a drive parry, input the direction towards your opponent twice to perform a drive rush. Quickly closing the distance between you. Performing this during attacks allows for combos that would otherwise be impossible. While blocking or performing a drive parry, input the direction toward your opponent alongside the command for a drive impact to perform a counterattack that pushes your opponent back. Gotcha. Right there. Ow, oh, god damn it. Stop it. Fuck. Jesus Christ. Bro. Ah. I forgot what DJ's special moves are. A big paint nice. splash and slowdown. Gotcha. You're killing it, Kazuma Kiryu. Seriously, your moves are looking incredibly clean. Does it feel real to you? You know how much you're improving? Ugh. Ugh. Hey. In that case, it might be worth thinking about putting your skills to the test. They just finished building a new stadium in the city and they're planning to hold a fighting tournament there. In fact, there's even a tournament for fresh face fighters scheduled in the lead up to the main event. <laughs> How about it, Kazuma Kiryu? Think you might want to enter? He can't reach his head. His, his arms are too wide. Oh, no, Sharper, I'm sorry. I'll do it soon. Bet you have a good shot at the bracket. Uh, nani? Moving on. Just head to the stadium and see if you can't find some info about the event. You can take the subway here all the way to the station by the stadium. The train is now departing. And hey, no pressure. Just head over there and have some fun with it. <laughs> You're my student, after all. I'm sure you'll manage. This prepaid car can thought, be thought of as a permit of sorts for access to the extremely unsafe Metro City subway system. It's extremely unsafe. You now play Hot O' Pizza on a new difficulty setting. Let's go. Let's go. I guess. Oh, yeah, about Bosch. Oh, uh, one of my connections had some intel on his kidnapper. Sounds like it was a woman contracted by some kind of criminal organization. Wild to think that Bosch ended up butting heads with the underworld like this. It's one hell of a situation, that's for sure. Uh, oh, okay. Right. Extremely unsafe. Not just regular unsafe. This man's forearms are terrifying. I know. When he's standing next to this and you're like, whoa, hey, calm down. That's how you know. Uh, just out of curiosity, I wanted to see if, um, back to the square. What? They said there was new stuff in the stores, and damn it, just need to see what they got in there. Can't wait to see all, yeah, everyone's OCs. Uh, whoa, whoa, okay. No, none of this screams cure you to me, but having more options is good. I'm just, I'm really hoping that there's a suit that we can customize all the way. Also, if I could preview with the custom, you can buy multiple. Why would you buy multiple? Shoes is probably good, but you know, it's fine. Don't worry about that later. Please come again. Come, come again. Anyway, this game's rad. Woo. Please buy a skirt. I might. I just might. Ah. Shit. Hmm. Autism Dragon gifted a sub to Afterglow Ampharos. And that was their hundredth gifted sub. Thank you very much. Dying different color. I guess, yeah. Make an entire ensemble. Tria Cosmic Garden. Thanks for 49 months. That's many. Uh, Strawberry Mango. Thanks for 38. 
Barry, I mean Puppet Father, Father of the Puppets. Welcome back to the land of the parasocial instead of the social. Mr. Streams, I went to a con this weekend and dressed up as Tears of the Kingdom Zelda and purple dress Tifa. I'd share a pic of the Zelda if you want, or just in Discord if not. Uh, if you are still around, then yeah. Go ahead. If you need a, a, a permit. And you said you were conking out soon. Uh, Soko Scene Cami. Maybe, maybe we'll, maybe we'll come back to this on stream. Um, Lonely Wheel. Uh, yeah, but, 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 soup bits. Kiryu's body looks more like Johnny Bravo's. Ah, oh, that's very good. Very good cosplay. I really like the design of the, the Tears of the Kingdom Zelda. And you killed it. Hope it was a good con. Hope it was a good, fun time. Uh, Ilks, thanks for 50 bits. The strength to protect Riku. Mr. Tensei, thanks for 34 months. Is this the fight between Bath and Nicole and Robert Frost's estate? Yes. Hope you had a good GDQ. Yeah, I was gonna roll my character as Robert Frost, but they don't let you make them see through yet. Um, what was the play more? Thank you. High Caliber Cookie, thanks for seven months. Play game. I did, eventually. Wirethan, thanks for 38. Not a werewolf, thanks for eight months. And the, uh, Big Cave Monster, thanks for 69 bits. What's with all these boxers? Retro Candle, thanks for 65. That's almost as many as 64. Shaw Mango, thanks for 34 bits. Marissa has bare feet, too. Capcom knows what they're doing. Smash Man, thanks for 96 bits. When did Kiryu turn into Catgirl Senator Armstrong? I just realized that Marissa's hair is shaped like a helmet. I think that's awesome. Yeah, it's real good. Uh, good night. Thanks for hanging. Yacht Club, thanks again for the raid. Congrats on the DLC launch for Pocket Dungeon. Kurt, thanks for 100 bits. Oh, yeah, baby. I came home and we have the cat ears. I mean, you know we gotta. Cozy Allison, thanks again for gifting Yacht Club a sub. Strawberry Mango, thanks for 10 bits. I just found that Halsey and BTS member Suga made an OST for Diablo 4. Whoa. That is wild. Black Cat Bar, thanks for 53 months. Bar Pride! Cave, thanks for 69 bits. Blanca wasn't raised by eels when the plane he was in crashed as a little boy or baby. He was exposed to electric eels, and it triggered a mutation in him that gave him electric powers because Capcom. I like that... If it's something that's true, I like the idea that he crash landed in a pool of eels and they zapped him into having electric powers and the community has just collectively said, yeah, he was raised by eels. Like that's, that's how, like everyone's right, <laughs> basically. Venus Varnas, thank you for the dollar do. Ice cold cloaca call, thanks for 11 months. Barry, why are you frowning? Uh. Cobalt XP, thanks for 14 months. Kiryu do be looking swole though. He works out. The Smash Man, thanks for nerbits. Happy 30th anniversary to Zelda Link's Awakening. It was my first Zelda game, technically the DX Game Boy Color version. It still counts, absolutely. Oxyb, thanks for 10. That wide man is dripping style. He is dripping and he's wide. And what else do you need? Uh, I'm gonna wrap up stream and we're gonna go raid someone. But uh, holy shit. I mean, I enjoy the demo, but damn, it's good. This is a good game. I'm very much having fun. And uh, I am, I, I, we'll see how I feel about coming back to it soon. We'll see. Or maybe I'll just play it off stream. I don't. I mean, God, I don't need more games to play off stream. So maybe I'll just play it on stream because I want to play more of it. We'll see. Bath is streaming. Shit. Is Bath streaming? Where the? Why is Bath so far down my list? Twitch, what are you doing? Bath is streaming. Faz. Let's raid Bath. I mean, come on. I mean, come on. I'm gonna raid Bath. At yeah, I'll be at Evo. I'll I'll, I'll be at Evo and I'll be in the crowd going woo. Yeah, woo. Can we get a yeah, woo, yeah raid? Um, here's what, here's what I'm asking. If you join for the raid. Cammy's pants demand you keep playing. Calm down. Uh, the raid message is either yeah or woo or any combination of yeah and woo and woo, yeah, yeah, woo. Poonam Panda. Thank you for the raid. We're just wrapping up, unfortunately. Hope you had a good stream. We're gonna go be raiding me, fiance, bath. Was doing some phasmophobia. I hope you had a good stream, though. Ooh, whoa, yeah, woo. That works, too. Nice, glad to hear it. Yeah, woo, yeah, woo, 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 yeah, woo. Yeah, woo. But, uh, this, this is a good game. It's fun. Street Fighter. Who knew? Who knew I would have fun playing Street Fighter? I mean, it's fun. I just... I don't know. I feel like I'm the target audience for them being like, hey, we want to expand Street Fighter and make it more accessible. And I'm like, that's me, apparently. Apparently, that's me. I didn't know. Because I remember when Street Fighter 4 was announced, and that was a big deal. It was the first one in a long time, and the art style was, you know, it was 3D, and they had the paint stuff going on. And it was like, whoa, this looks rad. I never played it. Maybe, maybe touched it once. So, 
I don't know. Apparently, this is what I needed. It's great. SGDQ, thank you. It was a lot of fun. Fiance. I don't know. I don't. I forget which how many E's it's supposed to be. But it's fine. Super sure. Anyway, goodbye. Thanks for hanging out. See you later. See you later. Goodbye. Goodbye. Get your bit. Okay, see you later. Goodbye. Uh, VOD watchers, thanks for VOD watching. Hope you enjoyed Street Fighter VI. Uh, the, the, the wide Kiryu edition. Um, maybe we'll come back to it. Maybe not. Regardless, I hope you enjoyed the VOD. Thanks for watching. See you. Goodbye. Make sure you watch Bath and Nicole's GDQ run and their interview slash prize segment. Hopefully I remember to put those in the YouTube description. I might forget. Goodbye!